Good morning! Bonjour, 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 chérie. We've just been talking about like days of old, reminiscing, reminiscing. That's how long we have all been here. Well, I say that. <laughs> I say that we've also... Oh, this is a treat because it's my first official show. Is that right? We're to say with the lovely Charlie, everybody. Yay! There she is. Morning. How are you doing, darling? Oh, I'm great, thank you. How are you? I'm all right. We've just bom bombarded you with memories, haven't we? Oh, yeah, but it's great. I like the stories. That's it's all good. I know. Lots of, yeah, there's lots some of funny stories. Ones. Yeah, <laughs> there certainly is. There is some funny stories. Yeah. We were talking about how... Okay. This is on in honour of you, apparently. Is it? There you go. Is that, is that my theme tune? Got... <laughs> Could be worse. Go. <laughs> I'm glad <laughs> it's not. Dun dun dun. No, definitely, <laughs> definitely not that. Definitely, definitely not. Oh, Charlie, it's lovely to have you with us. Oh, it's lovely to be here. It's raining. It's cold oh, outside, I but know. it's nice and warm. I know. It's and such a good, good day to be here. Isn't yeah, it? It's definitely. always a good day at JM. Yeah, it always. Is. There, there's, see, there's perks to not having any daylight in the studio. Yeah, when you, you don't see horrible days like today. <laughs> yeah, You're just yeah. literally in the sunshine that is the jewelry oh, maker studio. It's lovely. Outside does nothing for your hair, does it? No. It's just stuck to your head, you know. And we're running in with the hoods on. It's not a cute look, it's but we get it. Yeah. As my dad used to describe it, it's proper wet rain. Yeah. There's rain and then there's yeah. wet rain. Side rain. Yeah. yeah. It's not good. Now, will you pull that kind of face? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I, know, I know. It's exactly. We all know, don't we? We all know what we're talking about. I think we've all got it's it today. Going to be an amazing Thursday. Yes. Um, I have to say, and I've seen your your VT as well. Oh. <laughs> You were just saying how many times we played it. <laughs> um, your VT for your projects today, absolutely mm. beautiful. But to see the jewellery, you know, oh, in person. They're so beautiful and they're very well made, very well made. So they were lovely to work with. So if you are thinking of uh, venturing into uh, the wonderful specialism that is gemstone setting, yes. would you say your projects are ideal? The afternoon one is definitely a good one to start with. Yeah. And then nine o'clock is a good one to get get uh to find your feet with it yeah um and it's it sounds terrible because they are absolutely beautiful but they're really good practice pieces because there's six of the same five or six of the same stones yeah so you'll find your feet with the first two and yeah. then everything after that is really easy amazing yeah. love it and look at the finished results oh i know they're stunning that's I, professional I really jewelry it is it is i mean i i really can't take any credit for it really because well, they can. are stunning you set them well, I, I there you go them. take I the credit take. Take. Oh, I'll take it i'll take it <laughs> take the credit <laughs> thank you very much. and then it is it's finished professional jewelry oh yes definitely you know yeah to, definitely um so if you've never done gem setting before nine o'clock and also 12 o'clock and remember as well Charlie's uh, um, demonstration comes and projects rather um, come with yes. uh, written instructions as well mm, so that's yes fantastic. they do are you eyeing up the opals I know they're amazing oh, they're aren't they lovely I was like oh look at them and I, I, I went gravitated towards that one Ross as well um, beautiful, and you've got tanzanite, I think I saw. Yes. Peridot. Yes. Um, I wasn't sure about this one. I'm not sure. I've lost Is that colour. maybe a mixed? Is that... Oh, I'm going to say sapphires. Let's have a little look. Yeah, I'm tourmaline. Not sure. Ooh, tourmaline. Nice. So you have tourmaline, peridot, tanzanite, mm. Sleeping Beauty turquoise. Yes, I'm going to demo with that one. And we've also got those beautiful opals as well. Yes. So how amazing are they? Look at the colour. Oh, I know, I full know. of play of colour. Our opal is exceptional. Very. And we haven't seen a great deal of opal lately, have we actually? Not That's just registered as I was saying it. We haven't seen a great deal of Ethiopia or any opal for that, for that matter. Um, also in today's show, Jewellery Makers, your deal of the day, we've had a little swaparoo. The schedules had to change slightly. So basically your deal of the day that was originally planned for tomorrow is now today's deal of the day you know people's diaries get full and especially when you're in demand like our lovely Dave um, so what about you well you're in demand as well you are in demand Ross yeah um, <laughs> but yeah so Dave is joining us at 10 o'clock today to bring you tomorrow's deal of the day today does that make sense yeah um, so a little bit of a swaparoo I, I tell you what though Oh, it's, I'm so glad because I would have missed out on this otherwise. These are stunning, absolutely stunning. Now we know the pedigree, the prestige of your South Sea Pearl, 
Likewise with the beautiful pink tartar oyster, this, or the golden lip, sorry, this is hand carved from the gold lip oyster. Oh, just stunning. The mind boggles, doesn't it? They're absolutely stunning, stunning pink. So beautiful. So you can see you've got the flowers, we've got um, that lovely oval pendant here with some amazing sterling silver work. Oh my goodness, how amazing yeah, is that? Yeah. Just full of colours. Um, you've got another one just, oh that's the flower. Then there's the butterfly, there, that's what I was yeah. searching for. Is that not, I agree, is that not one of the most designer pieces you can imagine? It's absolutely beautiful. If that was in like a PowerPoint with Sotheby's written across it and it oh, said, yeah. you know, tens of thousands, you wouldn't bat an eyelid, would oh, you? Oh no, definitely No, not. totally not. And look at the amount of sterling silver that's invested in this as well. Um, and again, imagine that literally on the front of your decolletage because oh, it's no. big as well. If I hold it, this is not a small piece by any stretch oh. of the imagination. So imagine that secured that's to fair. some of your chains. It is a bit Levian. It's a bit Levian. Um bit Levian and a little bit Tiffany's as well. You Ooh, know, yeah. you know, the chrysanthemum. It's a little bit like I know it's not a chrysanthemum, I know it's a butterfly, but the movement, I mean there. It looks but sterling. Very, very it? designer. Again, all that sterling silver. You've got the beautiful you've got jump rings just here for you to attach to your chain, but look at that investment of precious metal. And of course, amazing topaz set down the center so this is coming up these i should say um, are coming up at 10 o'clock now with dave who's joining us in the studio so it's going to be an absolute super a super super thursday we've got a selection of your nan hong as well which is totally natural i'm going to say it stick my neck out that's the best lang hong i've ever seen do you agree um the most translucent nan hong not opaque it's totally natural um, Nan Hong, often referred to as the darling of all your agates, carved in the same way that Jadeite is, um, and of course mined in China as well. It, 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 it's an incredible, it's, it's an investment stone ordinarily. However, today we're going to change that. Um, and your early bird are these fantastic toggle extenders. Who knew that we needed them up until today? I, I like, know, now what I've a seen great them. idea. It is Aren't a great idea. Yeah. Just going to drop your necklace down or shorten it, whichever you wish. Um, how amazing are they? And they're in this hour now. So if you have a little look at the website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com, um, and look to the right and click uh, watch live, then scroll down and you'll see all the items that are listed in this hour. But remember, um, they're only available for this hour so you do need to check them out you can add and combine to your order as the day goes on that's not a problem with one postage and packaging here's just a little selection of some of the goodies that we've got coming up i can see y guardians malachite type a jadeite chains by the meter length um some lovely sterling silver components shari oh there's some beautiful goodies in there yeah, um is. shall we start then should we get cracking jewelry makers as always drop us a message we'd love to hear from you this morning Shall we start with something that's very Charlie, actually? Mm. Very you. You always make me squirm. <laughs> Here you go, Charlie. A parcel of beautiful, a beautiful topaz. Is that clear and blue? And pink. Oh, wow. You've got pink topaz in here. Imperial, oh. most, the rarest. You've got sky blue, Swiss blue topaz and white all in there ah oh, so the pinks are your imperial and you've got them in a selection of your cuts there as well princess round brilliant cut you've got some um oh. trillions just here as well <gasps> is that actually the price that is actually the price you need to be quick if you want to get these i was gonna say i snuck my phone <laughs> in and now i don't know where i put it oh no quick find the phone charlie yeah. da, 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 it's, it's a burned it's a burned ross I almost made myself cough then. Burned. It's burned. It's burned. Pet, 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 pet. <laughs> he likes to start every show with his little cheeky one pound. It's not always possible, but today it is. And you get the box. I mean, for the box on its own. For a pound. Sorry, I'm going all squeaky and excitable. I'm, I'm afraid to say they've sold out. I sorry. Charlie. It's not even loaded yet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Ugh. Wasted. I have some love. You have to be. You have to. Right. There we go. I am that's a lesson. Too slow. That's a lesson to be learnt. 
Always have your phone <laughs> ready. I thought I was ready, especially, but no. Especially when Roscoe starts the day. Thanks, Ross. You know, um, <laughs> how about some beautiful shell pearl in your cones? Um, yeah, he's a, he's a bit of a menace first thing in the morning. Yeah, is that I've noticed. Yeah. <laughs> Um, they're lovely, aren't they? They Amazing are lovely. They're very cute. Very cute, and through drilled as well. Which, if you like, if you are somebody like me that's not that great at wrap loops, they never look the same. My wrap loops, um, and this doesn't need a wrap loop, does it? Not Just really. No. Head pin through the centre. Yep. Where you go? They've got a lovely soft lustre to them, hasn't they? Nice. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Love bit of shell pearl. Very robust yeah. as well. Um, guess what? They've sold out. Well done. Well done. Well done. <laughs> uh, shall we do a bundle? Got it. Yeah, got it. This is pretty. Mm. This is pretty. <clears throat> like this. Again, Marla's stretchy bracelets with your spacers. We've brought you some lovely spacers lately. Um, this is your white agate and also labradorite, but it's got that lovely iridescent coating as well. Super sparkly from here. Pretty, isn't mm, it? Very. And they're pound as well. They are pound. They are pound. Well done to those who managed to get hold of that. That's 50p per strand. What? Bonkers. What, what, what? Um, should we do some storage? Yeah, there's a nice plethora of goodies in the... Uh, sorry, the desk slid then. Speedy this morning, isn't it? Pew, pew, pew. Off it goes. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Self falls off the chair. <laughs> See me pancaked on the floor. <laughs> So, 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 speaking of pancakes, I don't know why I've got my, um, images of those two women. The woman that's going through the window. Have you not seen that video? No. It's gone viral. It's hilarious. <laughs> well, she does. Uh, a certain part of her body gets kind of sandwiched between herself and the window. Oh. Um, and she's going to stock there upside down. Have you not seen I'm this not, video? I'm so, I'm so not oh, in the tech world. I'm, I'm right. She's kind of, You're she gonna gets have to locked show out of the house, basically. So her friend like pushes her through the front of her window and she's wearing like a it's in the summer clearly she's wearing like a, a maxi bandeau dress right so as she goes through her dress gets pulled down she's literally upside down <laughs> upside down with just her boobs smushed against the window <laughs> it's so funny i was like so and i would do that that's oh, the that's kind of thing great. that that is an L thing to do. Anyway, back to back to um, <laughs> back to your storage. Now you've had that little story. Lots of our jewelry maker audience are googling now. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, it's I'm hilarious. Open. It's absolutely hilarious. Um, you need your storage, don't you, to keep yourself oh, organised? Oh gosh, yeah, I love that type. Yeah, I love that type. You've got the little flippy lids. Very cute. There you go. Huh? They lock into place and they can stack on yes. top of one another. Um, plus you've got the colours, but also still perspex, so you can see inside. All three, $14.99. That's amazing. Can I also put this one out there? They'd be great for lunch boxes. Yeah, yeah. snack boxes. Yeah. Yeah, a few little snack boxes. Because yeah. sometimes the lids fall off your, oh, yeah. your Tupperware, don't yeah. they? Yeah. Whereas they won't with these. So great, uh, an ideal lunch box size. Mm, yeah. I might have to get some of these. Uh, $14.99. Have we got quantity, Roscoe? 100 available, but there's a purple clock right there. So that tells me that we're going even lower. Oh yeah, you could, uh, this, this, this is the, like, this. here's me thinking Sarnies. Adam's going, oh, you could have your rice salad in one. You could have, what, your hummus in the other? What do you reckon, Adam? A bit of hummus and a bit of avocado slices with your chili flakes. There, yeah, that's the difference, by the way, between Adam and I. Um, I put screws in them. <laughs> there you go. There you go. So we're all totally there different. There you go. I'm just thinking about your jam sandwiches. He's thinking about his hummus. <laughs> Charlie's like, no, they're perfect for my screws. Yeah. Um, we're going even lower. We've got quantity of them. Colour coordinated as well. So if you, you might Yeah, have. that's handy. Yeah. Yeah. But you can still see See them. through, yeah. Because if these were coloured, you wouldn't be able to see, in, see inside. No, you'd have to label them, wouldn't yeah. you? I would. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Uh, and that's just a bit of a faff. Oh, yeah. Um, and a faff that's not needed when they're perspex, or clear, rather. How about the set three? Nine pounds and 99 pence only. Not bad, not bad. That's not bad, like is that. it? Yeah. And we've got a big quantity as well. The boys in the gallery are saying they like a faff. 
What, you like faffing around? <laughs> oh, you would infuriate me. I tell you what, if we live <laughs> together, you would infuriate I, like, Don't dawdle, get it done. Yeah, oh yeah. I'm a get it done type, yes. type person. Yeah, get the kids out of the way, the yeah. husband out of the way, and yeah. just, yeah. Get it done. Yeah. I bet you they're the type that, that, that when they're running a bath, they sit on the edge just to swish it. Oh yeah, probably. Just yeah. to swish it instead of putting something away. You are. Stuff like that. No, <laughs> yeah, I tend to next, wipe around. I'm then. swishing my bath. <laughs> that, I bet you're those types, aren't you? When you're running a bath, you sit next to it just to swish it, rather than getting some stuff done. You sit in it. Oh, and it oh, feels really? around you. Okay, well, that's fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Funny games, eh? We're going lower. We're going even lower. We've got a big quantity of them, jewellery makers. Or you could be nicely organised, like our Mark. When I oh. see Mark's VTs, how organised it Workshop is behind him. Workshop envy when you see his VTs. I know. I know. He knows where everything is, doesn't he? Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, not like me, way. trying to find a single head pin and you're at the bottom of your bag. <laughs> £7.99 pence only to get hold of these. Again, they are robust. I, I don't want to take them off because they're all sealed, but you can see nice solid, solid storage containment. Mm. They're not going to distort. Um, i tell you what, says Roscoe. How about, no faff in here. How about the set of three for under a fiver today? How about that? Brilliant. I'll and you haven't got three. to pay more postage. Oh, yes, of course, that's a great Because they're quite one, bulky, it? still the same price, post and packaging all day. They have said it out loud now. We've got USA getting involved. Hello, Gigi, nice to see you. In California, you've got wow. Georgina, London, Leslie, Lynn, Susan and Brian, Jacqueline, Paula, Aisha, hello to you, Barbara, Andrea, Rachel, Merv at in Shropshire and Dawn in Lancashire. Text in, come and say hello, don't be shy. We'd love to hear from you this morning. Got any plans this weekend, everybody? Not really. No? No, not really. What about, what are you doing? You're with me, aren't you, tomorrow? Yeah, we're on air tomorrow, because we've got, we're in in the afternoon, extended oh, hours on Jewelry Maker. yes. Yeah. Yeah, so Elle's in with Dan. Um, we're going to, I don't know who's producing, is it Wayne? Is it Wayne? Oh, right, okay, I'll prepare, I'll prepare <laughs> Tom that I'll need a little lie down <laughs> afterwards then. Um, <laughs> not with Wayne, I could not prepare Tom. <laughs> Wayne's producing. Just as he's very excitable, is our Wayne. He is. Very excitable. Is he like that all the time? Yes. Are you <laughs> it's quite exhausting, really. Yes, yes. <laughs> he has that much energy. Uh, £4.99 pence only, jewellery makers. Loads of multi buying. You can have a nice little sort. I like a little spring sort. Oh, I love that. Oh, are you, I love are you an organised person then? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I try to be as much as possible, especially when you've got lots of different um, hobbies. Yeah. You know, so it's quite handy to have a section for your woodworking, a section for your metalworking, yeah. a section for your beading, a section yeah. for your sewing, which I don't do. You don't do sewing? Oh, I'm rubbish at it. No, I'm me. Oh, I'm rubbish at it. Well, loads of stuff, but yeah. Yeah, I had to sew on uh, Willow's swimming badge to a towel the other day. Oh. It's a right mess. It's a right mess, but it's there, it's still stuck on, so that's Aww. good. Um, Roscoe says, give them, open them up, Elle, come on, open them up. Do it. Might as well. And you can stack them all together. Okay, okay, we'll open them up. That's good, we can do that. Nice little sticky label, let's put that there. There we go. Look at, you can get loads oh, in there. Size. Yeah. Get loads in there. I don't know, let's have a little look. Shall I put some of our strands in there? Get us some of our Nan Hong. So you could have one specifically per gemstone. Oh, you'll get multiple strands in here. Look at that. Oh. Ample storage. Nice and like you said, it. you could have them per gemstone then. Oh, yeah. You? Amazing. Loving these. You can feel the quality. Um, so I've got my brother literally flashing through my mind right now because I can remember him tuning in once when we were talking about featherweight head pins. And he was like, you're getting really excited about a featherweight head pin. Right now, he'd be saying you're getting really excited about plastic storage. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah we are. Um, it's because you could, and it's good to cleanse and be organised because that doesn't hinder your creativity, does it? That's, uh, yeah, well, you waste time looking for stuff. Yeah. Oh, so much time. Yeah. So, yeah, get organised. I like the little diamond shape at the bottom. That's going to give it even more structure, isn't it? So they're nice go. and solid. I like that. Nice, yeah, robust. Yeah. Very much robust. I've thought about that. Um, £4.99 for the pack of three. That's essentially, what, less than £2 per container. So, amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, okay, what next, Roscoe? Shall we do... Wire end tips. Also go by the name Y Guardians. Look like little earphones. 
Um, great for things like your knotting or your beading, um, because if you can imagine for those people that don't know what a wire guardian is um, or a wire end tip, they go next to, if you can imagine beading with like something like your wildfire fire line, whatever it might be, silk, um, the friction that that silk will be exposed to against a jump ring, over time, it will wear and cause a weakness. So. Um, if I hold one with a pair of tweezers, we'll be able to display this and show you. Um, because basically, the threading material will go up one end or in through one earphone, through the gully at the top there. There's a like little groove out through the other, and that's where you crimp it. Jump ring comes here and your clasp, obviously. It adds longevity to your jewellery wear. Um, you'll use two in a bracelet, two in a necklace. Yep. For me, if you're knotting things like pearls, jades nanhong whatever it might be the little investment of a wire guardian mm. makes all the difference yeah definitely um now we're starting at one pound each we want to see 50 of you says roscoe on the web on the phone lines otherwise he said oh next price crash is where we're gonna have to stop otherwise but if there's enough of you there we'll put we'll, oh yeah you'll go again later at the end of this clock you are guaranteed a big price crash whether we go again, oh, he says it's up to you. The ball is in our audience's court. I like that. They're sterling, aren't they, as well? Yeah. Smashing. It makes such a difference. For example, if you'd go, if you get <clears throat> some, I don't know, South Sea pearls, we've got South Sea shell, pearl, uh, shell on today, haven't we? So if I was working with South Sea pearls, I would want the, the oh, Wire yeah. Guardian. You'd, you'd been you wouldn't leave it. the silk exposed, would you? No, 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 no. Oh, no, no. Camels, camels want to tell you about that. Yeah, yeah. definitely. You, it's just it, it looks more professional in my oh, opinion yeah. um and like i said it is peace of mind nowhere near enough people on the phone lines though i, I think okay 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 there's only a handful of you there but we will go lower don't worry and we have got multi buyers getting involved the r925 sterling silver the 20. yeah get 20 of them smashing nine pounds and 99 pence only Ross is saying I wanted to go lower, but um, unfortunately, and this is how shopping TV works. It's very different to your traditional retailers. He says, I tell you what, I'll give you another minute. So here's like a second chance. Oh, brilliant. Um, if there's enough of you there, then he will take it to that price point. Um, otherwise, we'll have to close it at 9.99. Shopping TV is very different to normal retail. So in a sense, obviously, we're tight. we've got a time restraint. Um, we've got 100 available and we want to sell the full 100. Yeah. So how we do that? Lower price tag, obviously. But the more that sell, the lower the price we can go, the smaller margin. They're actually quite expensive elsewhere. Are so they? Yeah, JM prices are very good for these. Do you know, I was looking at findings because I need a gold clasp. Oh, okay. I need a gold clasp for, uh, um, for a necklace. I was looking at findings elsewhere. They're so expensive yeah, very in many pricey. places. Yeah, very pricey elsewhere. So and I know we don't really do the gold clasp. We should. Um, but they asked another <laughs> conversation for another I'm day. on that same page. Yeah, <laughs> we should do them. But um, really expensive. Yeah, very. Yeah, very. I buy all French my little wire. findings from here. Yeah, French wire. Yeah. So expensive. Yeah, that ain't cheap stuff. However, thank goodness, thank goodness you shop with us here at Jewelry Maker. And there's enough of you there. He says, ignore 9.99. Thanks, Dan. Oh, you're a good egg. Here we go. Dan's brought in a pearl necklace for us to show you what a wire guardian does. See the wire guardian just there? So that's where the silk goes through, protects the silk, stops the friction, adds longevity to your piece of jewellery. Um, and uh, yeah. Perfect. I'll keep this with me, Dan, actually, because you've got an extender toggle coming up um, as your early bird today. So if you wanted to wear your necklace of whichever gemstone that little bit longer, you add your extender to it. £6.99, pence. everybody. Loads of multi-buyers. Stock up while you get the chance. These are part of our essential collection. Um, however, we seldom see them. That's working out at 35p. 35p. The mind boggles. I don't know how you do it. No. I really don't. And like you said, it's a high-end finish. That looks fab on there. Yeah. It wouldn't look the same without and would it? No, and I would, if, if I was buying a piece of jewellery that didn't have either French wire or wire guardians, and I would be a little bit concerned, because how yeah. many times can you wear it? Yeah. Silk is traditional, obviously, but 
um, it's it's a it's a natural fibre and it's fragile. So oh, yeah. you want it to actually be protected, and that's what it is. It's protection for the silk, but also it looks the part. Six pound ninety nine. Lots of you there. Well done, everybody. Good morning to you all. I hope you're all well. Um, we don't see them that often when they are on our screens. They do tend to sell out, like today. We just took a little bit of warming up. That's all. It is cold today, so actually I do oh, get it. I know. We're all a bit slow this morning. Yeah, that miserable it's fine. start. The week's progressing. Yeah. And all. Oh, the yes, weekend's in sight. The weekend. Weekend's in sight. Um, we had 100. Jacqueline, Genoifa, hello to you. Be Brenda, Marie, Angela, Margaret, uh, Barry, Christine, Sarah, Karen, Gigi, Carol, uh, Caroline. We've got new customers getting twos, threes, fours. Leslie, Ria, hello to you. Helen, Pamela, Caroline. There is still time, thank you, um, to get involved. Oh, you're on it this morning, Dan. Look at that. He's on it. He's on the ball. There's the silver. There's the silver. Are you taking the mickey out of you, Dan? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, well. I'm trying to be helpful. Here you do go. a smashing job. Ignore Scoot, them. He is, yeah. <laughs> there you go. You can see how they actually work. Obviously protects the silk just there. Amazing. Keep on checking out. 35p for sterling silver wire guardians. You're only going to use two. Uh, <coughs> I've still got the boxes here, yeah. There's still a couple available. Somebody has asked, can I fit a tube of sea beads in there? Mm, I don't, I'll try. No. Not quite. You'll get the smaller ones, but look, you're actually like, a, it's just the lid off. So good question though, Vera. You, the lid is, you, unless maybe you cut that. Can you cut that or saw it off maybe? Oh yeah, you don't necessarily need that. Yeah, you could. You could use the Voss as your, uh, the, <laughs> the box as your vessel, says. Uh, vessel? Vessel. He calls, he calls his like, cup of tea a vessel. He calls his cup of tea a vessel? Yeah, like, oh, I don't have a vessel. Okay, like that's it. different. <laughs> a vessel. Ross, how posh are you? Um, that's pretty posh. Pretty posh, pretty posh. Um, <laughs> sorry, Vera, they're not, not quite. They'll fit your Mayukis in there, unless, of course, you... Uh, you lose the top, which yeah, I suppose you could put a bung in there yeah. if you wanted to. But your, your smaller tubes definitely would fit in there. No problem. No problem at all. Um, okay, moving on to... What were you going to do, Ross? Print beads. No, I don't have those. No, I don't have those. Okay, definitely don't have those. I'm looking around, it's not me. <laughs> Normally it's me, you see. Oh, I do. <laughs> no, I don't. I don't actually. I don't. And is it these? <laughs> you found them. It's all good. <sighs> and that happens all the time. Now these were launched uh, recently. Absolutely flew recently. <laughs> <laughs> um, if, if, if you hear these words, it's not here. Chances are it is, by the way, <laughs> on the desk. It's, there's no chances, Ross. I guarantee it's on the desk. You just can't see it. He goes, that's why I didn't even ask Lauren, can I have item number such and such? He says, I didn't even bother because I knew they were on the desk, Al. Sorry. I'm sorry. Um, okay, so these are cool. Yeah, they're really handy. So, silver crimp tubes and rings. So, so what, you crimp in there? Yep. Oh. All one piece. Yeah, super easy. It doesn't even have to be a cord. It can be chain as well. So, yeah, great little bit of kit there. Perfect. So, all your lengths of chain? Mm. What about your leather and things oh, like yeah. that? Yeah, definitely. I mean, you need to know oh. the size of the hole, but yeah, definitely. Super easy. You don't need any glue, which is always good. I've never got any glue. <laughs> Yeah, I was never, never I find my glue. Tips. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I've never seen this before. That's amazing. Yeah. Launched last week. That's why over a hundred flew. I've got how many left? Nine. Okay. Oh. So make sure you do check them out, everybody. Nineteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. That's solid sterling silver as well. Make sure. That's amazing. These need to be part of our essentials collection, don't they? They're good for um, fine chain, you know, if you don't solder. Yeah. Yeah, so you can use that too. Oh, yeah, because we're often asked that question, aren't we, actually? Um, hello, Alison. These are the best for Kumahima with finer threads. Oh, Thank you, lovely. Clever. 
we're quite often yeah. asked how do you finish things like chains mm. etc hello sharon saying good morning to everybody at jewelry maker looking forward to today's show the weather's bad you can cheer us all up we certainly will my lovely no problem sharon we'll do our very very we best we don't mind that job do we no <laughs> no and thank you for joining us as well hello Gigi in california saying uh morning laddie uh, do you mean ladies i think that's yeah ladies morning laddie from california <laughs> that might float away May, oh, are you is it raining in california <laughs> is there floods oh my oh, goodness gosh. we're sending you lots of love Gigi. Yeah. please stay safe stay safe my darling um oh I'm bless sorry. you bless you i didn't realize there was floods in california i didn't know that either. gosh that's rare isn't yeah, it yeah very rare to say well you look after yourself safe safe my lovely yeah number four and number six yes we can do that um, we'll do number four first, which is which, sorry? The fire quartz oh. bangle. Ah, we were discussing we were this earlier. This, yeah. Now, this is extremely limited. I like your taste, Gigi. Mm. Um, incredibly, this is a variety of natural red quartz. Now, quartz is a gemstone family. One of the colours, yeah, me too. In training, there are certain colours. When, when I was training with the GIA, it was like certain colours you don't get in certain gemstone families. You don't get blue in your garnets. Right. Um, but you do. Now, it was discovered. <laughs> and then it was like, oh, you don't ever see reds in, in the quartz family. But you do, but very, very, very rarely. And that's why, if you remember, think back to the Moroccan Amethyst launch here at Gemporia. The reason why it was such a gemological uh, phenomenon was because the inclusions internally were red. Um, they're actually hematite. Um, so you do get it, but it is very, very, very rare. Um, gemologically, this is like I said something that for many decades we said would never would never exist and it's not just a little tiny fraction of red it's solid red and oh, it's yeah. totally natural color as well um this is called fire quartz it is definitely one for the collectors and the connoisseurs I mean look at that red on the inside it's beautiful I've never seen anything like it it's amazing isn't yeah. it absolutely amazing totally and utterly natural you can dye gemstones of course you can um you can polymer impregnate this isn't isn't any of those it's totally natural 499 pounds well, for something that is so gemologically rare i mean this this could literally be within our museum our gemstone museum um we only have seven available again worthwhile getting your certificate of authenticity with something like this now already people adding these to your baskets amazing it's one of the larger bangles as well jewelry makers are you ready look at those it couldn't be any more red could it what do we take it to a double figure price tag for any gemstone any bangle let alone one that is as gemologically exciting as red in a court it sounds almost like i mean i know if i was to have this conversation with some of my friends and family they'd be like okay yeah <laughs> but but red you don't get red well really ever get red in courts as a family so this is a jet if you are if you're fascinated by the gemology side of jewelry then this is most definitely one that's going to be exciting you plus you've got your split payments as well 0% interest split payments so uh 99 pounds 99 pence only how amazing again one of the larger bangles um so i'm going to stick with the bangles and i'm going to stick with the reds because in addition both of these by the way can be described as a sargonetic quartz oh i know do you like that she's a clever girl isn't she well, this one no sometimes i have no idea what you're talking about oh bless you <laughs> no, a sargonet that's a lot of reading of gemstone books i'm a bit of a nerd when it comes to that but any quartz that has internal inclusions yeah so your rutile quartz your golden quartz they're sargonetic quartz i actually learned right. that from remember marie our gemologist who lives next door to me and hi oh, yeah she's nice handy. um she taught me that um so anything with an internal inclusion like golden rutile black rutile they're sargonetic quartz mm. strawberry quartz is a sargonetic quartz now again very rare because of the red um and they almost look like little pips Ooh. like little strawberry jam pips and that transforms the oh, entire if it wasn't for those in th those sargonetic inclusions you wouldn't have the red color basically oh. I know it's amazing isn't it um again 
oh, gemologically so rare, so exciting to actually get a whole bangle in it. I think when we first launched Strawberry Quartz across the entire partnership, they were rondelles, so much, much smaller. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, to actually get a whole, you've got to imagine how big this piece of Strawberry Quartz rough would have actually been to, to start with, especially when we think about the, the presentation um, of Strawberry Quartz. We were showing specimens that had sold on Bonhams for like thousands. And they were like and that's this like big. a lump, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah, little yeah. tiny. They're about yeah inches. Yeah. Um, whereas this would have been an enormous piece, and it's all carved out of one amazing stone. Totally natural. Again, definitely worthwhile getting your certificate of authenticity. Um, let's do this in one price crash, shall we? Natural strawberry quartz. It's a beautiful, yeah, like strawberry jam color. Oh wow! Wow. You don't see those sorts of things anywhere else no. other than here, do you? That's quite special. Yeah, it is. The only place you might would be Bonhams the, the, and yeah. Sotheby's yeah. and Christie's. Places where we catch up. Places like, yeah, places <laughs> Most normal you, people. I, I don't mind saying, I'd be on my budget. Oh, yeah. I can't. Oh, afford. yeah. No, I can't. And to be honest, like I said, one piece of strawberry quartz. I don't know if you've got that information, Roscoe. One piece of strawberry quartz rough yeah. was thousands at auctions. Wow. I've got three of these available. It's natural certified strawberry quartz, um, 79.99. Um, there's people with it in their baskets like Gigi in California, Susan in Manchester. Well done, Gigi. They're absolutely amazing. It's such a beautiful, beautiful color. Uh, Suzanne in Yorkshire, you can do it too if you check out your baskets. We've only got, how many did you say, three? Three, okay. Um, so make sure you are checking out your baskets. We're over allocated on this one absolutely beautiful it's such a pretty color as well um, amazing well done everybody we're gonna stick with the red theme I thought I was eyeing this up and before the show Malagasy Ruby uh, um, Gemporia launched a big collection of Malagasy Ruby it's probably one of their biggest collections actually of 2023 um, Malagasy, different locations of Ruby around the world, obviously, but Malagasy has got this real intensity, this really sumptuous, quite passionate, like red. Um, we're going to do a big closeout deal, and these are huge. Genuine Ruby, natural Ruby, most Ruby, 95% natural fat, the world's Ruby is treated, either heat treated or, or, or fissure filled in some way, shape or form. This is natural. Look at that glow. Undeniably Ruby as well. How many? 65 wow. carats. Um, didn't Jake launch Malagasy Ruby here at Jewelry Maker? Because I, I bought my sister, it's her birthstone, my sister-in-law a Ruby. I'm sure it was Malagasy Ruby that I bought her. It's the colour that just, it's, you know, for me, it rivals your, your uh, um, Mogok Ruby, for me, because of that wonderful intensity. At £149, Ruby is, is widely regarded as the king of all colored gemstones. It's widely regarded as one of the most expensive colored gemstones. Obviously, it's in the big five. Um, but again, I, if we go back to sort of my uh, younger years, when I was in my 20s, this was a gem I never even entertained being able to own. Oh, no. Because they're so, it, it's tens of thousands of pounds, especially when you're talking about sizes like this. I mean, you could team this with something like your type A jadeite. You could mm. team it with something like your um, nephrites, which we've got coming up later on, or maybe some of your fine pearls. At £149, do we have quantity of these? 36 available, but we're going to do a closeout deal certainly one of the most successful launches of 2023 across the partnership wow oh. <laughs> right for natural ruby and the depth of color yeah they're just lush incredibly charlie that's still not our price you're joking if it wasn't for jewelry maker there's no way on earth i would own the gemstones that i do oh know. no me too and i think there's a lot of us out there that are on the same page yeah that is uh nonsensical yeah <laughs> i don't precisely. know how you do it because <laughs> not one of these would be 49.99 elsewhere oh no not one of them no you know and when you take the scale the it's size wrong. what size is that they go up to what 10 millimeters for a ruby huge That's whopping the average carat weight of ruby is actually larger than many other gemstones but they're expensive yeah you know um 
I hope I don't get told off for saying this, but I remember years ago actually asking our founder, what's the most expensive gemstone you've ever bought? He said, a ruby. Right. It was a ruby. A ruby, not massive ruby either, not one that's in the museum, a ruby piece of jewellery. That's, it's expensive. Nobody is paying 49 We're going to do a massive closeout deal. Well done, Christine, multi-buying on this. Gigi's on it as well. Well done, my lovely. Cynthia, Paula and Karen. Remember, totally natural and a brand new low for you this morning. You've got, what, 20 minutes on this hour to make your confirmations. Oh, oh that's amazing. I've got to be honest, I would pay, I would pay what is it, 29.99 for that one. Oh yeah. For one? Yeah. You know, because if you imagine that in a piece of jewelry and say it, you, you've got a booth or an artisanal market and mm. someone says, oh, lovely, that's a nice necklace. What is it? Oh, that's ruby with say pearls or whatever it is. Yeah, yeah natural ruby is I, you know it's not going to add 29 pounds and 99 pence to your piece of jewelry it's going to add hundreds if oh, not gosh, yeah. if not beyond shall i count them because this is a parcel so you can tell i'm getting a little bit excited <laughs> about this um two four six eight ten twelve fourteen sixteen seventeen don't tell me what that is per stone <gasps> one pound seventy six Per natural ruby. It's it's definitely over a carat on uh, you know on average across the strand. That's whopping, isn't it? Huge. Yeah. One pound. I actually quite like it just as it is. Me too. You know. Yeah. Let, well, should we hold it up to the decolletage? Oh yes, please. Imagine that. Oh look at that colour. If you oh, are a July baby, colour. you you simply must. Oh. Or even if you're not. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> You have lovely. 20 minutes to get hold of the Malagasy Ruby for under £30. And not just one. You're getting an entire parcel of them. But they're workable. £1.76 per stone. Workable for us jewellery makers. Again, imagine all of your lovely pearls that you've sourced um, over the years. Imagine just popping one ruby in there as well. Oh, oh yeah. my goodness me. Yes. Stay where you are. Make sure you're checking out your baskets on that. Shall we bring one of my favourite stones, Malachite. What's your favourite gemstone? Ah, oh, Opal. Opal. Yeah, <laughs> you love Opal. I do love an Opal. Oh, well, we haven't seen Opal in absolutely ages, I but know. there you go. I I'm know. honest I that we've got it in your I? project. Coming Malachi up in the next very hour. very big at the minute. Is, yeah. Yeah, very big. There's probably a lot to do with all the TV series that are on uh, Opal Hunters and things. Oh, do you know, I love watching yeah. that. It's love cool, watching isn't it? that. It's great. It's cool. um, what's that, sorry? Charlie's Opal coming up in the next hour. Whoop, whoop. Oh, we should call it that, Charlie's Opal. We should call it that. Charlie's Opal. <laughs> um, look at these, full of play of colour. Oh, my goodness. And this is the end result. They're just stunning. Absolutely amazing. It's a shame, really, because the lights wash out the colour. In the VT video, it was picking up reds, yeah. golds, there we go. greens. Yeah, there you go. Even with my rubbish recording. Uh, <laughs> do you know what? It's, it it's, it's Opal is notoriously difficult to show in the studio, so you almost have to trust that, trust it, us Yes. when you get it home. I will say it's oh, probably it's one of our greatest strengths, Opal oh. buying. Um, that's coming up in the next hour, jewellery makers. Um, beautiful for those of you that want to master the art of gem setting. Now, let's bring a gemstone that's firmly in the limelight right now um, and that is your beautiful malachite and that lots of the big um, a-list if you like uh, jewelry houses very much um, using and incorporating malachite into the designs you know casually say the likes of Van Cleef and Arpels, Chopard, uh, Piaget, uh, uh, Cartier, Gucci, um, oh, Dior. Oh, Cummings are, are using know, it as well, aren't they? They're taking all, inspiration. They're all, so yeah, they're big at the minute. And I get big. it. I totally mm. get it. Um, it is definitely one of those gemstones that I think is deserving of that oh, yeah. um, recognition because there's nothing like it. Oh no, it's a very shallow forming gemstone, very copper rich. Um, but like I said, in the locations or the establishments that I was talking about earlier on, they tend to be slices. Um, and you have these lovely stories. It's like a story within a gemstone um, where that copper-rich solution that has filtered through the, um, the earth soil 
pr produces these wonderful layers. You know, yesterday we had the Botswana and we were talking about the silica layers and how yes. it cools, etc. That's how it pre uh, creates almost like another chapter within the gemstone. Oh. Um, malachite is very, very similar to that. Um, yeah, I, I, again, the words of the jewelry editor sort of really stick in my mind and it says it's the outlandish eccentric that once seen you never forget. Oh, that's um, very well yeah, said, isn't it? In a gemstone. <laughs> it's so true. At 19 pounds and 99 pence only. Oh, this is Congolese as well. So just the reason why I'm highlighting that is Congolese uh, malachite is regarded as the best little bit like Columbia to your emerald or Mogot to your ruby. Um, or... We learn so much through you and Carol. It's oh, quite fascinating. I wish I could keep it all in. <laughs> well, it's it, bless you, bless you. Are you also? I also witter on a lot about about rubbish. So I don't don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there's a balance. You can't be perfect all the time. There is a balance. <laughs> um, we're at 19.99. They're a good size, aren't they? They are very workable. Very usable. We've yeah. shown that necklace, haven't we? I can't remember if it's Wolf and Badger. Um, and it's one strand of malachite. Simple, one strand of malachite. Or it might be Netta Porter or something like that. Have you got it, Ross? Is it Netta Porter? That one single strand of malachite. And they look to be about four mils, don't they? Three or four millimetres. And it's like 400 quid. I was going to say big bucks. Yeah. yeah. 400 pounds. I know our jewellery makers could create it. We're at 20 pounds, but we're going even lower. Ooh. Ross just said we're going lower in a big way. Malachite should never be this price. No, Ooh. I agree. <laughs> I agree. It's hard to get a hold of. It is. Yeah. It is, it is. You know, our team have just come back from Tucson. Yes. Um, I went two years ago and it became a little bit of a running joke. You know, if they if they lost me, which as you can imagine in a big city, it's like, yeah. oh, where's Elle? Find the Malachite and I'll find, and, and, and Elle will be, be there. for it. Yeah, I just <laughs> gravitated towards it. Not intentionally. I was just always over by the Malachite. It, yeah. So pretty. Yeah. But do you know what you couldn't find? Find Malachite, no problem. Right. Couldn't find strands. Oh. It was all either in free forms oh, or see. slices. Yes. Um, and in speaking to a Malachite uh, vendor, if you like, they were saying it's because of all the big designers. Right. So you can't actually, it's really difficult to get strands. It's 12 99 Ross is right though, isn't he? You shouldn't be able to get Malachite at such a low price tag. No. And again, there it is. There's that necklace I was referencing. Netta Porter, there we go. Oh, yeah, um, you could £480 do that. Pounds for that. Or you could make it yourself. Yeah. For, what was that? Twelve pounds ninety nine. Just add a few little precious Bonkers. metals. Yeah. Bonkers. It's got a fourteen carat gold clasp. All right. Again, you can pick those up for about twenty quid. Oh, I yeah. reckon. Yeah. Probably. Um, amazing. Well done, everybody. Make sure you're checking out your baskets. Stay where you are. Um, let's do some what? Neon appetite. Oh, but this one's lovely. Natural. Now Wayne went on um, holiday recently. Wayne's our gemstone buyer and sales manager, and he was in Thailand. Very nice. Um, basically, in his absence, we launched an amazing parcel, brand new parcel of neon appetite, um, that completely sold out. Not surprised. Um, not surprised. It's amazing quality. It's natural, which is rare for neon appetite. Normally undergoes some kind of heat treatment. And then on his return, he's like, ah. Oh, he launched the parcel of Neon Appetite and absolutely flew. He goes, I have got one more strand if you want it. And it was this one, wasn't it? We launched it last week. Or was it the week before? Yeah, I think it was. A, was it really? Recently. We launched it very, very recently. Um, I've got 22 left. And then that's that parcel done and oh. dusted. The reason, look, we'll buy gemstones by parcels, of course. They're launched. They might be divvied out across the different channels, gem collector, gem pour, etc. Um, but we expect them to maybe last a little bit longer. Right. However, this, gone. In and out. In and out. The quality is exceptional though. We have 23 left for you today. That's not heat treated jewelry makers. That is totally and utterly natural. That'll brighten your day, won't it? Oh, oh. it's such a gorgeous stone. Um, again, we've said we think big things for Neon Appetite in the forthcoming years. We reckon oh. this is going to, yeah, we've discussed this as a team. We were like, I reckon Neon Appetite is going to be one of those limelight gemstones moving forward. And if anybody's going to know, it's you guys. Oh, uh, well. It's good advice. Well. Little heads up. Well, I, you, know, just, you just kind of think, look at it though. Yeah, I know. It's absolutely it makes beautiful. Sense. Yeah. Stunning, but rare. Not only is this natural, the deal is also mega. The average carat weight of this gemstone is 0 0.15 
minuscule. You have 50 carats in this strand and we're at 14 pounds and 99 pence only. The final 23, once this parcel's gone, obviously we'll endeavor to get more, of course, but it's never a guarantee. Yeah. And really our expectation should be that this is heated because it normally actually is heat treated in some way, shape or oh, form. I didn't know that. Normally, to encourage those lovely colours. This is natural, but it's rare to get it in its natural variety. Again, we've shown you lots of different, it's another gemstone that, that uh, um, a jewellery editor got really excited about. Uh, they've written about showing lots of bit different designers incorporating. Um, who, who's your mate, Ross? Who's your mate? What's her name? Cat Florence, there you go. Um, Cat Florence is like one of the world's most recognized designers. She's made jewelry for many, many a Holly, uh, Hollywood A-lister. She loves this gemstone. She uses it a lot. And, and Ross, and Ross, and Ross knows her. Ross knows her, He's yeah. got some hookups, hasn't he? I know, it's a nice Ooh. little hooker. Are you still mates, Ross? No, <laughs> Cat Florence, no? If you needed to, you could reach out. You could. That's a good contact to have in your little pocket. Book. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah, you've so, you you've you've uh, brought some of her pieces of jewelry to wear, haven't you? You've you've literally <laughs> Can I just say this sentence as Ross said it to me? I have literally held her jewelry in my hand, oh. he says. There you go. And Oh, oh. and she says I she has a piece uh, of jewelry, a watch. Uh, what she made a piece of jewellery okay and Kanye West wore it oh and you've held that watch have you have you there you oh. go Kanye he's a one isn't he that's <laughs> definitely a claim to fame he's, that, a, he's a one um <laughs> ah, make sure you check it out your baskets everybody on that one um, stay where you are on those phone lines. Okay, now let's bring... Is it a bundle, though? Uh, it's one strand. Oh, wow. Whoa. The scarf. <laughs> Hence why I thought it was two strands. That's a metre of natural Canadian nephrite. Ooh. Now, Jade is the surname. This is how I always describe it. Jade is a surname. You have your siblings, Jadeite, Nephrite. Nephrite's the older sibling, thousands of years of history. Jadeite's hundreds of years of history. Um, they call it the original Jade, your Nephrite. Now, Nephrite forms in a few different places. You can get it in China. You, it's one of the few Jades that is mined in China. Um, you can get it in uh, um, Canada. Um, Kotan, we know of that. Um, with whatever variety, whether you're thinking about jadeite or you're talking about nephrite it is still all about the translucency and the color right. so how fine that crystal is this if you were to pop along you know just hop skip along to tiffany's and co um and you find your elsa peretti jade pieces it's this material this location mm. this is one of the few locations in the world you know how passionate the chinese are about jade this is one of the few locations in the world that they will are willing to um import okay. because they they mine nephrite in china so they tend to use uh, use their own however the quality that comes from canada it's one of the few locations they will import so much so that 90 percent of this location's uh, um, supply goes to china the remaining 10 percent goes to tiffany's cartier oh. van cleef and arpels and us you know we have to try and fight for it fight for it as well <laughs> and and then here we are bringing you not even like a, a 38 centimeter strand not even a 20 centimeter strand we're bringing you a full meter we launched this last week again look at that if i'm trying to hold it let me get a white piece of paper because then you'll really see the translucency of these if i hold a length of the strand out look at the translucency of your nephrite this is spinach green. We've got five left. Launched only a couple of weeks. Well, last week, wasn't it? On the weekend. Those facets just... It's gorgeous, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. £99.99 and pence only. Look at the quality, though. Spinach green to nephrite is what imperial green is to jadeite. Right. It's, it's the most sought after colour. There's only four of these left. You've got, what, a matter of minutes to get these? 
Um, we've got your early bird coming up. In fact, that would look perfect with this as well. Um, there is a definite sense of luxury. Well, this is an heirloom piece of jewellery. It's one of the world's rarest gemstones, no denying that. Um, now, coming up, something that we've never seen before. Um, we've done extenders, haven't we? Let's be honest, they're not normally that decorative, are they, extender chains? Not particularly. Not really. They're fit for purpose. Yep. They have a function. However, these are decorative and fit for purpose. Um, so they're your extender toggles. Okay, genius. I love the. <laughs> <laughs> I want to talk about you, Adam. He's on, he's on form. <laughs> he's on form. Although you have moments. <laughs> Don't we all? You have moments. Um, <laughs> no, do you know what? I love the fact that our design team are constantly bringing items that I'd never thought of before. Innovative, aren't they? Innovative. Yes. That's the perfect word, isn't yes. it? Yes. Because an extender chain, it's functional, isn't it? And mm -hmm. it's not exactly romantic when we say extender chain. However, they have that function. They have that practicality. This is a decorative extender chain now i'm just thinking out loud here if you, you know sometimes when we get your toggles and they're obviously coming two parts so i'm just thinking if you were to put one part of your toggle another toggle on the end of one chain and then you were to use this one say what well, i don't know which one we're starting with say we were going to uh, and then you would use this part to the other side you've actually got a, a um a three length opportunity then yes. haven't you yeah yeah it's a great idea because you could have yeah if you put another toggle here you don't have to this is just me thinking out loud but if you put another ogle of the toggle we yeah. were talking about this earlier <laughs> on here all of a sudden then you've got three opportunities three different lengths but this is your extender but in a toggle because normally your extenders are your bolt ring clasps aren't they yes which aren't as pretty, are they? No, and they can be a bit fiddly. Yeah, <clears throat> absolutely. Whereas a toggle is much simpler. Oh, yeah. That's a good point, actually, Charlie. Some people find bolt ring class or trigger class yeah, fiddly. Yeah. Whereas toggles are easier. Oh, yeah. They're that step towards a, um, a magnetic class. Yes. I think. Like bridge the gap. Yeah, yeah definitely. definitely. Now, we've got them in the three colours, jewelry makers, but we've never done anything like this before. Personally, I'm looking at these thinking, right, I'm going to say, let's use the Nanhong as an example. I'm going to make a necklace and I might want to wear it 16, 18, 20, whatever. Um, so I'm going to attach that there in my knotting process. This end, I'm going to put my ogle from another toggle. I love that. <laughs> ogle from another <laughs> toggle and put it there. And then all of a sudden I've got three ways. Does that make sense? Looks beautiful with gold, doesn't it? Amazing! And the little... Or, alternatively, leave them as is. Oh, yeah. That was me thinking outside the box. I like How... the little embellishments. They're cute, aren't they? You don't get them yeah, on the other ones. What? They'd be lovely pieces of jewellery. Yes. That's just on a shepherd hook. Oh, yeah. And that um, toggle front chain necklace, just yeah. on its own. It's very popular right now. So, yeah, you could just take a few bits off and do that. Was it like the 80s where you used to see the T-bar necklaces all the time? Yeah. I used to really love them. I like 80s stuff, yeah. And I me, mean, well, it's making yeah. somewhat of a revival. It you is. know, like the Bottega big oversized oh. earrings. They're everywhere, yes. aren't they? I can't wait for the perms to come back. Yeah, <laughs> corkscrew perms. Yeah. I remember that. I used to brush my corkscrew perm and it basically oh. just turned into this big Oof. mass. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, now, we've got how many of these available, Roscoe? 100 available. I'm wondering as well, you could take that one ogle off and put it on that toggle, couldn't you? Oh, yeah. It doesn't have to stay where it's positioned because there's a jump ring in between. Yeah, I think, in fact, that's how I should be displaying it. That ogle should be on there. Does that make sense? Yes. And flipped over because that's what that jump ring's for, for you to attach, you could be Clever. straight onto. Yeah, you don't even need to add the jump rings, they're already there. They're already there. Seven pounds and ninety-nine pence only jewelry makers. If I had pliers, I'd do it, I'd do it for you. But you just literally take the one ogle off, you put it on the other, and there's your extender chain. Um, because that's an ogle and that's a tuh. 
toggle um 7.99 we've got them in three different colors we've never had a product like this previously before we've had extender chains which aren't that aesthetic are they in comparison anyway no they're not no they're not and that tea bag they've you know it's decorative it's not just a plain bag no. is it no they've, they've put a little finesse in there they have you've got some nice little uh divots mm. you've got almost some like glue. bamboo yeah, isn't a bit it? Bamboo, yeah, I like a bit that. Gucci then. Yeah, a bit Gucci style. Um, there's multi buyers getting involved. Hello to you, Susan and Brian, Anna Marie. Hello to you, Pauline. Getting four Yorkshire, Nicolette, June, London, Weldon, to you, Karen, Helen, Lavinia, Sharon. New customers. Guess what though? Not your early bird price. We've got a hundred of these available. Um, let me just see if I if I if I can do this with ease. So you take. That toggle, which I'm holding in the T bars, uh, the tweezers, sorry, the T bar and ogle look obsessed. You take that, you pop that to your extender, and then you can wear it at two different lengths. Does that make sense? It's just how it's hung. Um, but like being said, I think that's a nice pair of earrings. Yeah, I quite like that as, as it is. They'd be very cool. 32 seconds, we are going even <clears throat> lower. Jewelry makers, again, make sure you are checking out to guarantee yours. We've never had this before. Not to my knowledge, anyway. We've had extender chains, definitely. We've had safety chains, yeah. definitely. Yeah. But the extender chains tend to be quite fine. Yeah. And again, quite fiddly. Yeah. It definitely, they, the usual ones that I'm thinking of anyway, need the bolt ring or the trigger class. Whereas you can't put a toggle on one of those. No. Whereas you can do on these jewelry makers. Um, in three seconds, taking that price even lower. We have a hundred, the phone lines have lit up. We've got the rose gold, you can shop ahead on those. We've got the silver, you can shop ahead on those. Guarantee your success in terms of quantity. Let me just double check. Um, okay, you've got 100 of the gold, you've got 55 of the rose, and we've got 200 of the silver, but we'll need those. We'll need that quantity. £6.99. Let's not forget, there's a big investment of your sterling silver. And why do we need extender chains? Because uh, if, you wear, if you wear the same top every single day, which, let's be honest, most of us don't. We do <laughs> mix our wardrobe around. But, you know, sometimes, you know, you'll wear your uh, necklace a little bit shorter, yes. higher to the nape of the neckline. Sometimes you'll see it, uh, you want it a little bit longer if you're mm. wearing a blouse or something like that. Yeah. So it's the versatility. And it's different sizes, isn't it? Some, some women, a 16-inch length might look very different on another woman. So I think the... I do quite like the toggle... Uh, fastening at the front, I think that's very trendy, isn't yeah. it? And I think I think that's quite a nice feature to have. Funny you should say that. We did a whole uh, because we had a toggle collection, um, and we were talking about that, weren't we? We were showing lots of different designers that are actually using the toggle at the front. Um, we're going to go straight to this one, rose gold. Um, again, take that, undo that jump ring that's connecting the two. You can see it open in the photograph, actually. Uh, just undo that jump ring. And then put your toggle on the on the bottom, and that's how you extend it, basically. Uh, Six pounds and ninety nine pence. Again, we have got um, fifty of those, but there's loads of you, uh, loads of you getting involved. Let's bring you the big one. Almost a third of the stock has already gone. Jewelry makers. I'm not surprised. We're going to do it in one price crash. If I had the time, I would take it off, but I haven't got the time. Um, sorry. And a minute at the next price. Okay. We've got 200 of these, but silver is always the most popular. Big quantity. Brand new premiere. Low price. You know how it works. JM price. Jewelry hey. makeup price. Yeah. That's a big amount of sterling silver. It's not, oh, yeah. it's not base metal. Yeah, four pounds and ninety nine pence. The phone lines have lit up again, giving you the versatility to wear your necklaces. It's it's the difference between this and this, you know. It's a it, it, it's a good drop. Mm, yeah. Um, which uh, there's not for me. There's nothing worse than actually wearing a necklace that's maybe a little bit too yes. snug. Coming up after the break, don't forget we've got Charlie's absolutely amazing projects. Um, all about the wonderful specialism that is gem setting. Um, and we've got Opal, Sleeping Beauty Turquoise, Mixed Tourmaline, Peridot and so Tanzanite. Unbelievable. And these come with written instructions now, jewellery makers as well, that are available upon dispatch. Coming your way, awesome jewellery maker prices, of course. Make sure you check out your baskets as well on your early bird. Don't forget as well, Dave is joining us at 10 o'clock today. We've had a little rejig of your deal of the days. All about your amazing South Sea mother of pearl. Don't go anywhere. I'm making my way over to Charlie for amazing projects next.
one of Jewelry Makers guest designers. Just wanted to give you a little heads up at what's coming on Thursday the 8th of Feb. So at nine o'clock we have some beautiful floral pendants. They're absolutely stunning. Some gorgeous gemstones. You set them yourself. They are exquisitely well made. I can't wait to show you them. And then at 12 o'clock we have some fantastic settings. I've never used them before. I will definitely be using them again. Uh, they're snap settings. Anyone can set them. You can use little to no tools at all. Bish bash bosh, they're done. Can't wait to show you those too. So I really hope you can join me on Thursday. Can't wait to be back in the studio and I will be seeing you there. Bye. Charlie. I've been making jewellery for about 10 years. I started making jewellery um, really because I was actually quite good with my hands. I've always been quite good with my hands. Um, but when my children were young, there wasn't enough money to spend lavishly on jewellery. And some of the designs were so simple, I thought, I can make that. I started off wire wrapping and very quickly knew that I wanted to make something more rigid and more structured. And um, because I take after my Nana, I do like sparkles. So it was just a natural progression to work towards stone setting. Um, my favorite tool is a little bit like picking your favorite pet. Um, probably my hand piece actually. If it wasn't for my hand piece, I wouldn't be able to do half the amount of work I have. Um, and I do like a good old hammer and rolling mill, who doesn't? I love Jewelry Maker because without them, I wouldn't be where I am today. Um, and they offer opportunities for myself and other makers to be a part of something much bigger that would be typically out of reach for most normal people. Um, and such a whole world of gemstones um, it's very exciting and it, it's, it's where it's at for me. Ah, there's our lovely Charlie. <laughs> that was very nice. Thank you. It takes a million goes. I actually find them very difficult. <laughs> they are, no, they are difficult. VTs are harder than yes. TV. Yeah, it's much, almost much like harder. It's, you have to remember lines, you have to remember what yeah. you're talking about. So yeah, it must yeah. take me 57,000 goes to yeah, get no, it right. No, 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 you're not alone in that. <laughs> it is, they are harder VTs. Gosh. Because because it is in a sense scripted. You know what you want to say. Mm. It's not just like a conversation. Yeah, no. Whereas TV is much more conversational. Yes, it is. So it's, it's just remembering things. I'm not very good at that. No, normally. <laughs> we'll wait till you have to do one with Alan. And I, I'm like, <laughs> if I'm doing them with Alan, I was like, you've got to break it down. 
I can't remember that. Yeah. She, he gives you a big paragraph. I, was, I can't remember all that. So break it. Yeah, a little bit of behind the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Welcome, jewelry makers. Then it's cut. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, not really. Not that bad. Now. Oh my goodness, me. Oh, they're lovely, aren't they? Stunning, so stunning, stunning projects coming up this hour. And as you said in your VT, affordable too. Oh, yeah. Now, just before we get into your amazing project, um, because I know we literally want to keep our head down, focus. Just a little reminder, we've had a little bit of a rejig around. So what was meant to be tomorrow's deal of the day is now today's um, because diaries change meetings and things like that. Look, I'm not pretending to be the, you know, the executive that many of the people are. Um, but yes, yeah, so this is <laughs> now, why is that funny? Um, this is now today. So we've got the wonderful Dave Troth joining us in the studio at 10 o'clock and i'm so pleased because uh, do you know what if, the, if it hadn't have happened if the change ever happened i would have missed out on this opportunity and i absolutely love well firstly the beauty of your south sea but this is the south sea shell yeah, hand carved stunning. um we've got it in the butterfly an oval we've got it in a flower we've got it in a ring as well which is absolutely yeah, amazing saw. yeah so these are coming up not too long to wait for those and of course in precious metal check out this one Oh, it's no. stunning. You were saying you love opal. Oh. That looks a little bit like Australian oh, it does. opal, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, it does. Because you get it's those lovely, lovely colours. Yeah. yeah, amazing colours across the surface of them. Um, so coming up in about an hour's time, Jewelry Maker, not too long to wait for those. But before that, we've got the wonderful talent that is Charlie. Oh, thank you. Well, you know, it's true. <laughs> it is true. I mean, wow. I, you said in that VT that you love, it was a natural process for you to sort of I don't know, work into or that you natural progression into gem settings. So when you see projects like this, I bet it's like, ah. Oh. oh, yeah, it's a treat. Yeah. It's an absolute treat. And it's even better because I don't have to make it. <laughs> so, yeah. Because Carol, so normally you, what, you'd make the setting? Yeah. So last time I was here, Carol was laughing at me because she'd say, would you make this? And I'd be like, yeah, it'd take a long time. But yeah. And she's like, well. And, it, and, I, and I think I slowed my progression down massively by not using pre-made mounts and mm -hmm. settings and things like that. So I think I would have learned quicker in half the time if I'd have just yeah. purchased the pre-made ones. And they're exquisite quality. Yeah. They're very, although they look dainty and delicate, they're actually really robust. So you can practice with these. I know that sounds so wrong because they are so beautiful, but you can definitely get some practice in with these. Yeah, don't be afraid to have a go. Oh, definitely not. It's all an investment. And even if it goes terribly, terribly wrong and it's an absolutely disaster, there's still value in the time you've spent learning and in the silver. And the, stones. And the stones as well. Yeah. So yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a great one to get started with. Um, and it's basically, or gem setting, it, it's it's you need to be patient, don't oh, you? You need to have a little steady hand, maybe, and just maybe be in the right frame of mind. Would you agree? Oh yeah, I walk away from my work all the time. It's probably the biggest tip I can give you. If you feel yourself getting frustrated, stop, go get a cup of tea, and come yeah. back to it later. And you just have to yeah. um, pace yourself. Yeah. It, it's not a race, um, and it and it's all a progression. It's a journey. It takes masters decades to learn the art of mm -hmm. it so but you've got to start somewhere absolutely 100 yeah. percent um now we've put all of your projects on pre-order so you can guarantee the gemstone that you favor now they all come not with cubic zirconia with natural white zircon oh, um so the oldest gemstone on the planet white zircon um and you obviously mm. get um the choice of the gemstones and you get that lovely flower detail so let's talk through the gemstones you've got sleeping beauty turquoise mined out in 2012 you've got that which is amazing you have the most beautiful tourmaline oh my goodness yeah, look at that clarity uh, sleeping beauty is this motif too oh is yes that... it is sorry i'm demoing with that one lovely. i kept hold of that one sorry so there it is. There's the Sleeping Beauty you can see on Charlie's uh, Charlie's desk. Um, you have Peridot, which is same motif, that lovely uh, five petal flower. Again, very Van Cleef. Um, and then you have two what, sorry? A slightly different motif, which if I move this one out the way a second, that's the Tanzanite where you actually got the stem 
How lovely. Mother's Day is around the corner. How beautiful would these be for Mother Night, uh, Mother's Day? Um, look at the quality of that tanzanite as well. Perfectly colour matched. Better than a bunch of flowers that are oh, with gosh, their own dye. I should say. Yeah. Absolutely. Perfect cornflower blue. Oh, stunning. And you get the two zircons. You've got the one in the centre and then you've got one just on the stem as well. Um, so the tanzanite comes with the stem. Look at that quality of blue. The more vanadium that you have within tanzanite, the deeper the colour, basically. And then, finally, what the one that's definitely got people talking is your Ethiopian opal. Unbelievable, which comes, with, again, with the stem Very and beautiful. the two circles. Oh, stunning. Absolutely stunning. Um, and you've got two little jump rings so you can suspend it. Yeah, I snipped one off for the tanzanite and kept the two for the opal. So it was just to show that you can do both. Yeah. You know, you don't have to keep both of them on there. It's nice to have that choice, actually. Oh, yeah, isn't it? I like that. I do Amazing. like that you offer that. Loving that. I think that's what I would do. It just means that if I make one and you make one, they can be they slightly can different. Be different. Yeah. yeah. I think, ah, oh, beautiful. And you might even be able to feed the chain through. I don't know. I don't know. I don't. Yeah, a nice um, box chain. Yeah, something lovely. like that. Yeah, definitely. Beautiful. Now, don't forget as well, each of Charlie's projects comes with written instructions this is available in your order history so after you make your purchase um, if you go to your order order history and then you'll see download content yes. click that box and this is what you'll see um, what, what I'm suggesting get yourself a ring binder oh I know I love that idea print them off yeah and you've got them there as a nice reference it talk Charlie talks through everything you can see um, what you'll need, the estimated time to actually make it as well, um, skill set more advanced. Yes, I, what I've put down as advanced, but again, it's a good one to practice with because with the uh, the single ones without the stem, there's five on there and six on the other, so it is it's a good one to practice with. So just ignore, and it might not take you an hour; it might only take you half an hour. I just I'm trying to be generous there. Well, we've got <laughs> we've got people that if you think sea beading, for example, we've got people that start at the advance yes. don't they it's it's it, and work it, your it, way back yeah i do it, that too it, yeah it's one of those and you can see perfectly um perfectly illustrated by charlie and written out for you um now ross has just said something in my ear he says l we've made a huge error have we you've put them on pre-order look at the prices where am i looking where am i looking oh 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 Thirty nine ninety nine for Sleeping Beauty Turquoise, Tanzanite, Opal, Tourmaline, Peridot. What? Okay, the Peridot is set at the correct price because we would take it lower from there. Our closing price should not be thirty nine ninety nine. Tanzanite should not be thirty nine ninety nine. That quality of opal should not be thirty nine ninety nine. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna, obviously going to have to go there. Amazing. Um, it is an error. We make them from time to time. Take advantage, everybody. Take advantage. Ross is actually going to see. It. Well, you can't increase them up, Ross. You can't. Yeah, you can't. You can't raise the price. That's not how we work. If you saw that piece of jewellery in any jewellers, it's not going to be forty pounds. No, is it? well over a hundred pounds. Well over, but probably double. Probably, yeah, I agree. Yeah, honestly, the um, the stones are exceptional quality. Every single set, I couldn't fault. There was no faults with any of them. They were beautiful. I loved them, all of them. And tanzanite. I mean, have yeah. you ever seen tanzanite at less than two hundred pounds elsewhere? I very rarely work with it, but it's. It won my heart. It yeah, really it's did lovely, working isn't with it? it. Yeah, that colour was oh, just lush. That's my favourite. Yeah, I know. We all know that that tans. Well, any of these, but we all know that that is not a thirty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence piece of jewellery, or the Sleeping Beauty turquoise. We know that the gemstones mined out. It's gone over a decade ago. On pre-order, those are the two. Well, three really, isn't it? It's tanzanite. Sleeping Beauty and the Opal, they're the ones that are flying because you're all recognising that that's so wrong it, yeah. <laughs> in terms of its price point. <laughs> so I would encourage you shopping ahead. Peridot, also big news in the Peridot market. Yes. 
and they, it's crystal clear again absolutely beautiful that's my birthstone is it you're yeah, nervous baby i am yeah it's that lush vibrant grass green do you know when i was younger i never used to like it but then as you get older and you see it more and more and you and you realize the value of of peridot it's just it captures you doesn't it yeah I it's love a it. very perfect for today rubbish weather outside yeah it always looks amazing spring green love yeah it. that's what i was about love to say it. i love that about peridot whatever the light conditions it looks amazing oh yeah absolutely amazing okay well well there's nothing you can do ross where do you start he says well, you've got to start at thirty nine ninety nine. Oh, which piece? Right, okay. I reckon start with something like the Tanzanite Sleeping Beauty or your Opal, <laughs> because they are going to sell out. Get get it, get it done, like a band aid. Whip it off. Do it quick. Yeah, it's gonna. Don't put it off any longer. Let's start with the Sleeping Beauty turquoise, which is what you're going to be demonstrating with. Um. <laughs> Okay, these are the three that we're going to be starting with, jewellery makers. They're on the web right now. Um, shop ahead because, I mean, the, look, it's $39.99 on the website straight away. So with the Sleeping Beauty, um, you have that beautiful five-petal flower. Again, with the zircon, not cubic zirconia in the centre. And then look how perfectly colour matched those Sleeping Beauty turquoise are. Um, again, I was following the team as they were over in Tucson. I know they, they made a beeline for... Um, you remember the gentleman I told you that I was holding a Sleeping Beauty turquoise orb? Um, and it was like £6,000. <laughs> it was £6,000 for one Sleeping Beauty turquoise. Whoa. Yeah, and I have to tell you, look no different to what I'm seeing here. It's an expensive stone because everybody wants Sleeping Beauty turquoise. It's like the pinnacle, if you like, um, in the turquoise world. But it's all but mined out. We're going to start with this. That's Clock to Graphics, jewellery makers. Good luck. How many have we got, Roscoe? Have we? So we haven't just... We've messed up big then. Oh, I'm glad I'm not you. <laughs> There's a hundred available. They're immaculate, those stones. Honestly, they're beautiful. Perfect robin yeah. egg blue. Definitely. Uninterrupted matrix. Polished beautifully. Oh, yeah. my goodness me. The, the, the silver, okay, at $39.99. I could oh, get yeah. that. I could justify that. Yeah. Not the parcel of Sleeping Beauty no. turquoise. Do you know what I mean? In fact, I'm fairly sure I've done showcases of Sleeping Beauty Turquoise where you've had a parcel like this for more than once on your screens right now. Um, it is a silly price, I totally agree. But you know how Jewelry Maker works, regular viewers. We don't just bring graphics to air and stay there, do we? We will go lower. You're joking. When we bring, the reason why we sort of start at a higher price tag it's usually like recommended retail price. What you might be able to yeah. find it elsewhere. Maybe. And 80 pounds would have been amazing. I don't think you'd find Sleeping no, Beauty Turquoise for 80 pounds. 40 pounds, no way. You wouldn't find Sleeping Beauty Turquoise cabochons, I don't believe anyway, for that price elsewhere. I don't believe, I might be wrong, I happen to be proved wrong, but I don't believe so. You certainly wouldn't find the end finished piece of jewelry anywhere near that price tag, but, you know how it works here at Jewelry Maker. We're not stopping there. We have 100 available. In 2012, this this location, not turquoise. Turquoise is found all around the world. But the, the iconic mine that is Sleeping Beauty Turquoise in Arizona closed its gates. Because it was mined out. In what, sorry, in a minute's time, we have 100. And that's why we're taking to, it to this next price. Uh, do you know what, Dare I think people are going to multi-buy on this, Charlie. Oh, do you know, I hope they do because they'll, they won't be disappointed. And again, I'm really sorry. They're great practice pieces. They are. I know they're beautiful, but um, they're, they're just, they're, it's the gift that keeps giving. It's very stunning. And I can I just point out, I know it's a really small detail, but just look at the bale. Yeah. It's not often you get detailed bales, and that just adds to the floral. It's like a fleur de lis, like yes, design, isn't it? Yes, it's beautiful, and it's solid. Yeah. You know, it's not flimsy. None of it is. It's, no. it's very robust. To say it's quite a dainty piece, and the stones just pop. That's why I'm demonstrating the turquoise, actually, because it's my daughter's birthday, and she says, she says you have to do the turquoise, Mum. Oh, like, oh of there I you do. go. Of course there I do. you go. She's got her eye on this one. Oh. Everybody will pay that final low price tag, jewellery makers. The phone lines are about to go crazy. 
Really? It, yeah, even even director Adam, who said, his reaction was, oh. oh. <laughs> you thought 30 pounds for the Sleeping Beauty? Yeah, absolutely. It's because of the quantity, says Ross. And that, yeah. It's a big, round, brilliant cut zircon in the yeah, centre. Yeah, good size. We turn its side profile so you can see that investment of precious metal as well, both in the bale and in the actual setting. Look at look look at the angles, so it's going to sit beautifully on the decolletage oh, as yeah. well. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness me. The mount. Let's say let's say that oh, it's not going to be ten pounds though. Look at the size of the zircon. But let's say it is. And then you're getting your Sleeping Beauty turquoise. Two pounds each. It's it is ridiculous. It's, yeah, it's bonkers. I don't know how you do it. Um, we often will exchange gemstones that we own, like like the, 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 the Gemporia own the mine of, so we can do it that way. Oh. Um, I know that's how we source a lot of our Sleeping Beauty turquoise. Like for example, if we'll exchange Moroccan amethyst or some of those gemstones. However, or maybe we've got I don't know. We might have some Mogok ruby. We'll exchange four other gemstones. Oh, okay. um, we used to go direct to the mine way back when, but obviously we can't. I think there's a picture, there's a photograph of our founder Steve um, back round about I think it was 20, uh, 2010 um, just before the mine's closure when I went over to Arizona a couple of years ago we were like oh should we go to the Sleeping Beauty mine then we are like no it's miles away because you think you're in Arizona it's, it's only going to be around be there. it's not it's miles away and what's the point there's, <laughs> there's literally a closed gate closed gate stay where you are on those phone lines everybody um wow 19 pounds and 99 pence we have 100 i'll keep you updated and you can shop ahead on the other projects as well all come with charlie's written instructions too so charlie take mm. it away thank you very much okay so what i'm going to do is talk to you about the points because i know people don't like the pointy ends so you've got your teardrop points and you've got your marquee's points so i just thought if we talk about that a little bit um it might ease your nerves about it so what i've done is i've just mocked up a bigger setting so i can show you how to figure out how much material you might need to remove some i did some i didn't um so if i just show you with this setting that i've made obviously when you put your stone over the top we'll take that one off Mm -hmm. and you can see that your uh, prongs are going to be in the way obviously you can tip them out of the way if you haven't got any um, can you see that if you haven't moved your prongs out of the way you know you're not going to be able to get that into your setting so just a quick tip on that turn obviously this this floral one turn it over and have a look from underneath and when you place your stone over the top we'll let go of that one you place it over the top you'll be able to see just how much material you need to remove and it's quite it's quite tricky isn't it? it's quite small I should have made a way bigger one um, so really what you're trying to do is replicate the shape and the tip of that stone into the prong now if you haven't got a hand piece you can actually do this with just one of those little pin vices so you can do it's going to take you longer don't get me wrong it will take you a little while so i i personally use my hand piece but you can use it without so when you come to shaping your uh, prong where your tip is you may look and you may already have a notch and then when you pull your prongs backwards to get your stone in, you might think oh that still looks a little bit snug so i would just check out your uh, shape of the tip on the back of your setting so flip it over and you can use your little round burrs if you pick some of those up and you're just going to i'll show you on the bigger one because you'll be able to see it better you're going to remove the metal inside that prong so just in that little gap i could do with some skinnier fingers couldn't i so you're going straight in and what you're going to do is you're going to go across the prong that way and then if you need a little bit more swap over to a drill bit so drill bit has a pointy end already so that that drill bit there is going to go straight into the center of that little burr hole you've made and just keep twilling it remove your metal remove your metal and all those tiny little shavings that come off tap them out brush them to one side put them in your pot it's not waste it's your savings and then when you've made those alterations oh you've pinched me pliers sorry bear with me 
Hang on. Wait. Oh, did I? I've got one of these. You got one of the I new bags. I got one of these. I got one of these. There I, you go. I wish I had that yesterday. So let me just pop into my new bag and go, grab a set, different set of pliers. Because you pinch mine. Did I d pinch yours? Yeah. Oh, we'll give it's those back. It's all right. It's all right. Don't there worry about over it. There. So when you come to moving your prongs, I'll show you on the big one, just because it's easier to see. Rather than pinching like you would usually when you're gripping something, really you kind of want to just lean and pull it back just just enough. It doesn't. Mm. It's only a slight bit. So you'll lean your prongs back on your little settings. And everything, I quite like the idea of buying a few of them and mixing up the stones. You know, if you've got, so obviously, I have the peridot for mine and my daughter has the turquoise for her, but I wouldn't mind doing like a full set. My mum, maybe we can request other stones. Or your birthstones. Yeah, yeah, and just like, a, almost like a family tree in one pendant. So it just pops in that easy, mm -hmm. super easy. And it just makes sure your little pointy tip is in the hole that you've created. If it's slightly off, it's just going to fall out. So you've got to make sure that it's perfectly lined up. And I'm on a chock of wood because it won't mar anything. Um, and if you really, really want to be super careful with your work, you can always tape up the back. But when you're starting with these projects, because there's a bale on it, leave that one till last. It's a bit tricky. I do that one first, but that's because I've got lots of practice under my belt. But if you are new to it, avoid that. And the way you set that one, it's just on the very edge uh -huh. and you just hang the bale off. You don't have to worry about taking it off. Just give yourself a little edge. I'm just going to turn the angle, I'm sorry. That's right. So if you've got your gem kit, you can. there is a prong pusher. I didn't use the prong pusher on this one just because it's the prongs are quite small. You can turn it on its side and push that way. But I quite like these little pushers. And just grip either side of your work and all it is is a very gentle push don't go all the way first because as you see it i've pushed and that's moved my stone so i need to make sure that we don't move it anymore and push again and it's in do another one i'm going to show you a trick how to show off in a second push in okay push in okay and i'm going to do a little bit more on that side okay right if you want to show off get yourself a set of beading tools now these things i absolutely love these <coughs> i'll have to take this off i didn't want it to fall out um when we come to doing some other settings later down the road i will recommend you getting two sets so i've just got this little mini one here pick the right size i'm guessing it's one of those and just check i'm not going to put it in the handle and check your sizing no that's too small so i need to go bigger than that i'll pick that one Oh yeah, that's a great size. Now, if you pick a, a beading tool that's slightly too small, what you'll do is, is you'll get bruising under your prong. So really want to avoid that. But to get a high-end finish that your fellow makers may skip past, this will set you apart from them. And you're going to use that beading tool on the very tip. You're just going to give it a little, little burnish. And what that does is, is it closes it down more on the stone and it makes it super shiny without using any polishing and it is literally that simple ah you're almost fanning it out yes that's right and just spreading the metal okay. so it goes close and the thing is when you do that uh it stops it stops snagging so if you've got a fluffy jumper oh, on or your hair and you things, can literally see which ones you've done yeah it's great isn't it yeah aren't they beautiful and i'm not kidding it is that easy so with my, I had a bit of a, I had some that already had the round set and I had some that weren't set. Mm -hmm. So with those ones, set your centre stone first. And again, with your prongs, oh look, that one's come out. I've not set that one, so let's do that one again. Um, when you, let's just have a look, let's do that a bit tighter. So hook it in with the tip first, use your nail to get it back in there and make sure it's straight. Okay, do that again. I would definitely recommend you having bigger eyes. You know, the... Um, <laughs> the, the magnifying. Yes, that's what I'm looking for. Yeah. So we you have can get those closer. sometimes. Sometimes, you don't have them often, do you? Look, they're bouncing around in the settings now. Let's go like, This is what goes back to what you were saying. <laughs> <laughs> this goes back to what you were saying. 
Sometimes it's all right. Just breathe. Yeah, this walk is, yeah. away. Don't get cross. Yeah. Don't get cross. It's not worth it. But yeah. and again, with the Sleeping Beauty, you want to be really careful. Yeah. Just because it's special, isn't it? I used to watch uh, um, uh, the gentleman in the workshop that um, <laughs> I worked at, and he used to do regular repairs, etc. And he used to spend ages gem setting. <laughs> Ages. Get off. We're expecting you to do this in a matter of ten minutes, but I used On a to watch wood. him. Yeah, I used to watch him, and he'd spend ages trying to set those stones. So it isn't a, it isn't a quick make. No, but it comes to work as well. I yeah. can't, it's too far away from me, so it's quite hard to see how tight you've gotten them. So we'll we'll go back and we'll do it again. Well, I tell you what, whilst you're doing that, yeah. just to ease the pressure, yeah. we do, we'll, do, we'll do another kit, shall we? So Let's we'll do it. swap over the graphics whilst Charlie's doing that. Let's do it. In fact, we've got to do it. Let's bring the opal because um, this is proving to be very popular on pre orders for obvious reason. Um, this is what? No. With the stem, so you actually, yeah, love that, absolutely love that. Whether you choose to use those two jump rings, you have that opportunity, um, or whether you choose to remove it like uh, uh, Charlie's Tanzanite pendant, it's entirely up to you. Um, but again, look at the quality, they're sensational opals, aren't they? Um, Charlie's favorite gemstone. And of course, it's not a gem that actually has uh, um, a crystal structure as such. Um, it's made up of water, basically. Yes. Silica, um, depending on how perfect those silica spheres are actually positioned, um, equates to how much play of color that you get. When they're lined up almost like little soldiers, that's when you see the flashes of colors on your screens right now. Certain colors are rarer than others, red being the one. Yes. Um, because it has to, the, the light has to travel that much further. You also get what, sorry? You also have the zircon in the center there um, that, for you to set. How beautiful. So this has the stem, all depending on which design you love the most. Again, give it a try. Just a bit of patience. It's basically yeah. a gentle rocking motion. It's not It's not a quick make. No. It's not a quick easy no, make. It's not to. one of those. No, you've got to take your time with these things. Yeah. Now, do you know what we're going to do, Charlie? You're going to do you something. You get the instructions as well, because that's applicable to all of them. Oh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Charlie, we're going to go lower. For the parcel of Ethiopian opal alone, right? I prefer, dare I say it? I prefer Ethiopian opal. Oh, yeah, I know me too. Yeah, it's yeah, because you too. don't. It's not opaque. You get the play of colour all the way through, not just on the surface. Yes, I love Ethiopian opal. Yeah. Now, and the days of it being in the shadows of Australian opal are long gone. Long, long gone. We are going to go lower. Have you got quantity? Is that why, Roscoe? Yes. We've got quantity. You've got to remember you get the written instructions, which is there for you to keep. It's not just watch once. Oh, you yeah. can print it off. That's there for you to keep moving forward. So it's a constant reference. Some places, and by the way, we have the gem setting tools as well oh. if you are looking to start on, on your gem setting journey. So don't worry, you've got that as well. Get your kits. Sorry, projects. Oh, I know, um, I keep doing that too. I know, it takes some, it's going to take yeah. us ages to actually sort of break the habit. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah. So you have your projects, you have the written instructions, and we've got the tools coming up too. £19.99 pence only. Oh my goodness me. It's definitely not a £20 piece of jewellery. 100% no. They're open back settings, so that's really going to allow all the light in. So you're oh, going to see all amazing. the different colours from all the different angles. So beautiful. So, so beautiful. I love the stem. I know, I like that too. Adds a little feature, doesn't it? It does. So, and again, Mother's Day's around the corner. I know. Mother's I Day, know. Valentine's Day. I'd, I'd much rather have a flower like that than a flower in a vase. And Absolutely. they are beautiful. Absolutely. But... Absolutely. It's the one day I always say to my husband, don't buy me flowers. Yeah, I know. Don't buy me flowers on Valentine's Day or Mother's Day. They're so expensive. Yeah. Have one that lasts forever. Uh, 19 .99. again, loads of you getting involved, jewelry makers. We've got the tools. In fact, you can just about see them peeking at the side of the screen there. Um, it's a tool roll. Oh, the this one. Wait, wait, wait. Here it is. I don't want to... It's uh -huh. half. Oh, oh there you've you go. got one, you've got one, you've there got one. There you go. So we've got the tool roll coming up as well. You'll be able to get hold of this if you if you are just starting. And that's all you need, isn't it? Oh yeah. I mean you don't this this the beading the beading tool thing's just showing off. I mean you don't need it. 
you know you can do it with basic pliers if you wanted to but this kit is a wise investment moving forward definitely definitely um so get hold of your ethiopian opal jewelry makers precious metal and you've also got your beautiful zirk on there in the center it's absolutely flying we haven't seen opal in a very long time or i haven't i don't know about carol but i haven't no. seen it in a long time um, again, this price point is purely down to the fact that you actually have a big quantity. Um, back to you, lovely, if you're good. That is, is that simple. Literally, just, is that just simple. Take your time. When you come to, um, so a couple of them had the stone already in. I think that was just by mistake. Um, they so just found their way. Yeah, they just found their way in. Um, but with the other ones, am I, can I pinch one of those? Am I allowed to have one of those? Of course you can. Yeah. yeah. Can I yeah. lean it over? So I'll pinch another one. So when the, oh, let's see, there's a stone in this one. Let's pick one that hasn't got a stone. Oh, there you go. So it's the Marquise ones. Yeah. So you obviously got your points and the, and it's and it's hollow. Um, so you, you've got that empty space where the light travels through. Where you've got your uh, center stone. If that's not quite, if you're not quite getting your stone in, let's pinch your stone. Let's make that sticky quick. quick Do you want quick. some of these? Yeah. Yeah. Let's have a tiny one. Scoop. Thank you. There you go. So when you have, I can't have long nails like you. They look so beautiful, but they're so not well, practical too, for me. They're too long <laughs> at the moment. So just assess your size first. Puppy stone over the uh, setting. Okay, and I can see that I need to remove just a hair, just a hair. Um, and when you assess your stone, just look all the way around. You know, don't just look straight down on it. You need to have it eye height, really, if okay. you can. And move all the way around and just assess just how much you need to take away. And some of them, you may not even need to take it away. You may just simply need to nudge it out of the way. So if we, uh, oh, my other little pliers are over there. Oh, here you are, we can get them, I'll oh. get them. Okay. One sec, Adam. Sorry. I'll go, because as I borrowed them, Quick run. There you go. <laughs> Thank you. Right. So again, rather than pinching, you're just leaning and you want to be gentle with the center setting. Mm -hmm. So I'm just going to hold it and you're just going to tease it out of the way. And you go all the way around, enough to drop your stone in. And then when you've dropped your stone, you start with the center stone because when you come to your marquise settings so we'll just bounce back to the other one i made where's that really what you want to do is just lean out the outer prong with the marquise try not to mess too much with the center prongs because that one's got your, your round stone set in place so we'll pretend like that one's set in and you pop your stone in and it needs to have the tip in first and because we've moved out the other prong, it should just slot in. One second, I think it's the wrong way around. My finger's in the way for everyone, I'm sorry. Don't worry, it's not, not a problem, we can see. There we go, so it's in. And just make sure it's sitting straight and it's all nice and neat and tidy. And then when you push that last prong over, let's use the pusher. All you're going to do is lock it in place. Now, if you find, now that stone's in now, if you find that these claws are too high, you can remove them with those. I haven't brought it with me, but um, you used to do those cut burrs, but it's like a twiddly yeah. one, a handheld one. You can yeah. get them as burrs as well for your hand paste. And you can literally just snip that bit off and give it a little twiddle and use your little beading tools because you'll have quite a flat look. If you use your beading tools and do your little swishy, swishy, swishy with it, it'll round off the edges and it'll give you a nice tidy finish. Oh, that's amazing. Thank, Thank you, Charlie. You. Top tip. It's <laughs> Top tip. It's quite a tricky thing to do here for you. Because, because you're doing it arm's distance, that's arm's why. Distance, it's, very, it's very tiny different. Tiny pieces, you yeah. know, but yeah. they are very, very, once you've got the hang of it, very easy to do. Oh, bless you. Have a go. That's the thing. Now, the most popular on pre-order, no surprise, is Tanzanite. Yeah, it's lush. It's There's just something about that. We're going to do what? You No, Tanzanite has to be a higher price tag. It's a one location on Gemstone Roscoe. You know, this is gem quality, Tanzanite. You can see that. You're brilliant. You've got, you know, we don't grade here at Jewelry Maker only because it would accelerate your price tag, mm. effectively. Mm. And each one would have to be individually graded. 
you can look i always say kneel on lean on your own knowledge you know that's gem quality don't you oh yeah it's vanadium rich oh, yeah. you've got that wonderful iconic sort of violet blue we're going to take this under 20 pounds as well regardless just because ross doesn't like you know throwing curveballs in amongst uh, projects prices do you do you ross it's not how you roll um not how he rolls have we got the same quantity of this oh <gasps> there is a sorry 70 there's 70 available i mean the gemstone of new beginnings december's birthstone often the gem gifted to, to, to an expecting mother 19 pounds and 99 pence only for tan tonight i challenge anyone to find tan tonight for 20 quid elsewhere. well you're not gonna are you are there our sister channel that might do yeah. it might mm, i don't know maybe Even then, mm. oh really adam's just saying no no 20 quid no don't be silly and isn't the marfon setting it yourself yes it's an achievement isn't it that i agree but, mm, yeah you think this if, if this was on a high street jeweler with zircon ross is saying and tans and i i think it'd be pushing the four figures he's saying i agree easy I agree. I remember I got quite friendly with one of our local jewellers. They've um, the shop's closed now, not because they went out of business. They're very successful, but they actually went um, into retirement. Oh. And I got really friendly with the owners. And I remember talking to her, and she had only about three tanzanite pieces. Little family-owned jewellers, three tanzanite pieces. I was like, you need to put your prices up on your tanzanite. It's yeah. far too cheap. Yeah. And she's like, oh, really? you know, and and they were still far more expensive by the way but they're different to us jewelers you know jewelers have got massive overheads and they're uh, lucky if they sell one or two pieces that's the thing that's we can bring them to you at 20 pounds because we have 70 of them and all 70 of them will go today amazing absolutely amazing don't forget you get the written instructions as well with your project and also don't forget we've got the actual gem setting tool roll um to bring you as well oh, i'll tell you what it's a sound investment it really is i mean 20 pounds you think valentine's day around the corner what does 20 pound buy you a single rose does it i don't know mm, not much does that but no one's going to look at that and think oh 20 quid and definitely ever. not never definitely not i agree adam's just said i don't get the whole single rose thing yeah no i don't either no me no what do you do with it just one in a jar yeah i, yeah, I don't know in the mouth <laughs> In between your teeth, he says, then he gets it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, fair enough. You'd have to take the thorns off, though, uh, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, <laughs> let's do what, sorry? The tourmaline. Sorry, Roscoe, I'm having problems hearing you this morning. Yeah, I'm, I'm struggling. Yeah. Quiet. Um, here we go. There you are. Let's do the tourmaline. Ah, oh, the beautiful gemstone that fell through a rainbow, and that's how it got all those lovely colours. How amazing, you've got your cognacs, you've got your beautiful greens, you've got your reds, all totally natural. And I have to say, tourmaline is a type three gemstone, so we should expect inclusions. However, amazing clarity. Yeah, they are absolutely stunning. And very popular at tourmaline, isn't it? Very popular. Mm. Uh, yeah, I remember looking at our gem buying guide recently, and you're looking about $350, um, $400 per carat. Ooh. Per carat. And that's just for the kind of mediocre grade. Right. Um, which I would say this is definitely not mediocre. It's sparkle there. You've got your zircon in the centre there as well. Back to the sort of Van Cleef and Arpels, um, sort of five petal flower uh, design. Amazing. You've seen the master demo in the studio. It's quite autumnal. Isn't it? Oh, it is actually. Yeah, I quite like that. Um, almost like amber with a variation of yes. colours. I do like that. Uh, that's why I didn't know what it was. It baffled me a little. Initially, I thought it was sapphire, and that's yeah. because of the cl clarity of them. Well done. Beautiful tourmaline. Rarely see tourmaline, actually. <gasps> why, have you got, why is this lower? Why is this one even lower? You've got chrome tourmaline in there. Amazing. Chrome tourmaline, normally, well, very rare. It's one of the rarer colours alongside your uh, um, sort of indicolites and your parabas and your, um, what's what I'm thinking of? Rubelite. There we go. Thank you. Uh, £16.99. Well done, everybody. Uh, Sarah, Cheshire, Jean, new customers get involved. Uh, but make sure you're checking out your baskets. You also get the, or your gem setting instructions, which I will be down uh, printing off. I mean, if you Put want a little to jiffy be... plastic sleeve. Oh, yeah. 
Do you know, my nana used to do that with her knitting patterns. Yeah. I used to love flicking through yeah. that book. So how cool is that? You can flick through your progression. Oh, it's like a catalogue of how you've developed your skills over time. Absolutely. I, we were talking about this the other day when I first uh, spoke about these instructions. I was like, I remember my mum, she, she used to subscribe to a dessert like kind of like um, a Reader's Digest sort of yeah, thing. Yeah, every, yeah, yeah. And every month she'd get a new recipe yeah. that went in her ring binder. It was called Sweet Sensations. Oh. I used to love those. Oh, that's lovely. Love it. You could do it with your jewellery making, couldn't that's you? That's it. And the it start, tells a story, doesn't it? It certainly does. Um, and then you can always reference it if ever you, if you don't forget a certain technique. Yeah. Now, in 30 seconds, this is the last of your projects, jewellery makers, in your beautiful Chiang Mai Peridot. In a sense, you've got Cambodian, natural Cambodian zircon. Love it. Think spring and summertime is on the horizon, isn't it? Little daffs are starting to poke up. Oh, I can't wait for that. My favourite season of the year. They're coming up, aren't they? Fritillas will be yeah. here soon. Absolutely. Little I love heads. spring. Yeah, it's just I love positive, spring. isn't it? Oh, really you need it after winter, season. don't you? And I think this gemstone just epitome is the epitome of spring and summer. £14.99 pence only. Wait a minute. So hang on, I can get a Tanzanite and a Peridot, say, £35. Oh, yeah. Cheap as chips almost, isn't it? Sleeping it's, Beauty it's... Turquoise. Are, yeah, they're affordable for you to get multiples of these projects. Yeah, I, that's, that's what I like. I like the idea of mixing the stones up. Mixing I do. I, think, I just think it's, it's like a family tree, isn't it? You could have everybody on there. Well, of you could have five you, of you. <laughs> of which you have got birthstones, tourmaline, yeah, yeah. birthstone, Peridot, yeah. birthstone. Tanzanite birthstone, uh, turquoise birthstone. Is opal a birthstone? I don't opal know. Opal birthstone. Be. They're all birthstones. Oh, amazing! Well, there you go. There you go. October. Oh, is it? October ah. babies. There you go. Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence only to get hold of the beautiful Chiang Mai Peridot, which is natural. Do you know this forms 55 miles beneath the Earth's surface? You taught me that. I, could, I couldn't believe that. It's amazing, isn't it? I couldn't it? believe it. Alongside diamonds. It's just, um, They're pals. Oh, are they? Yeah, they find their way oh, up to the surface like together. <laughs> there you go. So, yeah, best of pals. Amazing when you consider all the intensities mm. that this gemstone has actually uh, uh, formed under. It's quite fascinating, uh, really. It isn't is. It? Yeah, yeah, and it's I natural. You don't get that anywhere else, do you? No, you really the don't. Knowledge. And where um, would you buy a Peridot pendant for £15? Well, it ain't going to be the supermarket, is it? No, definitely not. You'd be hard put to get that bunch of flowers that we've been referencing. Well done, everybody. Make sure you're checking up your uh, gem setting roll is coming up as well. Very professional, I have to say. Should we do it now? Oh, in fact. Go on. So in this, in the, in here, so this afternoon um, with the other, the other projects we've got, I've opened and closed my settings loads of times just to show my family just how easy it was. In here you've got your um, prong pliers and you use them to ease your claw back out and you are, it'll be an invaluable tool for you, especially if like you had a minute like me just then and it wasn't quite perfect. You can pull your claw back with these, with these pliers so then oh. you can take the stone back out and do it again. So it's a very, and the uh, pliers alone are quite expensive. Are just they? on their own. If you were to buy them individually. Well, oh, yeah. So, so what, twenty nine ninety nine? Oh, easy. Yeah. Well, Pl expensive pliers are expensive, aren't they? Yeah. So, yeah, and they're specialist. It's a specialist tool. Well, you get the pliers. These are the ones that you're referencing mm -hmm. right now. So you get these. Here we go. With the with the comfort grip handle. And they're kind of like um like a, almost like a turtle's mouth. They kind oh, of yeah, turtle, yeah. Yeah, they're kind of little pinched. Pinched, yes, yeah. perfect. Can you see where I'm coming from? Um, then you've got the pusher. Then you've got a different pusher. What's, what's the difference between the two? Okay, one's, um, I go back to that one, so that's your prong pusher. So it'll have a groove inside. There's so if you've got like, let's say for example, a solitaire ring, you can use that to push your, cl uh, your claws over. Okay. And then the other pusher, I actually use that more than anything else. Okay. Yeah, it's I guess handy. You, you can use it for your bezels, your prongs. What, what other kind of settings do we have? It's, um, they're very universal. And the ones with grooves, you can still use them on the shorter prongs, just turn it on its side. Okay. So rather than the prongs sitting in that, in that groove, turn it round and just push and it just it, honestly it, I made it look quite tricky there free floating but it's really straightforward 
Wow. Well, there we go. I mean, you'll find your you'll find your feet, won't you? Just keep practicing with them, oh, I guess. Yeah. Then you've got this little gadget. Bezel rocket. Bezel rocket, lovely. Then you've got this little gadget. Burnisher. Burnisher. Straight, yeah, straight burnisher. These are really good quality. So when you get them from elsewhere, their edges are really sharp, whereas they're rounded with these ones. Oh, so they're immaculately perfect. presented, ready to go. And it comes in your uh, in your wrap, effectively. So you're getting what one, two, three, four, five, six tools, and of course the case. And you can fit more in it as well. Yeah, fourteen ninety nine. Bonkers. It is bonkers. bonkers very professional it's so a again, wise investment moving forward it, it is even if you're thinking i want to do gem setting mm -hmm. by the way these are not regularly on our show no folks so get no. them when you get the opportunity um so it just rolls up it's called a jewelry jeweler's roll isn't it it is there you go tie it all up all your um all your tools are safe inside there for when you do your next gem setting it looks very professional when you bring that out your bag doesn't it it totally does and just do that little flick of the roll do you know what? i need to get some of these because i've noticed a few of my stones in my existing jewelry are getting a bit loose oh great idea yeah so just actually just repair them. them yeah yeah well that's expensive taking your taking your jewelry to a isn't a it just yeah very that's that's their bread and butter actually to be fair yeah that's what i do most of is it repairs yeah, yeah. Um, hello to you, Gloria in Staffordshire saying, morning both. I got this last time, top piece of oh, kit. Good girl. It is. It is a top, I, I need to get one of these. It's, it's a wise investment. You know when you can start hearing a stone just rattling ever oh, so slightly? And I'm, it. I'm worried to wear it then. Yeah, well that's it, you've got to fix it straight away because yeah. it will get lost. It yeah, will. definitely. Um, amazing, well done everybody. 14 99 isn't that fantastic? Um, Okie dokie, now, shall we, what time are we on? A bundle of chains. Yes. Spools, did you say? Spools, Spools of them. Of you chains. don't get all three though, do you? Yes, you do, you do, he says, you do. You get all, you get all three. How amazing. All three, one amazing price. I could have done with them when they sent me the projects out. Yeah. Wouldn't they have been lovelier with those? They would have been perfect. So firstly, a spool of your paperclip chain. I really like that. That's the hottest trend in yeah. chains at the moment. A spool, sorry, I enjoy saying uh, that. Yeah, word. it's a good word. It's a good word, isn't it? Of your curb chain. And then you have another spool of your cable chain. Three meters in total. Oh, really? Yeah, and this is going to be perfect with your deal of the day as well. Oh, yeah. Three meters, solid 925 sterling silver. I get with those ends that we had this morning. You know, oh, ingenious were, ends, yes. Such a, a, a clever idea. You could work them with those. You can solder them, mm. but you don't have to solder nope. them to work with these. No. Nope. In fact, each of these chains, I think I tested the theory when I launched them, you can even put something like a featherweight head pin through oh, the link and yeah, just wrap yeah. loop a, a, oh, a clasp yeah, on directly. Mm. They're super shiny. They're very well made, aren't they? Yeah, solid 925, nothing's wasted. Again, speaking of your sort of jewellers' workshops, this is how they create their pieces yeah. of jewellery. It's not, they don't buy, well, I don't say they don't, most jeweller workshops actually do it by the spool. It's handy, yeah, it's very handy. And then you can change up what you put on it, can't you? Absolutely. It's not decided for you. And you can customise <clears throat> it to the yes. sort of length and size. Um, how many have we got then, Roscoe? 50 available opportunities, solid 925 sterling silver. So, sorry, this is just my, my inner OCD is just, this is driving me crazy, not having that one laid down as well. 53, exactly. Well, there ain't any left for me, is that? Uh, <laughs> I'm so slow compared to you guys. Well, uh, let's hope there is, because I know this is an amazing deal. I know it's an absolutely amazing deal. Again, you can customise it. Um, we're at... £30 per metre of 925 sterling silver just for starters. Again, a big investment of your sterling silver. You get a metre, because I remember when I launched these, um, they were hung over the sort of the, the display. Um, but we were saying on the graphics, it's like, oh, one metre. So you almost assume it's a metre across the three links. It's not, it's a metre each. Per Be spool? Per, yeah, a yeah. metre per spool, Amazing. absolutely. So three metres in total. And I remember us being actually shocked that it was three metres for the price that we take it to. How about £10 per spool? The biggest auction, I know I've said this at the time, 
Nine grams of precious metal. The biggest auction in terms of quantity that I've done here at Jewelry Maker was 2,000, and it was a metre length of chain, and it was more than that. Sterling. It was more than Sterling. 10 pounds per metre. Yeah, it's not base metal. No. That's nine grams of precious metal. Oh. Nine grams. That, that is quite a spectacular deal, isn't it? It really is. You would, you'd be struggle to get an 18 inch chain, wouldn't you, for oh, 10 yeah. pounds elsewhere? You yeah. genuinely would struggle. Yeah, yeah. Um, you can make two 18 inch chains and a bracelet out yeah. of one one metre. And if you've got any leftovers, you can just use them as little, little uh, earrings. Yeah. yeah. Nice. Oh, that'd be so cute, wouldn't Tassels. it? Tassels. Yes. The paper yes. clip on its own, I think, would be amazing at 29 dollars Yeah, well, that's very trendy, so that should be a lot more. Well, it, if you look at someone be. like Monica Veneda, yeah. you can get an 18 inch paper clip chain from her and it's hundred pounds. And it's probably lighter. I've seen that chain. It is very fine, actually. Really, really. So it's one of those that it doesn't hang. Does that oh, make sense? Okay. Yeah. It needs more of the gram weight there. Right. Um, this one would, you can see the investment. 10 pound per spool, Sharon, Donna, Conway, Elvina, Sarah, D, Sheila, Kay, Pauline. Hello, Gerda. Hello to you, Sonika. Hello to you, Swansea, and Marion and Pam. Uh, make sure you check it out, everybody. I've got a lovely little space of bee bundle coming up as well next. Um, we've got 100 of them. Okay, amazing. So make sure you check out. Keep on dialing through. Don't abandon your calls. Stay where you are. Speak to our contact centre to get hold of your chains. I'm getting some of them. You're getting some of them. Uh, yeah, I need, yeah. Some I need some chain because you've used the last of what I had on this. Oh, there you go. <laughs> there you go. Definitely to get hold of that then. Right. How about these? I'm going to tip them out as one because there's different designs here. Starting off, this is a spacer bead shape that I've not seen previously before. Almost like little hexagons. Can you see? Like irregular shapes. They're cool, aren't they? Um, then, your stardust. But they're diamond cut stardust. Then... Mm. Again, diamond cut. They're lovely, aren't they? They are very nice. Then, look at the amount of sterling silver in these. Your cubes. Those are cool. They're very aren't cool. They? Like those. I'd love to put a letter on those. Oh yeah, you yeah. could. You could engrave or stamp, couldn't you? Then, I like this shape. You have ah oh. these. They're like faceted cubes. Is that right? Yeah, 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 kind of like irregular shaped. Mm. You get all of these in this bundle. Now, I will tell you, I think I'm right in saying that this was a previous deal of the day. Um, with Wayne, what is when Wayne was producing, wasn't it? Because, Roscoe, you were um, off. And I know that Wayne took it to a silly, silly, silly price. Um, Ross is just saying, I tell you what, I've just looked, and for this amount of sterling silver, first price crash, how about £1 each? One pound each per sterling silver spacer. The next price crash, Ross says, I'll be honest, I'll show you where I'd have closed these. It's 925 sterling silver. He says, I don't know anything about the price. I don't know how much they were bought, but what he would predict would be about here, the next price crash. So yeah, I mean, obviously Ross will bring you the deals if he knows there's a deal to be given. However, if he was to guess, he said, I would have said $24.99. And, and happily closed there. You've got just shy of three grams of sterling silver. You've got, what, one, two, three, four, five different designs. So you haven't got to buy five separate yeah. bundles. Five different designs, of which you get quantities of two. That's your three, you've got multiple three millimeters. You've got four millimeters, five designs, 50 pieces in total. The next price crash is Wayne's price. Ross says, trust me, you'll want to get involved on this one. I can't remember now you've said it. I can't remember. Stop the clock, says Ross. There's nowhere near enough people on the phone lines. He says, I'm going to shock you. <laughs> We're at 50p per sterling silver spacer. Um, and Ross is saying, he thinks, I'm repeating now, that lots of you are expecting 19.99. Before, you, before an, a single other tick on the clock, can I just say, we used to sell packs of 10 three mm. millimeter spacer beads for 14.99. Yeah, I used to buy them. Yeah. Mm. Funnily enough, today, we're about to take 50 
to that same price. And they're not just your plain simple rounds no. that I, we used to buy back in the day. Yeah, no, they're, they're exceptional. The, these ones are super sparkly. Very sparkly. And they? They catch the light like nothing else. I mean, if we were bringing that pack of 10 right there for 14 99 that's amazing. How about the cubes for 14 99 That's How amazing. Any of them. If that was an early bird, 14 99 they'd fly. Yeah. They would absolutely fly. Today, you're getting 50, 5 zero, five different designs. I don't know why. I don't know why. He's having a little grumble in there, isn't he? <laughs> no, okay. I said, oh, I did this. I don't know. Sterling silver is not base metal. I agree. There's a deal to be had. I agree. I remember. It was fourteen ninety five to be exact. Oh, we used to get... There you go. I remember packs of 10. I used to buy loads of them because I did loads of stretchy bracelets. Fourteen ninety five. You're getting 50 now. It's... And the price of silver hasn't gone down. Oh, no. It... No. No. Up, no, you it? have to monitor that. Yeah, you have to bear that in mind. Mark, yeah, Mark Smith says one one addition of sterling silver to his piece of jewellery immediately. That's five pounds. Oh as yeah. As a starting point. Oh yeah. Definitely. As a starting. Point. Well, it's that perception of value, isn't it? Definitely. People know that sterling silver. And these are quite unique. I mean, those ones over there look like they've got a little carved leaf like a little design. Flower. Yeah, with the diamond. Honestly, they're lush. I've never seen anything like those. Diamond cut. Yeah, they're super cute. It's like a little heart in the centre, isn't it? Can yeah. you see that? How beautiful. So you get ten of those. You've got those lovely kind of, I don't know, irregular shapes. You get like two different shapes. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think I need glasses. And then you've got the <laughs> cubes as well. And then your diamond cup, which is almost giving you that illusion uh, yeah. of plastic. Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. That's fifty that you're getting. Not a pack of ten. Not a pack of twenty. 50 That's sterling silver spacer beads. I'd be getting two all day long. Maybe four. Maybe four. 30p. 30p. You can't even get a Freddo for 30p anymore, no. can you? Freddo's, Freddo's expensive now. <laughs> Do you know that? You know you're a Brit when you start comparing things. I was just going to say yeah. that. <laughs> uh, hello to you, Isabel, saying perfect. A silver stretchy Mama. bracelet for 15 quid. Ah, oh, it's lovely, Isabel. Oh, yeah, it is. Ah, oh, amazing. Hello, hello. Yeah, 15 quid. Exactly happy days. Um, loads of you dialing through. Mm. Loads of you in the process of checking out. How many did we have, do you say? 100 available, but... 30 now, um, 29 to be exact. Elizabeth, Nuala, um, Elaine, well done. Marion, another Elizabeth, Brenda, Lorraine, Maker in Dorset, Sharon, Heather, Geraldine, Caroline, Gigi, Janice, Cheshire. Uh, I can't keep up it's with busy. you now. It is busy, busy, busy. Um, it's. I agree it should be a JM essential, but we do make our own jobs very difficult sometimes. Yes. Yeah. Because we get something like this, like, oh, amazing. They're not just any old spacer beads. Let's bring them to air for 14 99 That's a great idea, isn't it? Of course they sell out. Um, we do loads of versions of the spacer bead, and it is definitely one of those that uh, um, you will use repeatedly. Would you oh, agree? Oh, yes, definitely. You can never have too many. And I love the pick and mix selection. You don't get that anywhere else. Pick so it's nice. Mix. I know. It's lovely, isn't it? I know. It's just great. I love JM. Pick, and, mi pick and mix sterling silver spacer. I know, right? I know, oh, that's amazing. Great. Throwing that. a Tanzanite pendant and ah, you're laughing at yeah. me. Yeah, happy days. Yeah. We're talking luxury here. Today's a good day. Um, down to the final 17. If you've got a phone in your hand, stay where you are. Our call centre will get to you. Um, but the call screens are super busy, um, which is fantastic because coming up in the next hour as well, you've got the wonderful Dave Tross stepping into the studio to launch some absolutely exquisite carvings. Um, you've still got a chance to do it. Don't be put off by 15. You've got to remember. You can leapfrog over everybody that's got it in their baskets if you check out sooner or if you speak to our call centre sooner. So, and remember, wish list is your friend. Here they're in and they're out, aren't they? Yeah. They're not going to stick around. Can't you can't go quantity. on the website. No, no, no. And I get it. Yeah. I get it. Especially at that kind of price. I mean, yes. it's not base metal. No. Um, we're in the single figures. Um, do not go anywhere, jewelry makers, because what a treat. We've got the wonderful Dave stepping into the studio to launch some absolutely exquisite works of art. That's the only way I can think to describe these. They are works of art. The beautiful curve, the amazing light performance, the wonderful iridescence, and we've got a plethora of pieces as well. So a little bit of a rejig to your schedule, 
But I tell you what, I'm ever so glad it did happen. Um, so join us after a very short break with the wonderful Dave. <laughs> Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. You've actually caught me in the middle of making quite a tough decision. Which bow tie am I going to wear Friday morning? And you're probably wondering why you're gonna be wearing a bow tie. Well, this weekend, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, we're going to be showcasing some of our favorite exquisite gemstones. I'm really excited to be launching the weekend with Carol, Tom and the amazing crew. So in my project hours, Nine o'clock, one of my favorite ever gemstones, it's the Power Shell. And this is one of the necklaces that I'm going to be showcasing. And this particular piece also comes with a free PDF download, so you'll be able to make the project with the kit. And it includes this incredible brand new sliced cylinder barrel bead. It's just beautiful. So Power Shell in the nine o'clock project hour. And then at 12 o'clock, a gemstone that I rarely get to use. It's so beautiful. And it comes with the most incredible Parve set gemstone connectors, jadeite. This is the butterfly, absolutely exquisite. And there's also a featured Koi Carp connector too. And again, these will come with a PDF download so you'll be able to make this beautiful piece of jewelry. So that's this Friday, the 9th of February. Join myself, Carol and the team for the beginning of the exquisite Gem Weekend. And I may also give you a few more snippets regarding my birthday show next week. Take care, see you soon. Here at Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. Remember, standard P&P is $3.95. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of $5.95. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. I love it when you get surprises like today. Very spontaneous. We are reactive. We always oh, say absolutely. it. But what a treat, Dave, to see you in the studio. Uh, uh, well, it's a treat to see you well, and to treat to see you guys as well. Now, there, there was going to be, and I'm going to do a little talk on, you know, how hard it is to get obtain, you know, A grade or quad A grade pink tartar Maxima shell, right? Mm. But 
first of all, I need to hit on what's happening with the South Sea market. Okay, right? yeah. I am telling you now. In fact, I'll show you. South Sea pills have never been more expensive and it's not even a little bit like, you know how we said Charlie Barron's not coming back? Yeah. Charlie Barron was on my flight on the way home. I was speaking to him. I was speaking to vendors in uh, Tucson and um, the Chinese arrived um, on day one of the shows and bought up all the South Sea pills to take back to the Far East because of what's happening there. Um, on top of that, I saw a South Sea pearl strand and I'll show it you, right? And you know, the, you roughly know the price of South yeah. Sea pearls, right? Um, and I'm going to show you this because I think you might have an idea. Apologies, I know this is, like we said, we're, we're not that professional, we're rough and ready. <laughs> but here is a, a strand of South Sea, okay? The, you see them? They're large. They're oh beautiful. my goodness, yeah. Okay, I'm going to ask you to guess the price on that. And, and don't, you yeah, know, don't worry. Like you, okay, you, I'm going to say, because of the size, is that wholesale or retail? This wholesale is Tucson trade show. Okay, so I'm going to say maybe 10,000, 20,000. 10, okay, no, that is that is uh, an amazing... Uh, Dan, do you want to guess? Uh, I, 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 Ross, I'm you've, you've sold South Sea. South Sea? 20. 20, yeah. Charlie, is it Charlie? Um, yeah. I'm yeah. in the middle, 15. 15, okay. <laughs> that, that South Sea Pearl Strand, by the way, I'd have said the same. Yeah. Wholesale, because I know that maybe Wholesale, might retail at 50. Retail, then be yeah, 50, about 50, 60, right? yeah. So I picked it up and I was like, you know, absolutely unbelievable. I've only really seen a couple of, of strands like that. Do you want to know the price of that wholesale at Tucson this year? No word of a lie, 880,000 US dollars. I've never seen a million dollar pearl strand, never. By the way, I picked up a, a, a three strand natural queen conch necklace that was nowhere near that price. Nowhere near. Wow. I, had a, I posted on my, um, on my uh, Facebook and my Instagram a 42 carat mellow pearl, perfect round, yeah. full coverage flame pattern. Yeah, I saw That's the that. most expensive pearl in the world. It's a completely natural I saw pearl, that. right? Nowhere near it. Really? I mean, in fact, that mellow pearl was under $100,000. In fact, it was, I think it was about 80,000, if I'm correct. I think it was about $2,000 a carat. Absolutely, but it's In wholesale. Comparison. It's wholesale. <laughs> yeah. I picked up that South Sea, and the guy even said, it is unbelievable what's happening with South Sea right now. Now, that completely transfers onto the Pink Tarda Maxima. Okay. And um, Paula Crevache, I don't know if you've ever heard of her. Um, you can look her up. She's an amazing designer, like yeah. one of the world's greatest designers with like Jar and, and people like okay. this. Um, she's worked closely with Glenn Lehrer before. Right. Um, she creates maybe, I don't know, less than 10 pieces a year. And they all sell for close to about $100,000. And it's usually the most absurd, beautiful carvings, very exotic, working with all manner of different uh, gems. She had a Pink Tata Maxima butterfly, which is amazing, on her booth, right? Carved from the, the finest shell. Now, I know, I don't want you to confuse this with like Mother of Pearl jewellery that we bought to you before possibly. Oh, no. Or over on, on Jamporia, I'm sure, because we can get Mother of Pearl uh, you know, for watch faces or whatever it may be, really cheap. I'm not going to kid anyone, yeah. you can get it. The reason that it's thousands and thousands at Van Cleef, the reason it's thousands and thousands at Fabergé is, and I don't know if you've ever been to one of their kind of outlets, their boutiques, you know, their um, stores in, within like a Selfridges or something or a Harrods. If you've ever seen that Mother of Pearl, that they use and it doesn't photograph well. It looks like an opal. Like yeah. so, the play of color on We've it because literally of the said that about these pieces is insane, right? Yeah. It's just outrageous. That's the material that commands tens of thousands. And the reason I'm telling you that is because I've worked my hardest to get this, and I'm. It's probably the luckiest I've ever been. Um, about seven years ago, I was at the Paspali Pearl Farm in Western Australia with Nick Paspali. Yeah. And then they produced ninety percent of the world's South Sea pearls. Okay. I spent a week there living on boats. It was incredible. We did like a documentary. And so I know the Paspalis very well, and, and as does Charlie Barron. And I reached out to them a couple of years ago and I said, I'd love to, I'd seen in, I think it was in Selfridges, um, like a Alhambra of Mother of Pearl. And it was insane. It was Pink Tata Maxima. It was about two and a half grand. And I, and I genuinely thought it was coated or it had been treated, but it was 100% natural. And it was just a completely different grade to anything I'd ever mm. seen. And so, the, 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 just so you guys know, when when they uh, put the pearls in the water at the Spali Pearl Farm, if it, if the first harvest after two years or whatever is successful, they reuse the oyster, right? Yeah. So because they're like, okay, this is a thoroughbred, this has produced a wonderful pearl. So then they put a slightly larger nucleus in, 
they put it in the harvest again and each time more and more drop off okay so at the very end probably about five percent of the oysters are, from the very first harvest are still in the water right, okay. because they only only so many make it so far and they're the ones you need to do the quad a grade mother of pearl right wow. because they're the ones that have been alive the longest they're the one that have been producing the finest pearls they're full of nacre they, yeah. they have the most incredible shimmer and it's completely different if you look at um open up an oyster from harvest number one to the coveted material that comes out 10 years later it's just unbelievable it's night and day it's like a different uh, uh, specimen and so that material is the material that's in the highest demand right that is the material that is if anyone's working with pink tartar maxima like the big jewelry houses they only want the finest grade of course it's their reputation it's their brand yeah so they're all bidding on the one percent now i recognized during covid that you know a lot of things happened mm. especially with the pearl industry mm. pearls went through the roof and i sw swooped in kind of and got a very small amount of the the one percent and we won't be able to get it again just so everyone knows and you certainly will never get it again in fact i guarantee right now i bet my house on it you'll never see south sea pearls on this channel yet really never see south no way Eight hundred eighty thousand us dollars why why is there so that? i mean they've always been no, very no, no. expensive yeah of course what's happened is it's only happened once before and it was in the early 90s and it was after the kobe uh, earthquake in, in japan yeah um and the price just went through the roof and they've never seen anything like it until now it's surpassed all expectations and it's because of um influences so Chinese, really? you know about the Chinese influence in Nini yes. and Yangmei. So they have done this campaign on, on uh, Tahitians and Yangmei did uh, one on the South Sea. The price has gone through the roof, like to, to the point that it's absolutely unbelievable. Wow. You've never seen anything like it. And the Chinese are buying all the South Sea pearls and they are putting money down on whole harvest for like the next 10, 20 well, they years. Have, once, once they have an appetite, it's insatiable, isn't it, for the gemstone? You won't see South Sea pearls on either of our wow. channels going forward. It is, they've become the most expensive pearls in the world. More expensive than mellow pearls, more expensive than uh, conch pearls, which has never happened in the whole history of the pearl wow. industry. It's never happened. Like A completely natural pearl should always be more expensive than a cultured pearl. Yeah. It doesn't matter, you know, that, that's the reality. South Sea pearls now are the most expensive pearls in the world. Because of demand. Absolutely. And as such, you have now got this material, which is carved from the mother of pearl, from the finest and largest South Sea pearls. And when we say it looks like an opal, I'm going to show you something now that if I'd have seen, and I did see a piece like this, if I'd have seen it, another one at Tucson, wholesale, that would be 30 grand, I think. And I'm going to show you this unique butterfly that's a hundred percent natural. That's a masterpiece. Like I know I got a crazy deal, an incredible deal on these, but I'm telling you, we should just this morning we should have just done another show mm. and put that into platinum. Yeah, a hundred percent, and sold it as a piece of jewelry on our sister channel. And even there, you won't see mother of pearl like that again. And I'm going to show you even before what's happening right now. These are the um, forget all this. I'm going to show you this. These. So the, the look, Cartier yeah. necklace, right? You look at that and you go, what is it? 3,700 at the bottom there? Yeah. My, my eyes are terrible. 3,700 pounds. You probably think, oh my God, they're making so much profit there. It's disgusting. They're not. They're all outbidding each other on this grade of mother of pearl. Like Cartier, Van Cleef, you know, that's two and a half grand. And I said, they don't photograph well. Okay, they don't. No. Just like opals don't really. Yeah. But if you've ever seen it, many of you that are tuned in right now will have seen it. I've, I've been to, you know, your Selfridges, your Harrods. I've, seen, I've been to Cartier and Bond Street and I've seen their mother of pearl and it genuinely looks like an opal, like an opal. In fact, um, Adam, that, that piece you've got there, just the, 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 the kind of unique cabochon, that kind of Baroque. That's amazing. Look how many colors are on this material. Yeah, and we'd, we actually said that this morning, Dave, before mm -hmm. we came along, we were like, that looks like opal, the yeah. finest opal. Yes. All those colors. Yeah. And, and far rarer and far more expensive. Without the knowledge that you've just given us. So oh my goodness. For, for anyone, and I, I, yeah, I'll show you. I think I've got some other pictures, if I can find it. Just, you know, the, the, the price of pearls right now is at an all-time high. It's outrageous. It's uncomprehendable. Even fresh waters. Fresh water strands are like 30 grand. You know, to, to get your, your South Sea is impossible. I've never held uh, an $800,000 necklace. And that is South Sea. 
I'm going to wish all of you the very best of luck and I'm just going to say this won't happen again. It doesn't happen again. This is a very fortunate, very lucky moment for me. During COVID, I reached out to Paspali and I knew they were going through many changes because many harvests have been compromised and I just said, I want some of those you know, coveted quad A grade mother of pearl. Usually your Cartiers and everyone's getting involved on in that. We only got a very small amount, but to be able to bring you something like this. Yeah, and it, uh, wow. It's a huge piece as well, isn't it? But it's just that hand carved, incredible mother of pearl with that myriad of colors because density of the nacre, the way that it's so compact, the, the, the structure of this. But again, knowing Dave, this is why it's so we're so fortunate, and I'm going to sort of uh, blow your trumpet here a little bit. But it's knowing that, seeing a window of opportunity, mm -hmm. knowing okay, COVID hit, this is going to impact. Mm -hmm. Having that foresight, I guess, saying right, I need to get over there. I need to yeah. you know, perhaps get hold of this opportunity because had you not have gone on that trip, I assume something like uh, well, this wouldn't, wouldn't have, have come. the relationships for sure. Yeah, you know, I wouldn't be on first name basis with Nick Paspali. I wouldn't be able to you know, have his number in my phone and reach out. But he could have also said no. He's done me a solid here. He's True. really looked after us and, and allowed us to get involved. But he even said, and this is before what's happened. And by the way, all of this has happened for South Sea. It's happened since September. Just wow. gone. I bought these kind of just after COVID. Yeah. Um, and, and I mean, I bought the, the Mother of Pearl, which are huge. But it's taken us a long time to find a team that can carve it. True. You know, because when you're dealing with something this rare, and I'm not saying, you know, we got an incredible deal, by the way. That's why you're not paying 30 grand for them. But because I knew it was the only time we'd ever do it, mm. I don't want to just entrust this to everyone. We can't just go, let's try it. You know, because we knew this would be the only time we ever get to do it. Yeah. So we, we spent a long time, probably too long, maybe, but it's, it's great for you guys. We spent maybe two years trying creating to find carvers, this collection. Trying to find carvers. Wow. This is not done in Jaipur. This is not done in India. This is not done by our team. Our team are amazing. This is done mm. by a high jewelry house in Hong Kong, yeah. right? which is you know kind of where some of the world's finest high jewelry is created. And um, this team has produced what is a masterpiece. Now, if this was just had a brand name attached to it, yeah. and it was platinum, and those central stones were diamonds, you're looking especially with the pink tartar maxima you know the, the south sea mother of pearl the quad a grade and you can see it here yeah you can tell the difference yeah that is is one of the most spectacular pieces of jewelry jewelry maker has ever offered yeah like i don't believe jem has ever offered a piece of jewelry that is that you know that unique that it's special stunning. it looks like it should be in a museum yeah, yeah, no, I no, agree. Truly, like, I know we create wonderful jewelry and we go and get big stones and we surround them with diamonds, but this, this kind of whimsical, unbelievable, you know, combination of carving and design is something that usually is one of a kind and is usually, probably exclusively other than today, um, only available to those of us that have tens of thousands to drop on jewelry. I mean, that is, it's the ribbons of precious yeah. metal as well. And you have lots of different offerings. Look, look how they've made the mother of pearl look like silk. Oh my goodness. Folds of silk. Now, as, as you guys who are, you know, jewelry makers and jewelry designers, I mean, the, 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 the manner of things that you can create with this, whether you want to create a brooch, whether you want to create a ring, like a really stunning ring, thank you, or, or whether you want to create a, a pendant, whatever yeah. it may be, you guys are the designers, but I'm just saying as an opportunity right now, things like this don't happen. Now, usually when we, we're on your screens and we have a brand new collection, a brand new launch, whether it be a bangle, whether it be a jade carving, whether it be bullseye malachite, whatever it may be, you're used to us going anywhere from 100 to 200 quantity, right? This, I've got less than 30. Oh. In fact, I'll just tell you, I've got 27. I've got 27, and I know, I've just seen uh, the phone lines, I've seen uh, what Charlie and Elle have been doing, I've seen how busy it is. Yeah, it is. And I know there's more than 27 people watching. Oh my goodness. And this is something that you've never seen before. And, and by the way, neither has Gemporia, like our sister channel. It's beautiful. This, this, in the current climate, in the current market, is probably the biggest saving I can make for any collector in the world right now. That's the truth. Even, and you think about how amazing our deals are when it comes to Jedi in comparison to the rest of the market. I'm telling you right now, the West, forget me, 
the West are not getting South Sea or its derivatives. You know, your pink tartar maxima, the shell, anything, the mother of pearl, they are not coming to the West. And anything that is in the West, the Chinese are buying up. Mm. And I'm going to be in Hong Kong at the end of March. The last time Hong Kong happened, which was uh, in September, I'm talking about the Hong Kong Gem Show, yeah. the World Trade Expo. The Robert Wan auction is where you buy all your pink tartar maxima, okay. where all the big jewelers are. Cartier, Van Cleef, you know, they don't go to Australia. They, everyone goes to Hong Kong. Right. And from Australia, they bring the Spali uh, harvest. Okay. And they buy all their pearls. They buy all their, their mother of pearl. For the first time in its history, the Robert Wan auction is the, the most incredible pearl auction in the world. We only have access through Charlie Barron. No right. one can just rock up. We go to Hong Kong every year, but it's only since we've known Charlie just... Barron that we can actually gain access to, to um, the, the Robert Wan auction. Okay. For the first time in its history, it was called off in September. Did you know this? No. Right, so what happened was uh, the, the, there was a Chinese frenzy because of these influences and everyone wanted pearls. Um, a lot of vendors sold out within an hour. Within an hour, which is impressive. I'm talking tens of thousands of pearls. Yeah. And then the highlight of the whole event is the big Robert Wan auction where they bring the big harvests out. One Chinese buyer shut down the whole auction, right? Paid a 60% premium and took everything. Everything. Like, I don't know how much oh, it's a billion dollars. Like just said, I'll buy everything here. I don't want to go in anywhere else. It's the first time it's ever happened. It's documented. You can read about it. That's never happened. Every auction, every time we've been going for the last six years, we go to the Robert One auction. There'll be things that are left unsold. There'll be incredible yeah. highlights. Oh, that, that harvest got this much. Like one guy bought the lot. And now the next auction is going to take place on the 27th of March. I'm going to be there. I'm, I'm just going to see what's going to happen. Is that guy's going to be there well, again? Just what's going to happen. Yeah. The Chinese demand is crazy. Yeah. So to, to any one of you right now, who wants to get involved. And by the way, that's not even it. When they're buying them in Hong Kong, when they take them to mainland China, they pay a 60% import tax. So a lot of these people that have paid these huge vast sums of money for these pearls, have left them in Hong Kong, they're still there. They're just investing in them. They've just left them there. They've bought all these pearls and they've said, leave them there because the price is only going up. Because they know once they take them into mainland China, they pay a 60% import tax. So they're just, it's almost like sitting in a bank account in Hong Kong right now just these endless amounts of incredible pearls and I'm going to offer you something that we should never have access to like someone like me or someone like you guys at home we shouldn't have access to that that's oh, you know wow. you know we talk about jewelry that's beyond jewelry that's high jewelry you know, yeah, high jewelry totally is agree. creative it's like oh it um, I'm going to give you a, like a 30 second clock and I'm just going to give you a piece of advice just before we start the clock I just want to address every single one of you and I'm the jade guy right I love jade you guys know that about me. I'm very passionate. I'm writing a book. I look, Jade's my stone. But I would, be, I would be wrong if I didn't tell you right now. If I had one piece of advice to anyone that's tuned in right now. If you could only buy one thing this year. One thing this year. Buy something from this show. That is my absolute honest advice. And I'm only saying that because this is the one thing I'll never replace. With Jade, we've had some of you have incredible collections. We've been working with it for four years. This is one and done. This is one show and done. And this is the most elite Stunning. grade. This is, I don't know what you'd call it, Cartier grade, Van Cleef grade. Yeah, this it, is not shell jewelry. No, this is not no. tat. This is the real deal. Probably the only time this grade has ever been set into silver, by the way, ever. Do you know what I likened it to? Not necessarily in terms of the, the design, obviously, but in terms of the curves. Mm -hmm. Like that chrysanthemum, yeah. you know the conch? It's yeah. like that. Uh, you got folds of silk. Yeah, it's stunning. Carved into to mother of pearl. I've said what I've said, and I'm uh, I'm up front. I'm going to be here all year, bringing you the most incredible jewellery. On Monday, myself and Ella bring you bullseye malachite. Oh, Undoubtedly, bring you more jadeite throughout the year um, if I can get it. But if I'm honest with any collector right now, and, and you know, I have a, I have a huge responsibility to our collectors. I actually met a, a couple that come all the way from Surrey yesterday and met a couple of uh, customers, oh. right? And we went for lunch and we chatted. They talked about what they'd invested in, you know, how they'd been to Hong Kong in the 90s. And, and they're probably tuned in right now yeah. and, uh, you know, never thought a dream they could own Jade. And they have one of the, you know, we talk about the most incredible private collection. I'm going to go down and film in their, in their home. Oh, because amazing. the collection they have puts my own collection to shame. And, and this is the kind of clientele that we're working with. And I'm saying to anyone, if there's one thing you get this year, it's I love this. Jade, and the deals on Jade are incredible, but this, this is 
unprecedented. That's the truth. Ugh. Oh can, my can, Sorry, Adam, to be a pain. I'll can, never tire of looking can, at can that. Can we just do one thing? Just indulge me for a second. Just take the graphics out for, for one second, everything, and just watch this on the screen. If that was a billboard in London, right? And mm. you know, those, those wonderful big TV screens. Yeah. And that was like a new Cartier collection. Yeah. Or a new Van Cleef collection. Or David Webb. Or David Morris. Yeah. You can be, imagine we, it, can't you? You'd be spellbound. Yeah. And the reality is it could well be. Oh, they'd be the but finest diamonds. we have diamonds. managed through our relationships, through our connections, to snatch away this grade for the only time. And I'm telling you now, a piece like this, a piece like this, you should be looking at not four figures, you should be looking at five figures. Yeah. Thank you, Adam. I apologize. I just wanted, because sometimes, no. it, you know, that is my own worst enemy when I see this and it's like, deal of the day, some f free phone number, <laughs> you know, pink graphics. And I love it. It's amazing. But it should never be next to jewelry like this. No, this I agree. Sh this it shouldn't should even be a price. It should just be priced up because you walk past the window and you yeah, just dream about magazines. it. Yeah, in magazines. You just dream about it. POA. Yeah. That's what Absolutely. it should be. Totally agree. I totally agree. Okay. Um, I'm going to start. At four thousand pounds. Yeah. Uh, obviously, guys, we're nowhere near done. No. We are jewelry maker start after somewhere. all. But I'm going to tell you, to anyone, this is an elite, world-class, world-beating, high jewelry collection. You're never going to see Mother of Pearl that does that, again. Nowhere near done. In fact, I'm going to give you a thirty-second clock. I'll show you how crazy this deal is going to be. I will. But remember, nothing else is on pre-order, is it, Ross? It's a very limited no, show. No, no, okay. no. So you know, we're, we're talking. There's 27 of these. I'm, I'm amazed. There's 27. That's incredible. First thing I would do with this, and, and, and like, I won't be able to do it right now, but maybe in two years, three years, I'd find some incredible diamonds and I'd recreate this whole design in platinum and diamonds. It might cost me Swap it out. four thousand pounds to get diamonds like that in platinum, but it'd be worth it at some point. Wow. Yeah. Right. Just because it's a crazy show. I'm going to take three and a half thousand pounds off the price right now. This three is out, and a half? Yeah, yeah, taking three and a half thousand pounds off the price right now. I'm telling you what this should command, I'm telling you what pieces like this should be at. And I'm going to tell you I'm, I'm not done, but this is where you need to capitalize. This is where you need to get involved. It is huge. Oh my goodness, mate. It is huge. It's absolutely, yeah. And I like, I'm holding it kind of asymmetrically. Yeah, I love it. I mean, how beautiful it could be worn like that. It's the ribbons that wrap mm. around. Maker in Devon, Nottinghamshire, oh. Elaine, Leslie, Maker in Swansea, Pamela, Maker in Wiltshire, Angela in Surrey, Maker in Grey London, Davini in West Sussex, Hazel you've got two, Denise in Sheffield, Nicola in West Sussex. There's so many of you there. There you go. Mother of Pearl, butterfly pendant that you've just found there. What's the price? Six, Six and, and a half thousand, thousand dollars. pounds. Yeah, this is it. And I know that doesn't photograph well. I can sorry. guarantee that's going to be a grade like what you're seeing here. Yeah, it's but, not going to be this size. This is absolutely well, no, that's enormous. That's just you know, a small, maybe laser cut motif. Yeah. This. It's a work of art. It's a dream to even it's get to see something like this. Yeah. Like it's, I said, those folds on the wings. Yeah. Those ripples. Three like dimensional. Like folded silk. And the way that the light pools. Do you know what, Dave? I'm going to I'm going to say this. I think this is one of the most beautiful pieces we've ever commissioned. Yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad that, that you feel the same. Um, how many do we have left, Ross? Eight. Okay, eight. We had twenty-seven. Do you know what any other jeweler in the world would do right now? They go right. That's a great day's trading. Put those eight in the vault. We're done. Yeah. I'm not. In fact, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to take hundreds of pounds off this. Hundreds, plural. So I'm going to give you a thirty-second clock. There's eight left. We only had twenty-seven. There is a few other pieces in this collection, but that is it. That is everything. I've, I've told you up front at the start of this show what we, what, what you, you can do, you know, how to get involved. Oh. Um, and I told you, if, if you only could buy one thing all year, this is it. Yeah. Even though that's not in my best interest. No, no, I, I get it. But you can see the magic of this and I can see why, you understand why, don't you, mm -hmm. that, that, that it's happening. Yeah. It might extortion at prices, I don't know. Realistic, I don't know. Right. But you understand. Yeah. Um, I know what's going to happen now. When we do this deal, everything in the show is probably going to have reserves on it, right? And you guys find a way. I know it's not available on the web. It's You're going to call this. And That's I would true. too. I'd call the contact center and I'd demand yeah. that I can get involved in any of the pieces. So I'm taking 300 pounds off the price right now. And I've got six chances remaining. I'm going to 199.
That's amazing. 199 on a fantasy piece. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Like, the, the, this is that, you know, I when you describe your collection. Yeah, but I, honestly, I apologize that I'm, I don't seem very professional this morning. I actually don't have experience with jewelry of this level. I don't have the a vocabulary, you know, uh, wide enough to be able to talk about jewelry like this. Mm. This is the best thing this, this piece does is it speaks for itself. Yeah, when you yeah, describe your jewellery collection or your family's jewellery, this is that kind of pinnacle piece. Oh, God, yeah, oh god. Because there's nothing like it. This is like, you know, the, the kind of piece that, you know, if, if you're a grandmother and you wear it, your grandkids are going to remember. Yeah. That's what they remember first and that's foremost. That's true, yeah. This is a piece that enters a room before you do. Yeah, that's now, this true. This is what everyone's drawn to. The, there is no other gemstone that catches the light like something like this. There's those, it's sold out. Apologies. Apologies, apologies. Do you know, I'm so sorry to those of you that have missed out. Can I just see it again? Just because I'm never going to see it again. So, sure. Sorry. It's amazing, isn't it? If you've missed out, don't be too disheartened. Wishlist it, firstly. Have you seen that, Charlie? It's unbelievable. But, you know, there's like a layer almost beneath the surface. You yeah. Know, because of the, the, uh, it, the, the right term isn't crystallization. Because of how compact the nacre is. It's, it's just this shimmer beneath the surface. Oh, wow. Um, we've just had, um, a, 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 who, who created this? It wasn't you, Laura. Uh, no? okay. The team upstairs. But uh, uh, one of our in-house designers, I believe, has created this. And you can just see how it just, that piece transforms everything. Oh my goodness. That's amazing. Well done. Congre Apologies to anyone who misses out. Uh, we have some spectacular pieces coming up. It's a very small show, but my, as much as I love the butterfly and it's you know that fantasy piece I said to Adam who's our director and I said to El uh, when we were in the break when I was getting my microphone on this is my favorite piece this incredible that's kind of beautiful amulet, this kind of baroque uh, shape and I don't know if this comes across these are the worst lights in the world like yeah for jewelry. totally um but, can I just say sorry to interrupt Dave those white those are white topaz by the way whoa. oh was it Mark who made this there oh, thank are. you Mark thank, thank you, you Mark. Mark we appreciate that. um it, they're colourless white topaz That's in the centre. A few customers are asking. I hope that this does this justice, okay? This doesn't look real. It's phenomenal. <gasps> oh my goodness me. Of how $60,000 Australian opals are going to do this. It's, it is opal-esque, isn't it? Yeah, it's beyond that. I just wanted you to see what this does, even in the worst lighting in the world. And again, it has that sort of baroque form. And oh. that is unique because it allows the light to pool in such unique ways. How many of these do we have, Ross? 57. Oh my God, this is gonna be a crazy deal for you. Absolutely unbelievable. Biggest quantity of the show? Yeah. On my favorite piece. I, I can't believe I'm about to say this though. It's, it's the highest level of jewellery, but it's wearable at the same time. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Um, let's give everyone a 30 second clock. There's, there's uh, 57. That's uh, amazing. You can wait for this 30 second clock. If I'm in your shoes, I'm ringing at the contact center saying, they're about to bring this live. Can I just pre order it? Can I reserve this? Can I get it? That's so beautiful. I agree. I've and never look, seen. Can, uh, if, uh, oh, the other thing I'd say is, I'd get three. You know, a pair of earrings. Maybe you don't want oh, the, the silver over the top. Maybe you're going to frame it in a different way, but just to have that drop. I've never seen such color. No. Nope. Never, and that's all down to, it's, it's interesting, isn't it, to see. And I was going to ask you the question. Sorry, I know your clock's just run out. Go on. Okay, look, look at the phone lines already. Yeah. Wow, that's stationary and the worst lighting conditions one could imagine. Absolutely. And it still looks like no other gemstone I've ever seen. Catherine, Swansea, you've got two. Lincolnshire, you've got two. Valerie, you've got it. Pamela, you've got it. Hazel, you've got it. Denise, you've got it. This is, there is not another show like this ever, just so everyone's aware. It's amazing. Swansea, you've got three. I knew there would be collectors that were saying, yeah, I'm going to have the earrings independent. We haven't got hundreds of these. But if for everyone gets reasons. three, if everyone gets three, yeah. that's, well, I can't even Say 20 that's. people. 20 people, yeah. About 20 people, just under. Again, the rarity to actually get hold of Mother of Pearl like this. And it was interesting, earlier on, Dave, you were saying, you know, the 1%. Mm. 
that yeah. makes this stage. 100%. Is that the further, the more and more pearls that they actually Yeah, cult- so that will be produce? when they're produced in their lifetime, four pearls. So then Each one getting larger later. and larger and larger, with the last harvest being the ones that were $800,000 wow. in that strand. Wow. They are the 1%. And then they are kind of retired, and then there is a bidding war for that mother of pearl. Wow. Because it's the thickest mother of pearl there. And if you just show the profile of this, or you sure. probably see it in the shot that Adam's got of me holding it, but you can see the depth of it. Yeah, it's not a slither, is it? No. It's and, a full cabochon. If you've ever got a pink tide maxima shell from us, you'll see how thin they are. Yeah. Because they're like first harvest shells, right? Yeah. This, look at the depth, look at the thickness. That's not a doublet or a triplet. That is all pink tide maxima. Watch this. Wow. Oh my goodness. It's like a flame. It is. And Margaret, Maker and Cumbria, Swansea's got three, Gloucestershire, Jeanette, Sarah's got two, Catherine, you're there, Lincolnshire, Maker, Valerie in Somerset, Maker in Oxfordshire, Pamela in Devon, Hazel in Hampshire, Denise in Sheffield. So many of you have secured this already and I want to congratulate you. It's absolutely monstrous. It's huge. Like I said, I love the way that that, that it's been carved in that Baroque form. Oh, wow. Oh, oh my God, this is the piece. That's this is the our piece. piece, right? This is what I'm saying. If that's on a billboard, if that's on a billboard and it's David Morris jewellery, it's price and application, none of us are going to afford that necklace. Um, a little bit of a sneak peek as well of what's coming up. That's... Yeah, you see the earrings? Yeah. They're coming up. Wow. Yeah. All the same grade from the same harvest. That is sensational. I'm, I'm speechless. How do we then. even have access to material like this? You know, how are we how are we genuinely making this a reality? Well, I mean, I, I am going to say this, you, Dave. It's because of you, and like I said, you. Yeah. It, look, that you look, travel look, a lot. You you yeah. know, and you meet a lot of people mm-hmm. and those experiences and those relations that you form. Mm-hmm. I look, I but love, it's amazing, I love what we isn't do, it? But even everything that I do, this is an absolute fluke, I'll be honest, right? Really? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, there are, I've never been part of a show like this where I'm just lost for words, where it's just, it's high jewellery. It's absolutely high jewellery on Jewellery Maker. Yeah, look at this model wow. shot here. Wow. This is what you're owning. Are you we... see the pieces, the pieces at what, Van Cleef and Cartier, and they're two and a half thousand pounds, and then you see those fantasy pieces. That is the pendant we're offering you right now. Right now, you can see the scale of it. It's, yeah. it's huge, too. That it's ring not... is coming up, too. Oh, wow. Don't hesitate. Look at that. Yeah. Purples, and we're violets, looking at greens, it blues. In the worst possible yeah. lighting conditions, and it's still performing. We had like 57. This. How many do we have remaining, Ross? Um, we have. 28, 27. 27, because half the stock's gone. I'm going to start at two and a half thousand pounds. Yeah. You wouldn't even get near this piece for Mm-mm. two and a half thousand pounds anywhere else. And how exciting, if you're able to get, if you're successful in this opportunity and, and knowing that you are you, going yeah, to Hong Kong next can, month. Yeah, absolutely. Look, South Sea is untouchable, it's unthinkable. We cannot do it wow. in any in any form, whether that be the mother of pearl, whether that be the pearls. If you've got pearls, from South Sea, you are sitting on a gold mine right now. It's like, it's like finding oil, like striking really? oil. Yeah, 100%. I looked through my own uh, little safe at home the other day and I've got a few loose uh, South Seas, like golden. And I'm like, right, I'm putting, I'm literally uh, putting bales on them now. Yeah. And I'm going to take them to Hong Kong. I don't know. I've got you. about four or five, but like large ones, perfect rounds. Yeah. And I'm just like, yeah, absolutely. This is, this is why I bought them. Yeah. I bought them because I hoped the price would go up. I anticipate the price going up. I'm going to go and cash them in. I don't blame you. It is wild what is happening for pearls right now. So they, they're calling it the golden age, golden age of pearls. Wow. I'll give you a 30 second clock. Look, you're going to have to be quick. It, it's, it's on you if you want to own this material. If you've ever seen anything like this, it will have been high jewelry. It will have been unaffordable, unattainable. I'll never tire of looking at that sort of... No. That travel, if you like, the journey um, of colours. It's the other world. It's right. otherworldly. Okay. You know what? Look, just you got uh, Hazel's got two, Swansea's got three, Sarah's got two. I want to show our model shot. Thank you so much. Spectacular. You walk into a jeweler's in Bond Street, right, and that's on a big, big building across the street, and it says, "Visit our store in Mayfair," right, and you go in, and they have the the quad A grade pink tartan maximum. It's yeah. a one of a kind. 
pendant like that. It's in a cabinet. It's on a, a floating acrylic stand, yep. lit up to the max, not with awful, god awful kind of floodlights, but yeah. with these twinkling, stunning LEDs. You couldn't even multi buy if you're a millionaire because they've only got one. You see that, that will be a one of a kind. Yeah. They might say, we do have another in our Par Parisian boutique. We can get it flown yeah, other in. Other places around yeah. the world. Yeah. I'm going to take two grand off this. Nowhere near done. But I'm telling you right now, I, 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 it'd be in my best interest just to get a booth at Hong Kong and yeah. take this material. Just reset it into platinum. I'd make my money back. How amazing. I've just never seen a stone that does that. I've seen the most incredible Cooper PD opals. I lived underground there for a week. Saw the million dollar opal. The Virgin Rainbow doesn't even do what this does. Dave, you bring us the most amazing gems, inform and educate and make the accessible to all. Sharon, thank you so much. That's the reason I do it, I love it. I love to, to, yeah. to make them available to real people like you and I. Just beautiful, thank goodness I bought the South Sea Pearls from you when I did. I'll tell you what, yeah. you are sitting Janice, pretty well if you've done. got South Sea Pearls right well now. Well done. Okay, Jean 30 second clock, we're going again. Oh. We're taking hundreds and hundreds of pounds off this. It's gonna be yours. It's a huge carrot weight. Do you know, do, do, Ross has just said in my ear, Dave, this has had the biggest reaction yeah, I can via imagine. text messages yeah. in, in any launch. Keep them coming in, we love them, but I'm let me just surprised. tell you, I'm not surprised. When you see something like that, That's you know what we should have done, guys? You know what we should have done? We should have put this on our social media and said, guess the gem. Yeah. How, yeah, how yeah, on yeah. earth? There is, we would think that's a new discovery. Is this a yeah. new opal that's been discovered in Indonesia? What is it? Yeah. It's quad A grade pink tartar maximum. It's the material you've never seen because we can never afford it. And I'm going to go straight down to 199. I'm going to make it a, a possible for you. That's what we want to do on these big, big carat weight pieces. On these exceptional masterpieces. I want you to wear them. I want you to get them. 199? Yeah. Um, we had 57 of these. We do not have that anymore. But let me tell you, using the queue, I've got Linda and Janet and Maker and Wendy and Jane and Julie and Sheila and Maker and Karen. Dorset, you're there. Northamptonshire, Heather in Lancashire, Karen in Hampshire. Look, we've got multi buyers. When you've got your interest free split payments under £50, yeah. pounds, this is that unique moment yeah. that you happen to be tuned Irreplaceable. in. Irreplaceable. Irreplaceable what moment. Absolute exquisiteness. It's out and above the most beautiful pieces of craftsmanship. Must own a piece. Well, Caroline oh, in Greater amazing. Manchester, you absolutely can. You know, we're making it affordable to all. We want you to get this. We're thinking about you when we're pricing this. Uh, when, when a couple of years ago, a few years ago, when I did this deal, I never even imagined that it would look this good. Like I saw the the rough form quad a pink tide max i'm looking at them this is before they're polished i'm like this is incredible you know and i was thinking to myself everyone's gonna go wild for this and then the high jewelry team in hong kong have just created these unique unbelievable fantasy pieces well do, well you say that word fantasy do you ever do you ever imagine at the beginning of this idea that you have yep. like this this mm -hmm. showcase like oh i know what i want to do but you think no this is fa fantasy it can't yep. possibly become reality no, yep. and then here we are Does it's, that... it's better than a dream isn't it yeah it's better than what you could have ever dreamed absolutely Look, here you go i'm not a pearl person don't usually like them these are amazing mm. i am so in love i've got mine ordered to make a sweet butterfly and two pennants sarah wow. congratulations well done. Look. That's when you know jewellery. That's when you know the, the gemstone is on a diff different level. Yeah. Some people often ask me, because it's just terminology, but when does a gemstone become a jewel? You know, like a, a jewel. Well, that's a good right? question. And for me, it's when it's something that you've never been interested in, and then you are. Yeah. You know, if you, someone says, I'm not an emerald person, then you see like a world-class emerald, yeah. and you go, I love that. Though. Yeah. That's when it becomes that's a, a jewel. jewel. When it can speak to the people that don't even want it. Yeah. Right. That's, that's when you're talking analogy. about a jewel. But that's what it is. For yeah. me, it's not about the size. It's not about anything. It's about yeah. something. It's easy to people. You know, if people love pearls and they love it, great. When people are like, I'm not interested. I don't want it. And then you see it and you go, I can't resist. That's when it's a jewel. Yeah. When it's universally wow. accepted. That's an amazing. And, and, and that is my the, the way that I kind of quantify it. Certainly can do, be um, just described as that. I'm gonna do a one minute clock and going lower. One minute clock, I'm actually going to take this lower because we've heard from collectors who want to get um, the butterfly and this. And look, if we can make that a reality, if we can make that happen today, then we're going to do it. I'm going to give you a minute to really think about this. I've got 20 opportunities remaining just wow. under. I am going lower. And you know we're not going to mess about. I'm not going to stop off and go, maybe it's 179. No, we're going low. If we want you to get the butterfly in this, it's going to happen. This is your opportunity. Again, the finest quality topaz set within there as well. So you've got that beautiful... Mm -hmm. Rainbow of colours. Yeah, half but a it's minute. not a slither, is it? Like no, you no, said earlier on. No, no, this is a on. substantial piece. It's like a talisman. It's, it's massive. Yeah. Um, 
less than 30 seconds now and we are taking a substantial amount off this and you still got your split payments you, you know you, you can still benefit from everything the jewelry maker makes possible but hopefully you can now build this incredible collection or it can make it a little bit easier a little bit more affordable so beautiful day well done and to the multi buyers congratulations thank you for trusting us uh, five seconds do you think, I mean, we're only in the second month of the year, 2024. This is going to be one of the most historic Yeah, absolutely. This is the one that we'll look back on. You know, when you do your year in review. Yeah. At the end this of the year, the we're going to go bang. Do you remember that showcase? Straight down, 149. Wow. Um, you're going to have to be super quick now. I think we've yeah. got like 15 or 12 of these left. It is wild. It is busy, but you can do it. There's no reason for you to miss out. Um, and we're making it as affordable as we possibly can. So wait, what, split payment's now like 30 something pounds? Yeah. Is that, oh my goodness me. Well done. Congratulations, Denise, Janet, Julie, Mark, Mary, Je Jeannie, Linda, Maker in Angus, Jane, Maker in Gloucestershire, we've got Karen, Maker in Dorset, Maker in Northamptonshire. Janet, you've just got two, well done. Karen, you're there, Maker in Conway. There, there are so many uh, collectors now. And if it looks like that in the studio, oh. dreadful light conditions. Yeah, the worst. Remember, Charlie used to always complain about them, didn't he? Rightfully so as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. This is the worst light conditions imaginable. For yeah. Cars. But imagine what it's going to be like in natural sunlight. Mm, oh, my goodness me. A full That's not rainbow. what you're seeing on your screen is not a photo. That's not a photoshopped image. That's no. live stationary no. in the studio. Look at the light. Yeah, there's literally my hand right there. Wow. That's the light naturally. That's incredible, Dave. Mm -hmm. We have 10 left. 10 no reason that it can't be you there is no reason whatsoever oh that, you're, that you have to miss out on this do you know how many people have got it in their baskets right now go on 83 yeah uh, look we knew the response would be huge we've um, seen it yeah uh, yeah it, and it's insane it's absolutely insane mm -hmm. probably one of the most beautiful pieces of or oh, collections i've seen i Dave. agree i completely agree and probably will ever see as well yeah that's the important thing to remember um there are 10 opportunities remaining got Maker in Gloucestershire, Wrexham, County Durham, Cumbria, Cheshire, Cambridgeshire, Lancashire, Devon, Angus, County Durham, East Sussex, Dorset, Lancashire and Hampshire on the phone lines and then goes off my screen, single figure stock, £37 on your interest free split payments. You can make this your reality right now. That can be yours. But you're going to have to be quick. I just want to point out that the ring matches too. Yeah, the ring is sensational. We're going to do that next. Yeah. Oh, my Let's goodness. Let's do a one-minute clock to close this one out. Like you said, there's so many of you, 80-plus of you on the phone lines or on the baskets, whatever it may be. There's seven chances remaining. Wow, 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 wow. Make sure you don't miss out on this opportunity. It's one of those... And again, Dave, it's so exciting that you're going to be in Hong Kong. Let me just stop you there, Al, because I, I hate to do this, right? Go on. But it's not one of those. It's one on its own. True. There is nothing that has been happened like this. There is, True. That's the reality, you know. And, and I know, like, we, it's one of those shows. It's not. We've had amazing shows. We have so never had shows. anything like this. But this is just outrageous, and you can tell by the response. You can tell by the people that say, "I'm not interested in Mother of Pearl. I'm not interested in Pearl's full stop." But this, I got this to own it. Their and mind. I've got the butterfly, and jewel? I've got the pendant. Yeah. And uh, Ross is saying that we've already had pre bids on the other pieces in this show. And we don't even know how you've done that. No, oh, you find a way. Yeah, you do. Get this home. Follow Dave on his journey to Hong Kong. Oh, my oh for goodness. sure. Yeah, absolutely. Um, good Join morning. Dave on social media as well. Uh, they are beautiful. I have all of them. Thank you. See, oh, Sharon. See, how Sharon, has Sharon, how, how Sharon done that? Sharon, that is exactly what I'd do as well. That's exactly <laughs> what I'd do. You know, look, we've only seen two so far, but you've seen in those model shots the other pieces coming up, the ring, the earrings, and you've called up the contact center, or you've done whatever you've done, and you've got involved and well done. Now, that was the biggest so quantity, and that's just sold out. Someone's just had a, an interesting idea. Go on saying, could you hold the pendant to your ear for me, wow. please? Mm -hmm. Are you imagining these as earrings? You certainly can. Well, so we had a lot of multi-buyers, so I'm sure many of you probably like the, yeah. <gasps> yeah, what an idea. What an idea. Oh my goodness me, they'd be amazing as earrings. Look at the way they catch the light. Oh my goodness. Closer to the light as well. Was it Sarah? Sarah, that's a great idea. Well done. Stay holding. Make sure you're checking out on those. Um, we're doing the earrings now. What we're doing next? The ring. Okay, we're gonna do the ring. Now again, very limited. About 25 of these available. That's it. In the, the world, only ring that's in the, in the whole world. Show. Yeah. The only ring in the whole show matches dependent perfectly. Well, it matches everything flawlessly because it's all from that same grade, all from that one incredible harvest. This is an opportunity. This is an exquisite, oh, look at this. 
That's stunning. Yeah, look at that shimmer, that flame. Absolutely stunning. Wow. Uh, it's almost translucent. That's how spectacular uh, this is. How tightly bound this piece is. Oh, tell me what. Wow. Right, we're gonna bring this live. Good luck. One of the most limited of the whole show. Look, there you go. Sharon's already got it. Who messaged and said I've got everything? I don't. Swansea's <laughs> I don't already know how you've done it, but well Maker done. and Devon's already got it. Catherine in the city of Bristol's already got it. I promise you now I'm going to do a crazy deal on this, but we don't have a big quantity. Just so you know, you know. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That quality mm -hmm. is consistent. Oh, my goodness me. You can, I mean, sizing's not what you need to be concerned about right now. No, reset it. I'm, re I'm reading it. your mind no right now. No one's running out of silver right now. No. This is the material we're not going to be able to replace. Yeah. This is the material we can't get for you. Well done to everyone who's already in the queue. I know there is a queue forming. I know how frustrating that can be. Don't worry about your size. Just get this piece into collection. Just to show you how crazy this deal is going to be, I'm going to start at 199. Nowhere near done. Oh, Carol says that you're in love with this ring. Yeah, it's stunning. It is absolutely stunning. I think I just heard Wayne in the gallery saying, what? Yeah, sorry, Wayne. Starting at 199. Right, 30 second clock. I'm going to ask you to trust me right now. I'm going to look after you and I'm going to say it's going to be the lowest price of the whole show. I own just a piece of filigree mother of pearl, which is 80 years old, but nothing like this. That's the, that's the reality, uh, Catherine. You know, I've never seen anything like this apart from in the window of high jewelry. And now we get to own it. We get to, you know, to, to have it in our collection. That's to make the difference, it affordable. isn't it? Yeah. That's the difference. It, 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 it just, I, none of us will have seen it like no. this before. Unless, of course, you shop regularly in the places Absolutely. that you showed. Yeah. Wow. And it completely travels across the entirety as well, yeah. doesn't it? Full coverage. Right, straight down, crazy deal, 129. I said it was going to be the lowest what? price of the show. You guys already trusted us. You were already getting involved. You've, you've got involved before we even made it available. Um, that's the problem with showing you know, the glimpses of the pieces coming up uh, on our wonderful model shots that we were sharing with you. Leslie, you've got it. Make, you've got it. Maker in Oxfordshire. Patricia in Lincolnshire. Maker in Lincolnshire. Hazel in Hampshire. Sarah in Lincolnshire. Denise in Sheffield. Maker in Gloucestershire. Sharon in Wiltshire. Maker in Swansea's got two. Maker in Devon. You're there. Catherine in the city of Bristol. Four interest-free split payments. This is that unique suite, the elite suite of quad A grade. Uh, you can get both of these of for less pearl. than three hundred pounds. It's wild, isn't it? It's crazy, but fantastic crazy. Yes, the best kind. Oh my goodness me! Look at that color. Color it beyond. Do you know? Actually, Dave, even some of the finest opals don't produce that performance. For sure. And, and like, if they do, they do it in patches. You don't get the full coverage. No, and it doesn't travel no. to the extent that this is, because it's almost like a chatoyancy of yeah, of yeah, Chile. it is. Oh wow. Again, don't worry about your sizes. It's about owning your South Sea. Yeah, don't miss out on something like this because we don't have an R to S. No, because that's so easily rectified, isn't yeah. it? So so easily rectified. Absolutely stunning. A uh, one two nine, Dave. When I first saw this this collection, which was first thing this morning, yeah, there was no way in my wildest dreams. What have I imagined that I could possibly afford this? No, but you know, this is this is jewelry maker. This is what we do. You know, and that's why we have this level of trust. This is why people have already pre-ordered on the, the rest of this showcase. I've got involved because you know what we're about to do. You know what we always do and we're never going to let you down. And, 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 you know, if you were to speak to someone like Charlie right now and tell him about this. Oh. Yeah. Well, but let's not do that. No. Um, I mean, I'm not going to pick up the phone. But he would, he would, you know, be mystified look i'm gonna go lower on this i said i was gonna do the lowest price of the show and i'm gonna do a great great deal on this i'm gonna give you a 30 second clock there's only 10 left well done to everyone who's got involved we're gonna do the unthinkable there's only one place to go for this remember we have the the wonderful floral car pieces coming up they're amazing in this show too. and they're just as limited as this there is now 10 opportunities we are going lower we're about to lose all sizes. If you want to multi buy, this is how you come in and do it. You know, just get wow. involved, call that number on your screen, use the website, use the app. 
129 is where we're at, which is 32 pound 25 in interest free split payments. But we're going lower. In fact, we're going to 99.99. We're going to take it to double, double figures. figures. Yeah. And you said, you know, when you saw this out, you never dreamt you could be able to afford it. No. Well, this is this is an unbelievable deal. And again, it's, things have changed in the pearl market. More than any other market. More than any other gemstone in history. You know, wow. to hold up an 880 wholesale price, $1,000, um, you know, South Sea Pearl Strand. I mean, you know, you guessed, you know, 10 grand, 20 grand, 15 grand, but 880 wholesale. And the years that are invested to actually uh, to achieve this material. Yeah, yeah. 10 if, years, 10 if, years. 10 yeah. years. If it... And it, usually it, it's just a bidding war. You don't even get yeah. a look in. We don't see it. That's why it's so exciting and that's why you've gone crazy for it. do a minute to it. close this one out. We've only got eight chances remaining. Yeah. Please, please, please don't worry about your size. Just no. worry about getting that unique South Sea Mother of Pearl Quad A grade pink tile wow. maxima. Yeah, that's so easily solved. It's about owning the actual piece. Uh, and and uh, are staff are allowed to get involved in this after the show because oh, this yeah, is Oh yeah, but there won't be anything left, Al. I apologize well, I'll try. I will um, wish list it. Yes. And many of you will be doing the same. You know, wish list it if you're not successful. We understand how limited this showcase is, but realistically, for this level, we're yeah. lucky to have more than one. Can we, uh, I'll just shout out, this is just a few of the names that are waiting. Yeah. Margaret, Gail, Karen, Helen, Mary, Jackie, Mark, Jeannie, Valerie, Dorset, Gloucestershire, Sharon, and you disappear off the bottom of the screens. If you, if you are waiting to check out, don't wait. If you are on the phone line, stay where you are. If you've got it in your basket on the app, check it out it yeah. will sell out today and this is irreplaceable this opportunity For sure 100 percent. certainly at the prices we're being accustomed to right now this is not a possibility yeah forward. that yeah that's that's true if you've got the very deep pockets so it's a possibility oh, you, you, then you are one of the very fortunate few who can maybe get this you know when you see it in mayfair or in knightsbridge or mm. bond street but i certainly can't so well done to you guys who have managed to get involved today wow the final auction the final auction this floral unique carving that i think has been pre-ordered more heavily than anything else oh. ridiculously limited you caught a glimpse of it when we shared with you the model shot earlier on when we were showing you the butterfly pendant um, and you could see it in the ear this piece is about to become available good luck around 25 of these available no one's worried about sizes here this is your opportunity. So the the earrings. Well, it, it, it comes on a pendant sort of bail, but easily rectified again. But you get two. You do get two. Oh. Yeah. So I oh my God, look at the phone lines. Sharon's got it. Gloria's got it. Maker in Nottingham's got it. Maker in Swansea's got two. Pamela in Monmouthshire, you've got it. Catherine in the city of Bristol, you've got it. Valerie in Somerset. Maker in Devon. Pamela in Devon. Maker in Great London. Hazel, you're there. Denise, you're there. We've got uh, Maker in Cumbria, Cambridgeshire, Kent, Northamptonshire, Oxfordshire, Greater Manchester, Gainer, you're there. Karen, Tracy, Maker, Karen. Yeah. Lots of multi buyers. You get two anyway. I didn't realise you got the two of them. Yeah. So you can already, oh my goodness me. Absolutely exquisite. Maker in Cumbria's got two. Maker in Swansea's got two. In, in terms of you've multi-bought on this pair. Wow, sorry, bear with me. I'm just putting these on a T-bar for you to see. Because you, I didn't realize that. I thought it was just one mm -hmm. single. And in the center again, you've got the finest, purest, colorless topaz. Again, there's the artistry of something like this, Dave. Not just the, yeah. you know, the rarity of the material. Wow. Okay, I'm going to do one price and one price only. 30 second clock. How many do we have remaining, Ross? Oh, 11. Okay. 11 chances. A lot of you multi buying. Make sure you're getting involved. Look at those. Phenomenal. Wow. It is special. And I think many of you are multi buying. You're probably looking to maybe make a ring as well, um, maybe a pendant. And of course, the earrings. Wow. And then super easy. Wow. Straight down 99.99. We've got to finish the show with one wild deal. That's exactly what we're doing. Oh my goodness. Congratulations. Hand carved, but works of art, but with the finest, some of the most precious materials 100%. on earth. 99.99 yeah and uh barbara tracy linda moira i'd be confirming if you can 
Jane, Maker in Kent, Maker in Northamptonshire, Oxfordshire, Greater Manchester, East Sussex, Swansea, Hampshire, Tracy's got three, Maker in Cumbria's got two, Maker in Swansea's got two. Three chances remain. Look at that. It's actually translucent like almost, rainbow, isn't it? A rainbow shimmer. This one here, mm -hmm. look at the top the top few petals. Yeah. Oh my goodness me. That's the difference, yes, Dave. That is. And th I'm so grateful for you to introducing oh, this to because if it wasn't like I say for your relationships and yeah. the the travels, there's no way on earth we'd have seen something like this. No. Especially at an affordable price tag. So that's the unique thing. Wow. Two left. The final two. Good luck everyone. They are absolutely amazing. Truly, truly amazing. One left. Amazing. Congratulations. Love it. I love it. I love it. If you miss out on any of these opportunities, then wish list it. Um, don't leave it. That's really the only other absolutely. opportunities we can bring. Yep, the sure. likelihood of you repeating this. It's not this. happening again. So wish list <laughs> it is what I would say. Yep. Make sure you're putting yourself on the wish list. That is your only chance, realistically. Um, absolutely appreciate you being with us or with me this morning i know charlie is coming up as well and l you've got an incredible masterclass coming up yes we have uh, it's been wonderful to be with you um, uh, with sorry dave yeah. we've just noticed a bit of a typo on our graphics they are not cubic zirconia yes it says cz on right. our graphics okay I didn't they are see not that. cz no okay so it's they are pass. zircon oh zircon wow beautiful zircon so, oh, oh it's been rectified it. there okay, you go thank rectified you, that not cz um, four millimeter round brilliant cuts are absolutely amazing. There's still one that opportunity to get hold of that. Dave, thank you wow. so much. Wow. Yeah. I have to say that's probably one of the best, my favorite showcases. Good, I'm glad. And mine you. too. Um, so well done to anyone who got involved. We still have incredible shows coming up over the weekend and obviously into next week as well. Yeah. It's going to be sensational. So stay tuned. Um, and I know that you've got an incredible show coming up. Oh, as well. we certainly do. Thank you thank once you. again. Isn't he wonderful? Massive congratulations to each and every single one of you um, on what, what can only be described as, a, as an absolutely incredible achievement. Um, now, coming up at 12 o'clock, yes, we have got the most amazing masterclass with Charlie. But also after the break, we have the most incredible parcel of Nan Hong that I have ever seen. Um, so don't miss out on that, jewelry makers. Make sure you check out your baskets and join us after this. Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. You've actually caught me in the middle of making quite a tough decision. Which bow tie am I going to wear Friday morning? You're probably wondering why you're going to be wearing a bow tie. Well, this weekend, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, we're going to be showcasing some of our favourite exquisite gemstones. I'm really excited to be launching the weekend with Carol, Tom and the amazing crew. So in my project hours, nine o'clock, one of my favourite ever gemstones is the Power Shell. And this is one of the necklaces that I'm going to be showcasing. And this particular piece also comes with a free PDF download. So you'll be able to make projects with the kit and it includes this incredible brand new sliced cylinder barrel bead that's just beautiful so power shell in the nine o'clock project hour and then at 12 o'clock a gemstone that i rarely get to use it's so beautiful and it comes with the most incredible parve set gemstone connectors jadeite this is the butterfly absolutely exquisite and there's also a featured koi carp connector too and again, these will come with a PDF download so you'll be able to make this beautiful piece of jewellery. So that's this Friday, the 9th of February. Join myself, Carol and the team for the beginning of the exquisite Gem Weekend. And I may also give you a few more snippets regarding my birthday show next week. Take care, see you soon. Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. 
Remember, standard P&P is three ninety five. Charges may differ outside the UK, or upgrade to our premium option of five ninety five. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Ah, welcome back, jewelry makers. Just wow. You know, that's what, when, when, after you've seen something that just leaves you saying that wow, speechless. It's mesmerizing. So beautiful. Yeah. Stunning. You know, and, and it made me think, while Dave was talking, he was saying, you know, what to take changes a gem to a jewel. I was like, that's true. Yeah, genius, yeah. It's so true. Yeah. When you almost don't think you want it until you see it. Yeah. That's a jewel. Holding that butterfly was special. It's special. Very special. Colours mm. were Amazing. Fabulous. Massive congratulations to each and every single one of you. Now maybe, just maybe, we have the perfect gemstones for you maybe to suspend your butterfly from or your pendant, whichever it might be. Or just maybe you are a high-end, ultra-rare gem collector and you have tuned into Jewelry Maker thinking, no, surely, surely they can't bring me the finest quality Nan Hong parcel that I've ever seen. Well, listen, I was introduced to Nan Hong maybe, what, a year ago, possibly? Um, Nan Hong is not to be mistook for any other variety of your agates. Nan Hong and Sakura, if you like, are very different to any other variety of agates out there. Firstly, they are one of the few natural examples. Um, and it's often referred to as one of the darlings of the agate family. It's mined in China as well. And I'm just gonna say it as it is, it's expensive. It's incredibly expensive. Can I show you um, a bracelet, a single bracelet, can I also just point out this bracelet has zero translucency. It's completely opaque. $680. It does look more like a poppy jasper. I totally agree. It isn't. It is Nan Hong Agate. But again, I, I, I don't mind sticking my neck out and saying, for me, that's nowhere near the quality that you're going to see in this parcel. Even for us here at Jewelry Maker, where we introduced Nan Hong, I reckon about a year ago, I've never seen this grade. Never seen this grade. So instead of taking my word for it, if I skip forward on this presentation, there's an article which describes Nan Hong, because I'm still very much learning about Nan Hong agate. You can see a beautiful image there. It's often carved in the same way that jade eye is. And it's an introduction. I won't read all of it because it's very lengthy. Um, but it talks about the history, where it was discovered, royalty. I think the second sentence down is talking about used by the royal family and nobles. 
but if we just focus on um, the highlighted part um, that says the discovery of Sashuan Nang Hong um, has greatly alleviated the problems of low output supply, i.e. Uh, many grain cracks and exhausted mining in Boshan Nan Hong and led to a new Nan Hong fever. For a time, the price of Nan Hong agate soared and became the darling of the collection, uh, collection industry again. Nowadays, nowadays, the price of southern red agate has soared all the way. So what that, uh, in a nutshell, that introduction talks about how historically um, it has been a gemstone that has been uh, favoured, worn by nobles and royal family. Ming dynasties um, used to use this gemstone a lot within their own personal collection and then it was almost completely mined out until more recently it was discovered once again. But the price is remarkably high. You know, um, Shanghai Daily, here's a little headliner for you saying red, rare red agate makes a comeback that's not come back in terms of popularity it's always been incredibly popular um but it's a comeback in terms of its supply into its availability in itself so again that's one amazing headline but again here at jewelry maker i have never seen i've never seen nan hong like this before there's a little buddha in this presentation and i want to show it beautifully carved like i said it's often carved um in the same way that your agate, uh, sorry, your jadeites are. Um, so, in fact, I'm fairly sure we have done jadeite carvings like this. Look how sweet he is. That's cute. And apparently, if you rub his belly, he brings you happiness. Oh. Now, but I've never brought you, I've never brought you a Nan Hong agate carving like that. But what I really want to focus on is not the artistry. Look at its translucency. Mm. Look how he glows. The parcel of Nan Hong that you're about to see today, and I've never, I don't mind saying this, I've never said, focused on translucency when bringing you, bringing you Nan Hong before. It's always more been about the color. And Nan Hong, you take on the same kind of mind concept as you do when grading your jades, jadeite, nephrite, whichever it might be. Translucency, that, that fine, not coarse, uh, crystal structure. If it was coarse, you wouldn't see, it would be opaque. You wouldn't see the play of light. Um, yeah, let's skip through, because high quality Nan Hong agate is uh, as, as a uniform color. See the second on the right hand side of this next uh, um, article. So um, let's read that together, jewelry makers, because it is actually um, really important. So Nan Hong agate, uh, which is especially valued if red. Could it be any more red? I can t it's hands down the best parcel we've ever done. Hands down. Um, and even more valuable, uh, luxury items whose price has increased greatly. Um, it is a waxy, opaque appearance and it grows brighter as it's handled. So it glows. But go over to the other side, the right hand side, that's what I want to focus on. High quality Nan Hong Agate uh, has a uniform colour saturation. That's exactly what this is, a beautiful uniformed color saturation across every single one of your rounds. And it talks about a carved piece, uh, the size of an egg can be sold for 1 million won, which is about 162,000 US dollars. 162,000, it's the size of an egg, but it's about the consistency of the color um, and also that translucency. Again, have a little look at this. This is an auction house, a Chinese auction house, a string of Nan Hong agate um, with a Buddha head. Um, went to auction, there's the estimate, price realized, including the commission. That's the comparison, by the way. That's what, sorry, the, the um, exchange. 24,860 pounds from one to pounds. 24,000. This is why when I started this opportunity, this showcase, I wanted to say, please do not compare or think that Nan Hong is in any way near the same 
league as your died agate because they are so worlds apart and there is a rush for this beautiful gemstone as the supply is once again um, being available you can see them how they're buying it this is the same way that they actually buy uh, jade as well along the streets um, um, in particular say your uh, Kotan jade is but it literally displayed like so and individuals will go and buy it in its rough so they can go on to carve it now this again I know I've said it repeatedly genuinely is the best Nan Hong parcel that we've ever bought ever 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 bought I don't know how much there are in terms of quantity but it's about that translucency and remember that solid color those articles weren't my words that was the article well, it was uh, it was a Chinese publicist who know this gemstone far 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 better than I do we've got it in three strands drums eight to nine millimeter rounds and also we've got four to five millimeter rounds they're coming your way but first I'm going to start with from that same parcel a bracelet kit let me get a piece of paper first you only have 20 available and you have they're all set for you you can turn them into connectors if you want don't have to be a bracelet it's up to you so look at the amount of precious metal that you're getting with it within this as well I'll hold them up look at the recording look at all that oh my goodness me solid red color remember when it's red it's especially sought after and highly valued these are solid red aren't they you have all the luxury components to make your high-end piece of jewellery. I'm going to hold just um, one of them up, if you like. And you can see, perfectly set within your precious metal. And then you have um, the stone in the centre there as well. Look at that. That's natural, stunning. Nan Hong. It is stunning. That's just one of the components, of which you get two, four, six, seven. And then in between that, you've got those lovely sterling silver, very uh, um, very Cartier, Chanel, that's it, thank you. Very Chanel-esque. Now, how many do we have of these then, Roscoe? Oh, my goodness. There was the, that's the, that was the, uh, um, oh, gosh, why have I lost for words? That was the... When so inspiration, thank you. That was the inspiration to this collection. I want to show you the piece of uh, the collection that we're looking at. A suite that sold at wholesale. Um, again, with the high goos like you're seeing right now. If uh, um, that's talking about the buy color, it would sell for two or three times the price in the market. But actually, when you look inside your um, high goos, some of them have got the buy colors. There's areas of white coming through as well. Did you say we had quantity of these? 20 available opportunities. It's the finest strand of Nan Hong Agate that I've ever seen because of that beautiful translucency. And look at that red. It's so, so incredibly intense. Even here at 599, if we've got sweets that were selling at $1,800, not one, that's dollars. I agree, I think ours is nicer. I don't think that is a sweet, to be fair. It's a bit of a mix. It's a bit of a concoction, isn't it? Bit of a concoction of pieces of jewellery. You don't have to turn this into the bracelet if you don't want. We're at £599. Turn it into seven pendants. Turn it into some amazing earrings. Tassel earrings, yeah. Beautiful earrings. Mm. We are not stopping there. Natural, certified. <coughs> Excuse me, Nanhong Agate. Today, you can get the entire kit project collection whichever way you want to word it get all of this for an amazing 129 pounds of course it is framed beautifully within your 925 sterling silver i'm holding one of them up but you've actually got what um seven others you've also got the the lobster claw you've got the extender chain you've got those lovely very very chanel inspired um encrusted pieces to go alongside it's just like putting together the most beautiful luxurious puzzle but what a collection opportunity so purely because nan hong has been around for centuries it's one of those amazing gemstones as it said in that article that was uh favored by royalty 
uh, and nobles exclusively really um, until recently and of course was pretty much mined out until uh, recently Nan Hong fever hits again now if you've got it in your basket then please do make sure you're checking it out because we only had 20 and I've got multi buyers Suzanne is saying thank you very much jewelry maker I will make sure I get four of those good uh, well done to you that's absolutely amazing again remember if you want the perfect strand to go alongside it I've got those two uh, coming your way June you can do it incredible make sure you're checking out there is no glow like Nan Hong it has this and again we're looking at it in the worst possible lighting conditions if you were to take this outside they just light up um, and by the way this showcases of five pieces is there oh no oh, oh sorry I beg your pardon we've got new pieces that we can bring you as well I beg your pardon okay up next I think this is going to pull on your heartstrings because we showed in that we showed in that article there was some it's often carved in the same way that jadeite is this oh look at him is your little pixu i love pixus he's one of my favorite mythical creatures and they are believed to bring you they're staunchly loyal they will protect you and they're believed to bring you prosperity and wealth because I did buy this, yeah, I bought this, I bought two. In fact, you've just reminded me, I've still got Dave's Pixu. Um, yeah, I bought one at the time on, on air. So the little Pixu is great to give someone because he's believed to bring you prosperity and wealth. The only thing that a Pixu will feed on is jewels and gold, precious metal. So he feeds on that and that's bringing the, the wearer all that wealth. Um, he's often depicted, there he is, look at that absolutely amazing look at the detailing of him he's kind of like a dragon a cross dragon cross dog right very sweet very very sweet uh nanhong agate a rare stone a rare a rare source agate in dark red is mainly produced um in boshan it is considered uh, conductive, uh, condu I can't say conducive uh, to people's digestive systems, intestines, and stomach, and is popular amongst Buddhists. A small Nanhong agate bead used to cost only several won back in 2000, but prices soared to hundreds of won in 2005, and collectors continue to push the price to tens of thousands of won after 2011, um, according to new uh, portal news. Um, a price of Nanhong agate can be sold at up to over 10,001. That's, I mean, wow. Per gram, $62,000. Per gram. That's a statement, isn't it? It's a, it, this is not an inexpensive stone by any stretch of the imagination. And remember that intense red? Look at him. There are only five. I bought these on the original launch. He is drilled, by the way. He's got a, a very, um, um, a very discreet drill hole. So he can actually be suspended beautifully. We're going to do this in one, um, in one price crash. Look how cute he is. I love the little Pixu. There's a story of the Pixu. I'd read that on another occasion. If I had bigger quantity, we could go to it at greater length. But he's very protective and he's believed to bring you prosperity, wealth. He's a mythical creature and that is beautiful. There's the drill hole. You can see it there. Beautifully hand carved. Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine pence only. Gigi in California, you've got yours. Mark in Cheshire, you can do it too. Natural Nan Hong, but a work of art as well. He's stunning, absolutely stunning. Yeah, and apparently, if you wear him facing out, facing outwards, not inwards. I think that's the right way. I right. think I've said that the right way. Maybe research it. But if you face him out, so he can collect, so he can collect all the abundance. This is and gold and wealth. It's very new to me. I don't know anything about this. It's, it's cool, wonderful. isn't it? And listen, yeah, neither did I up yeah. until very recently. I've learned all of this from um, Dave. Uh, just amazing. Little Pixu, he's half, he's kind of like cross dragon, cross dog. Right. So you can feed him the precious metal chain. Yeah. To make it a bracelet. There we go. Oh, clever. Ah, there I you like go. It. And he will do lots of good things for you as well. Again, some price comparisons for you on your Nang Hong. This is just a simple beaded necklace, which, by the way, we're getting to in a second. Um, but wow, you won't believe the price per. Oh, there we go. $12,500 US dollars per carat, not per strand, per carat. Gigi, you got yours. I've got sorry there, Julie there, and also Mark there. Make sure you do check out. Let's start. And I'm going to ask or just stand for a bust, if I may. Um, I've got three strands, that's it. 
we're going to start with the largest and when we look at that image that we just saw by the global times 12,500 US dollars per carat and we fully appreciate you know the quality the intensity that solid red color that article earlier on referenced do we all agree that this is of that same absolutely amazing amazing grade translucent now I'm fairly confident in saying that we will have a limited quantity of these such as the rarity of Nan Hong is that right yeah okay all I'll say is good luck to each and every single one of you it is worthwhile in fact I would strongly advise getting your certificate of authenticity you have 60 second countdown that's to your graphics how many available Ross 49 exactly 49 Nan Hong fever, the price, pushing the prices, the demand is pushing those prices even further, even higher than what are, oh, let's not be, let's, let's say it as it is, thousands of pounds per carat on this amazing gemstone. How, and I know so many of you ask it, how do you do it then? I'll be frank, it is probably, it is because Dave goes to Hong Kong like he is next month. He travels the world to source opportunities like this. He builds those amazing relationships. You know, and doesn't ask how much can we get, it's how low can I bring it to air. We've got 49 though, and that that's an incredible quantity when we're talking about the size, the quality, the colour, the fact that this is 175 carats of beautiful, pure, vibrant red, like the article that said only a few moments ago, with that translucency, look at that grade. Get your certificate. That's probably my advice. Well, that's definitely my advice. When we're talking about the rarity of Nan Hong Agate, definitely get your certificate of authenticity. That's a gem lab uh, um, authority, effectively, that is certifying your gems. The graphics are live. We want to see you there. There's only three strands. Um, that, well, we've got two rounds here. Might be able to bring you a couple of others. But this has got to be one of the biggest quantities that I've seen in Nan Hong full stop. Would you agree? It's up there, says Roscoe. It's definitely the best parcel I've seen. Not opaque in the slightest. First one's gone, well done. When we've just discussed 12,500 US dollars per carrot, 2,999 pounds for the whole strand is not bad. Still beyond my reach. Mm, oh, mine. Mine too. But when you compare the two, the quality of the stone, the origin of the stone, it's exactly the same. Same mine. The translucency. The only thing that differs is we're not selling it in a jeweler's. We're not, you know, we could take these to Hong Kong alongside, you know, that mother of pearl. We could do all that. And again, we could say how much can we get for it well the price is uh, in the market is is xyz we don't do that we think how low can we bring it to our collectors it's always been the ethos of gem, of jewelry maker and ultimately gemporia next price crash making its way towards a jewelry maker price point wow that you know that's beyond a jewelry maker price tag i was expecting you to go in with 299 in a minute's time though apparently we're going even lower it's the finest i know i keep repeating this it's the finest parcel of dan hong i've seen because you've got translucency and that solid red color today in 60 seconds we're just under we are going to squeeze this jewelry makers under 100 pounds for nan hong agate under 100 pounds we had 49 available opportunities Oh, there's no colour like it. Again, the glow. And that, and that photoshopped image. And I'm not being... 
rude it's 100 percent photoshopped you can see that can't you to the untrained eye which mine is i can see that that is photoshop so that's the best they're ever gonna look and they're at 12,500. we're in a poorly lit flood lit lit studio not with specialist twinkly lights or special uh, um, effects or filters and look at how beautiful it is on your screens wow nan hong ag to me i always have a jade out price tag in my head yes. Because it's the, it, that's how it's looked at. It's treated as a jade. It's carved in, in many ways like jade is um, in, in the East. I've got hiccups. Um, and to be able to bring it to our audience at £26.99 only, make sure you're checking out. We had 49 There's lots of you there. Would you, uh, if your budget allows, imagine multi-buying. Again, just to recap, that solid red colour with amazing translucency. It, you're talking high prices when it's coarse crystal same you need to have the same hat on if you like when you're grading your jadeite if it's got a coarse crystal um, then it becomes very very opaque that's not the case here you've got that bl uh, beautiful glow and translucency London Suzanne Sarah uh, another Susan well don't you multi buyers getting involved you can use your 0% interest split payment as well lovely jewelry makers um, that's yeah that's there it's already an unbelievable price tag at 79.99 and i'm gonna say it ross that's about 200 pounds if that would have been 299 that's why i was expecting you to stop and then maybe close at 149 on launch you think the strands were shorter half the half the length yeah i think i remember that half the length now Fast becoming Ross's favourite shape. I do agree. I love the drums. Have you seen them? Yeah, they're cute, aren't they? Because they're going to create that really lovely linear mm. light look. I'm with you, Ross. I agree. And in jade eye, it's fast becoming my favourite shape. In fact, I would re I'd be reaching for the phone lines on this one. Look at that textbook Nang Hong it is so worth you getting your certificate of authenticity because you know firstly if you want to get your gemstones whatever it might be certified in gem lab you have to send it off and it's expensive it's going to cost you probably best part of 300 pounds there or thereabouts um so if you get the offered that service for free take it or for a matter of pennies take it because having the province of this gemstone in black and white is invaluable you know in the same way that, uh, personally if i was buying a diamond i wouldn't buy it without a, its certificate oh no you wouldn't would no. you this is offered to you at pennies and it's so worth it because moving forward i always look at it this way yes if i do want to sell it not that i would but if i do want to sell it then you could say, well, this is the price of Nan Hong. They, you, you, you've got that. You've got that reference. But also, when I pass, I'm not expecting my girls to have the knowledge of what Nan Hong Agate is. So to have that information there at their fing uh, fingertips, natural, translucent, cherry tomato red. I know it's not. It's not a gemological term. It's not it's like your coat. It, it is. It, it in, is in sunset. In gemstone farm. It's yes. Stunning under 100 pounds and that's just for starters it's a full 38 centimeter strand ross raises a very good point i think we did the nan hong launch didn't we and i think the strands 19 centimeters says ross it's, it was a while ago granted i agree i don't think they were full 38 centimeter strands but then this is the thing we might that might have been a first purchase we might have been a little bit more cautious about quantities now we know that you love it we know we've learned more about nan hong agate so now we're like oh we'll get as much as we can but it sense. has to be that top grade yeah. that top quality so that's the learning curve imagine this teamed alongside your type a jadeite maybe alongside your kotan i mean oh.
the clock is ticking not to close the auction we're taking it even lower again you can use your 0% interest lovely jewelry makers um, that's there for you I don't have quantity I won't have quantity when it comes to Nan Hong Agate it's not to plea it is still very much being mined it, but the demand for this gemstone remember they referred to it as Nan Hong fever wow okay I was expecting it to be a little bit higher because with your drums you have you still have to make the the, the, the the circular shape and then effectively you use a percentage of the gemstone at either end. £23.33 pence on your split payment, jewellery makers. Tracy, Sarah, London, Suzanne, Cumbria, Susan, London, new customers. Multi buyers getting involved. Um, make sure you're checking out everybody. It's absolutely beautiful and there's no colour like it. Actually, saying that, you know what? There is a colour like it. Type A red jadeite, <laughs> which which again commands is is very expensive. The interest payment, interest free payments are mental. Aren't they are, aren't they? Aren't they? Aren't they? To get they? such collectible gemstones like this. Yes. When again, the you know the information that we present to you here at Jewelry Maker, which really is one of the uh, main reasons why the Financial Times are coming along to do a, a, um, a, an article That's on exciting. on Jewelry Maker and Gemporia because what jewelers do you go in even the most expensive jewelers in the world do you go in and they'll say well this is Nan Hong there's some articles that I can read through and talk to you about the history of the gemstone you know what the gemstones are no jeweler does that no. I didn't have the knowledge I didn't have the knowledge of uh, of gemstones when I worked in the jewelers and 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 we were selling the likes of Piaget, Cartier, Chopin, Bulgari all of those you know Please that's the difference that. it is that's it's invaluable The best price Nan Hong we've ever done, says Ross. It's also the most beautiful colour. Uh, look at this colour. Oh my goodness me, that's insane. That is beautiful. That's insane. I guess the smaller the stone, the deeper the colour. Yeah, that makes sense. These are natural and we have an absolutely amazing 100 quantity. That's probably one of the biggest quantities we've actually ever had in Nan Hong. And Ross said in my ear, it's actually the lowest price Nan Hong that I think we've ever done. I want to buy some of these, Ross. He says, the quantity says you might be able to, however, the price might be the kicker. Okay, I tell you what, let's get the graphics live. How many of us are watching right now? And I, I'm, guessing, I'm guessing that this question, quite a few people will say, no, I don't yet. How many people own Nan Hong? I'm going to, yeah, not many people will say that they own Nan Hong. Do you know what? Maybe... Not point, not, 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 of the whole world, it's a minuscule percentage. But we are talking about a very ultra rare, not to be confused with your usual agates. This is natural and some of the finest quality I've seen. You're about to see a hundred quantity, which is mad. That's mad. At the lowest price that we believe we've seen ever. And, again, just to solidify the best quality we've seen ever. Your first deal, just to show you what you're not paying, and then I'm going to encourage you to join us. I want today, the reason why I asked how many of us actually own Nan Hong, I do, I bought it on the launch. Mine are the shorter strands. Um, that's your first price crash jewellery maker. Today, jewellery makers, sorry, plural. Um, today... If you are thinking, I've always wanted it, L, but it's never been within my budget, then hopefully today's the day. Join us on the web. Join us on the phone lines. It's fast becoming one of the most popular sizes as well. You have that beautiful translucency, translucency and that amazing, intense cherry tomato red. In fact, it's beyond cherry tomato red. This is pillar box red, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, it's got a wonderful depth to it. I imagine it's quite popular with uh, fellas. Yeah, you know, maybe a bit of leather. Oh, That'd be beautiful. Valentine's Day. Yeah, I know this is it. 
I've never seen a red that, you know, normally with, with jadeite, it's cherry tomato red. This is pillar box red. I'm hoping that comes across on your screens. Our first price crash, but not where we are close. Look at that color, that's natural. I'm gonna say these words, not stop in there. Purely because of the quantity. When we say textbook, red nanhong agate it is exactly this when you see this magnified nanhong agate round in this article there you go that's what i have draped across the back of my hand here in the studio without question yeah without definitely. question oh yeah do you reckon that one there that's photographed with all the photoshopping and everything Looks lovely, don't get me wrong. It's tweaked though, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Do you reckon that's $39.99? I doubt it. Neither's yours, by the way. But I need to emphasise that this is no reflection of the true value or worth. Jewelry makers, Nan Hong fever. Um, and that is purely because the rediscovery, the re-offering of this gemstone. Hello, Gloria. OMG, on screen, this colour is phenomenal. Absolutely. And do you know what? In person as well, Gloria in person when did you see it at home it's insane normally you know i say all the time gloria cherry tomato red it's not that it's like telephone box red and it's totally natural totally natural 29 pounds and 99 pence look at that this is why at the beginning of the hour we said it's the best show it's the best parcel of nanhong i've ever brought to wear and most likely will i don't know i'm not saying it's not my it's mined out it's not it's still very much uh, um in operation however nanhong fever is pushing really pushing the price up on this amazing gemstone which makes being able to actually source it for a crazy look at split pay seriously yeah look at the split pay i've looked up sorry yeah, yeah i caught that too <laughs> under a tenner i know it's bonkers isn't it under 10 pounds natural certified in black and white nan hong agate natural the best color i've ever seen Lengthy the finest strand. color there's a lot on there yeah there's a lot of stones on there when you see strands like this and when you see jewel gemstones like this you know for me charlie i keep it really simple and not it and it uh, will yeah. be it's all about the stone yeah. i don't want to complicate no, it no. it is all about the stone are you with me i'm on that? with you on that no distractions it, it doesn't need it no it doesn't need it because nice you've clasp. got You've got, yeah, nice class, yeah. absolutely. Because you've got years of history, you know, that's what I would put, put throw Definitely. my uh, uh, um, sort of time into, is actually getting all that information. And I'm happy to send them to you as well. All that information talking about your Nan Hong Agate. Yeah, it's the rarity. It's, it's mesmerizing, it's beautiful. Well, think how few natural red gemstones there yeah, are. I agree, yeah. Most There's of them are many. died, aren't they? Yes. Most of them. Um, type A jadeite. And that's not the same. That's not the same color as this. Um, type A jade is much more, like I said, cherry tomato color. Whereas this is that pillar box color. Having said that, this is an exceptional strand. I've never seen anything which is literally pillar box red before. Um, well done, everybody. Make sure you are checking out those baskets. Not long to wait until I bring you. Oh yeah, there is. Is it there? It's over there. Um, oh, Charlie's amazing mask off. Can we turn that ring towards mm. Dan just to show? Oh, I did make a beeline for this, Charlie. Oh, did you? So did my that, daughter. <laughs> that's beautiful. I, I, that's not down to me. I didn't design it. I just set the lovely stone. And it's, I'm pretty sure it's a crumbs out. Cr oh, Is that right? hang on. Double check because I do forget stuff. No I'm probs. Pretty sure that's what it is. And it's beyond simple to set. Oh my, what a colourless kunzite. It's, it's got a very soft pink, soft pink. to it. Uh, there's two, I might... I oh might... no, 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 that, yeah, there's the... Is that, that right? That one's the zircon that you're looking at right now. The one that, yeah, no, the one that Charlie's got is the zircon. Right. This is the zircon, look at the fire. But we also do have one in a kunzite. Yes. That's where you're getting that. Minas Gerais kunzite, natural Brazilian kunzite. Wow. We're going to show you as well, just to give you a sneaky peek. Now, we're about 10 minutes away from uh, this mark. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Oh, that's so beautiful. That soft colour. 
Lauren has just passed me the most amazing pendant oh, bale. Yes. Those two. So yeah, you've got the gemstone. Is that tanzanite? Is that, that right? you, oh, that you set within your yes. pen and bell. There's a time tonight, there's a certificate. So it sets within the actual mount itself. Oh my goodness, that's incredible. Look at the quality of that tanzanite. I was so excited when they arrived because I bought myself some fireball pearls. And Have I you? Did it, yes, and, I, and they arrived during the BNG competition and they've been sat calling me and as soon as... I realised oh. that that was Tanzanite. Like, come on. I can't not, can I? Yeah, it's got to be set with it. And honestly, they're so easy to set. I didn't even use any tools. Really? Yeah, I'm going to sh show you how to do that with the bigger ones so you can see what I'm doing, but it's exactly the same technique. How amazing. So these are coming up. We've got, what, literally minutes uh, to wait for that masterclass. Um, now, I've got one final Nanhong opportunity. I saw this getting handed in, the lovely Lauren, and you only do a double take, and I was like, oh, she's given me... Sometimes we have two sent over. I was like, Nan Nan Hong, we don't bundle Nan Hong. It's that... We shouldn't bundle Nan Hong. They're six millimetre rounds, because the rarity of the gemstone, you can't just casually say, oh, let's bundle it. You know what I mean? Individually, they close at $69.99 just for one strand. Well, that's amazing. It's not a 19 centimetre strand. They're full 38 centimetres. $69.99 is incredible. But are you sure we're getting two? Okay. Do you know what I'd do? I'd knot this with a Kotan jade. Ooh. That's the pedigree of Nan Hong. It, it's worthy of the finest gemstones that you have. And I gravitate towards your, your jades because it's often uh, treated and respected in the same level um, in the East. Like I said, it's carved in the same techniques. It's price, let's be honest. Yeah. In the jade categories, I would say. Do we have many of this bundle then? 30. I, I've never seen Nan Hong bundled before. That's a lot of carat weight, isn't it? It is, especially as we were casually throwing figures like yeah. $62,000. You know. Yeah. Casual, num casual numbers like that. But again, we're not Christie's, Bonham's, Sotheby's. Um, like we're not shop you're not shopping currently from in the East where they obviously will say, well, this, is the high this is the price. That's the market value right now. We do the polar opposite. We get a great deal, you get a great deal. Again, you have that, would you all agree, that telephone box red? Mm, yeah. With that translucency. Now, on its own, per strand, $69.99. Today, you can get the two. The bundle, the buy one, get one free, whichever way you want to refer to it. Oh, my goodness. £99.99. pence. Or you can get hold of it on your split payments, jewellery makers. Again, the colour is textbook. Absolute textbook. Um, definitely, I'm sorry I keep wittering on about this, but definitely get your certificate of authenticity. That is mm. invaluable to you. Um, especially if, you know, I mean, Dave said it earlier on, didn't he? He's taking pieces, his South Sea pearls, out of his own personal yeah. collection that he's going to cash in. I don't blame him for Savvy that. Man. Yeah. 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 Why I not? Get it. This that's when if you know when occasions like that say do arrive in the future, that's when you'll be thinking, Thank goodness I got that certificate of Definitely. authenticity. London, Cheryl, Elaine, congratulations, you just got two strands. Two strands of certified natural Nanhon agate, the darling of the agates, not to be confused between um the dyed varieties. And there's nothing wrong with dyed agate, don't get me wrong. There's nothing wrong, it's got its place. Um, it's more affordable, yeah. it's fun, it's cheerful, it's nice. But these are special. Yeah, that's the difference. And it's an education with your little certificate as well, isn't it? Yeah. Would it go with the little Pixu thingy you had with earlier? With the little Pixu? Yeah. Definitely. On a stretchy for a gem, oh. I think that would just pop, wouldn't it? So How nice. How great is that? So mm. nice. And there's a lot I of I did those. buy one for Tom. 
Yeah, yeah I bought one for my husband, oh, and I was so like, "This lovely. is a Pixu," and I told him the story of the Pixu. Oh. I was like, "They'll be, it'll bring you prosperity and wealth." He wears it on like a um, little, very oh. narrow macrame cord. How lovely! Yeah, that's it. That's exactly it. Yeah. Simple. Really, Keep really simple. simple. Yeah. If I had the strand, then I would have done that too. Well, yeah if I had the strand, but maybe today's the day. Make sure you're checking out, how many do you say, sorry? 30 available, London Cheryl Elaine, Maker in Cumbria, Mary Tracy, Susan, Northamptonshire. Uh, London, you're there as well, congratulations. Make sure you're checking out your basket. Um, as if we're bundling Nan Hong Agate, the darling of Agate, it's totally natural. What a collector's dream, what a collector's show this has been it's today. It's been fab, I've learned a lot. Oh, bless you, yeah. likewise, <laughs> likewise. Um, and we're gonna learn some more, aren't we, in the yeah, next hour? More. Yeah, a little bit more, it's more fun, actually. <sighs> just a bit of fun I loved it well so great I don't oh, I've got fun, a little bit of a but look story. at the result I know well that's that's the thing it's minimal effort maximum effect isn't it really is that's yeah. incredible that's absolutely lovely. incredible so we are going to delve further I love the gold one delve further into your amazing gem setting is that right yes just a little bit this one this one's one for everyone this morning. Are you telling me I could do this? My, I'm not kidding, my husband can do it. Now that's a statement, right? I'll tell you a little funny story. Have we got time to tell a quick story? You can tell a funny story. story. So my parcel arrived <clears throat> and my son was at swimming lessons and my husband had taken him and gone to go pick him up and bring him back. So the box came and tore it open, you know, like you do. Yeah. Stuck my hand in and I just lucky dip, you know, pulled one out, tipped the rest of the packet out on the kitchen counter and I took the, it was actually the, um, uh, garnet setting in the gold which Lovely. my daughter loves and uh, I tipped it all out they walked through the door my sons like they do I'm starving what's for tea yeah yeah and my hubby says oh I'll, I'll feed him is this your stuff do you want to just budget out the way and I says oh yeah that's fine Do look at that and he went did you just set that on the kitchen counter I'm like yes don't judge me honestly it is that simple he was gobsmacked Honestly, blink and you'll miss it. It is that easy. Um, but then look at it. And then look, 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 look. Look at it. Coming up in the next hour, Jewelry Makers, as part of your masterclass again. Um, uh, do we get, do we need instructions? Uh, you do get instructions, but I don't think you'll need oh, them. Oh, well, it's all good. It's all good. They come anyway, free. You can have them um, anyway. With your project. So don't go anywhere, Jewelry Makers. Join us after this. <laughs> Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. You've actually caught me in the middle of making quite a tough decision. Which bow tie am I going to wear Friday morning? You're probably wondering why you're gonna be wearing a bow tie. Well, this weekend, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, we're going to be showcasing some of our favorite exquisite gemstones. I'm really excited to be launching the weekend with Carol, Tom and the amazing crew. So in my project hours, nine o'clock one of my favorite ever gemstones it's the power shell and this is one of the necklaces that i'm going to be showcasing and this particular piece also comes with a free pdf download so you'll be able to make the project with the kit and it includes this incredible brand new sliced cylinder barrel bead that's just beautiful so power shell in the nine o'clock project hour and then at 12 o'clock, a gemstone that I rarely get to use. It's so beautiful. And it comes with the most incredible Parve set gemstone connectors, jadeite. This is the butterfly, absolutely exquisite. And there's also a featured Koi Carp connector too. And again, these will come with a PDF download so you'll be able to make this beautiful piece of jewelry. So that's this Friday, the 9th of February. Join myself, Carol and the team for the beginning of the exquisite Gem Weekend. And I may also give you a few more snippets regarding my birthday show next week. Take care, see you soon. Jewelry Maker, we only charge one PMP throughout the day. You can add as many items to your basket and check out and still only be charged once. Once you've checked out the first time and want to order again, you simply add the item to the basket and click on the Combine Order button. 
Remember, standard P&P is 395. Charges may differ outside the UK. Or upgrade to our premium option of 595. Shopping made easy on Jewelry Maker. Have you purchased one of our projects and want to download the instructions? Then simply log into your account at jewelrymaker.com. Go to your order history, find your order and click on download content. From there, you can save to your computer or print off a copy. Please note that your project sheets will be available once your order has been dispatched. Jewelry Maker, create, wear, share. Are you having trouble finding the ideal gift for that someone special? Then why not treat them to a Jewelry Maker gift card? Simply head over to the website and scroll down to the bottom of the page and click where it says Gift Cards. You can decide between posting the card or delivery by email. Then decide the value you would like to send. Whether it's for a birthday, a special occasion, or just a way to say thank you, the Jewelry Maker gift card is the perfect answer. Welcome back. Oh, we've been having so much fun. I can't <laughs> believe we're at 12 o'clock. It's been a wonderful oh, day. It's been lovely, I've isn't I've learned it? so much. Some lovely people, beautiful stones. It's literally been a great day. It has. And we've still got your amazing masterclass as well. Because speaking about beautiful, wow. Oh, Charlie, okay. these are stunning. Yeah, I mean, I was spoiled. I was, I was truly spoiled. And, you know, I don't, I've always said this. It doesn't matter if it's the most, to me simple of techniques if it's beautiful jewelry it's beautiful jewelry oh definitely it speaks for itself doesn't it it's yeah yeah it's quite a high-end thing is that keeping it simple because actually some of the most commercial jewelry in the world is actually very, very simple. simple very, very sim simple yeah yeah and it fetches a pretty price tag too. <laughs> absolutely a hundred percent i mean you think of, uh, of i don't know south sea pearls as we've been talking about them with dave today mm. if you see a single south sea pearl pendant it's not the most complex technique it's oh, probably no. just glued in the same manner that yeah. you're going to see uh, or that we show here um i don't know a four prong classic tiffany cut solitaire diamond ring not that hard to do not really i mean you can buy you can buy the mounts can't you you don't yeah. even have to make it no which is what these beautiful pieces are well this charlie just this now th uh, we've got a big quantity of these oh that's good because i want more <laughs> yeah now the price that we are going to take these to people won't just multi-buy oh, they're buy. probably going to get part uh, like tens mm. 20s maybe okay so i'll definitely have to be fast then because oh. firstly you think how popular your split peg or your peg bales are? Yes. How popular they are, full stop. They go crazy here at Jewelry Maker. Oh, I bet they do. Yeah, go I bet they do. Crazy. Because you don't have to be a gemstone setter, no. a wire worker. You don't really have to be a jewelry maker, do you? No. Let's be honest. I think I've just made my life hard because I've always made them, but I don't think I'm going to be doing that anymore because I've been given some to work with. Yeah. With the most beautiful stones and it's exceptional quality. I, I almost think your silver is closer to like a Britannia silver because it's so sparkly, yeah. it's so shiny, so bright. way shinier than anything I've seen. It's like a, it's like a bright rolled finish, yeah. very beautiful. And then you throw the stone in there. Oh. Sometimes it's like, it's not worth my while making it. No, I know, I know. I think for me, because I do a lot of jewellery repair, I need to understand how things are made. So if I learn how to yeah. make them, then I have a better yeah, no, understanding no, of repairing it. But yeah, I don't think I'll be doing that anymore. 
Um, plus, you get that beautiful tanzanite. And it is a tanzanite, everybody. It's just, it just pops. I mean, those fireball pearls, it brings out every colour in the pearls. So they are really exquisite. Now, we have quantity, 300 of them. Oh. They're also certified, can I just say? Oh, yeah, I got, yeah, yeah. You got the certificate of mm. authenticity to go alongside it too. So you can see the carat weight of your tanzanite, the size, etc. Of course, location is going to be Tanzania. Now, we have solid sterling silver. There they are at the bottom. Solid sterling silver in a split peg bale. And then you have that four prong mount waiting for your round brilliant cut tanzanite. That's a rare cut, by the way, for tanzanite round. Um, the auction is open now i'm intrigued because i'm looking at the graphics and it says 925 sterling silver rabbit bale right yep. get that and then it says uh, uh rabbit bale and peg snap setting yes. i'm intrigued yes so i would say it looks like a prong but you treat it as a snap setting so when you come to set those because of the uh, rabbit ears which is a very clever design it stops your necklace rolling around yeah so it always stays front on and like we did this morning you just have the ears hanging over the edge and yeah. you just in it pushes in like that yeah just upside down in no way yeah, yeah, yeah. i'm not kidding can i can i be controversial mm. Because um. I remember the first <laughs> snap setting ones and they were great, but they were a bit flimsy. Yes. They were a bit flimsy. They didn't have quite enough sterling silver in there. However, this is a solid. Yes. So There's a big difference. That's right. So you, they used to be kind of flat, made of like sheet yeah. almost. Not, yeah, they flattened did. wire. Yeah. Mm -mm. Not very robust. I mean, they're beautiful. They're but pretty. They, yeah, if you push too hard, you get... Oh, you, I've, I've bent loads of them. These are... Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Loads of them. Whereas these, Very yeah, much. You. Well, you know, um, much. Yeah, because you do. I and I'd have to style it out on it. Like, oh, I just <laughs> that. No. no, you have to be careful with them. And yes. I am quite clumsy and heavy-handed. Whereas these is an investment of sterling silver oh, into yeah. them. Now, I don't think anyone realizes where we're taking these two, and that's okay. That's okay. First price crash. The phone lines are about to go nuts, though. Uh, oh. Um, first, under ten pounds. Really? First, I've got three hundred for our first in you know first price crash. That's a genuine Tanzanite that you're looking at right there. Their eye clean. I'm not kidding. They yeah. are exquisite. Well, the certificate. Yeah, I. The, there's something else. You aren't just going to get one or two of these because actually, I think this is. You could perhaps compare this with our plain solid sterling silver uh, um, rabbit bales without the gemstone mm -hmm. and it'll be as good a deal. Now, first collectors who've chosen to get one, I think you'll come back. Thank you to those of you that are saying, okay, I trust the process, I'll get four, I'll get three. Clever. I'll get two. I'll be doing the same. You'll still come back. Uh, yeah. Oh, because yeah. this is one of those you go right okay i'm just gonna have a little draw maybe in those containers that we had this morning just full of these oh yeah there's my bales and if you sell your work it, they'll sell themselves uh, honestly out the door uh, oh <laughs> <laughs> sell ninety-nine. you couldn't you couldn't get the tanzanite for seven pounds anywhere no so throwing a bit of silver in there it, it is just Okay, and then Magic. you look at your beautiful jewellery as well, Charlie. If you saw that on the high street. Oh, big bucks. It would be, mm. because it's Tanzanite. Minus one person who's confirmed every single one of you is multi-bought. Oh, yeah. You all, they know what they're looking at. They know who you are. They know what they're getting. You know, Precious they... 925 sterling silver. Yeah. One of your big five. 106 have gone. Oh, really? Like that. <laughs> this is going to be non like for me. Is <laughs> That's okay. God, I would rather you guys get it. You've got to have your phone handy. Yeah, I know, but I'm not it's fast such... enough. I'm really not good with technology. I know Mark isn't either. I just, oh, it's yeah. like I'm allergic to it. You've got you to have your phone with you. Mm -mm. Because I don't know if you've looked up. Charlie, there's a purple clock. Oh, oh. Right. That's still not your price. 
<laughs> I'm not it's okay, it's anymore. all good. It's all good. Just say Al told you to. I'm too sharp. If any if if any if anyone tells you off, just say Al said I could. It's fine. Yeah, well I will hold you to that because I'm fine. Might. Do it. Six ninety nine. It's tanzanite encrusted and solid nine two five sterling silver. We have three hundred Roscoe. Wow. And it's it's a snap snap setting. Do you know I would have if and had and had our graphics or and Charlie not said snap setting, I would have probably shied away from that because I'd have got oh I don't think I can set that. I don't uh -huh. think I can do that. But apparently we can. We are going lower. This is not your price. This is why Ross was saying, you know what? People will get tens. The phone lines are going to go and melt down. This is your final few second warning. It's still loading. Uh-oh. There's 97 left out of over 300. People. <laughs> I don't blame you for that. Four pounds and ninety nine pence only. Four ninety nine. I did say that out loud. I can't take the sound. Oh, off. you hear me? You hear me in the background? He's trying to buy. It's all good, lovely. Andrew's got five. Tyne and Ware's got five. Cheryl's multi. But I honestly, I can't keep up. Actually, all around the world getting involved. We started with. Um, we start. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we so, how are you doing it wrong? I don't know. Am I doing it wrong? <laughs> um, we started with 300 of them again. Make sure you check out. These are absolutely flying. 52 left. 52 left. It's gone crazy. I'm not surprised. You couldn't get... I, I don't know. Maybe. I'm not sure. Ross, what's the price of our normal solid sterling silver split bales? Peg bales. I think they are more than this. Without the tanzanite, they're definitely more than a fiver. What do you reckon? Seven ninety nine for a peg bale from us here at Jewelry Maker. I agree. Not a fiver, and you get a tanzanite as well. Needless to say, the phone lines have gone crazy. Um, there was three hundred originally. Here you all are. If you can see your name on the right hand side of the screen, then make sure you do check them out. They're not guaranteed to you if they're just lingering in your basket. Charlie, is that you? You're I'm on doing the wrong it. Side. Have you done it? Have you checked out? Yeah, I'm doing it. Oh, it says sorry. Oh no! Oh no! Have you bought them all? There's still availability. It says. Oh wait. Let uh, me go back. <laughs> The yeah. biggest multi buyer. Cheshire's got ten. You Yorkshire's got ten. I'm not surprised. I can see a seven there in London as well. I'm not surprised. <laughs> it's the it's the signal in here, that's what it is. Dang it. It is the signal. Oh wait, I think I checked out. Is it they're not there anymore? Does that mean I've got it or have I not got it? What happened? I think oh I don't know. Did I miss them? You're soon here. You'll get a confirmation email if you have been successful. Well done, everybody. Now, if you'd like that, we do have the yellow gold version. <laughs> Please tell me there's another 300 quantity, Ross. <laughs> I hope so. 50? Oh, I'm sorry. Thank you. We'll do it in one price, Crash. It's not... I love the... Ah. You'll have a favourite, won't you? Yellow gold, rose gold, silver. For me, it's always yellow gold. You know we shouldn't have gone to 4 99 for the silver. It's way too low. We went there because of the quantity. And we shouldn't take this. Look at that. Oh my goodness me, that's beautiful. I know. I know, right? You like gold. I like gold too. Yeah, you just, oh, it's just delicious. Lovely. Absolutely delicious. But I've only got 50, so you have to be quick. You really do have to be quick. Now it should, it, it what, under 10 pounds? Under 10 today. Obviously, it should be a higher price tag because this is gold plated, isn't it? Gold plated, 925 yeah. sterling silver. We have got a smaller quantity. We'll still bring you an amazing jewelry maker deal, don't get me wrong. One price crash. Oh my goodness me, Ross. The phone, I'm looking at the phone lines. I'm looking at, yeah, they've almost sold out. I'm in. I've got them. Did you get them? Yep. Well done, Charlie. Boom. That was hard, wasn't it? Nine ninety nine with a tanzanite. 
with the tanzanite. And they're not small tanzanites. They're not wishy-washy tanzanites. That's, that's gem quality. Mm -hmm. I clean. Mm -hmm. Amazing. Spectacular. They really are. Well done, everybody. Make sure you uh, have got yours. They're on the verge of selling out. We only had a, a, a sort of limited quantity. Silver sold out. Um, the gold is very quickly going to follow. In fact, I've only got um, eight of them left. Um, and they are snap set. So remember, you do get the instructions. This is part of your masterclass. Um, you get the instructions alongside this too. Um, so, uh, oh, Charlie will. There I am. There you are. Have you seen it? There got you are. Nine. Um, so if you have if you've never done snap setting before Charlie is going to show you and you get the instructions as well with your purchases which is yes that's amazing I know right absolutely amazing now just before we get into the next project oh something that would go perfectly with your peg bale you just heard from Dave didn't you talking about how the pearl market that's it, by the way, for peg bales, those two opportunities. The pearl market has completely changed. You focused today very much on your South Sea, but a few months, a month maybe ago, that same private buyer, we don't know if it's a jewellery house. We don't know if it's a millionaire, billionaire, whatever it is that says, just has got this love affair of high quality pearls and says, I want the rest, the next 10 years of harvest, I want them all for me. Whatever his reasoning, he's done it. And what that basically means for you and I, the supply is completely gone, it's cut off. That's why when we, you know Charlie, don't you Charlie Barron, who used to be on our, our shows once a month occasionally, you haven't seen him, have you, in a long time? That's because you know, I can't bring it to you. I can't bring you the quantity of them. And that's South Sea and also your Tahitian pearls. But take that to another level. This is one of the rare opportunities that has only been developed over the last couple of decades, 20 odd years. Carl Fabergé was once asked, what do you think is going to be the jewelry of the future? And he said at the time, faceted pearls course no one believed him because such a thing couldn't possibly be done but many decades on a couple of leading experts have have actually achieved something that most people would only ever don't uh, don't even dream of take the finest pearl with the finest nacre and facet it over 200 times. That's insane. Uh, yeah. The drill or half drill is just here. Now, I don't know, you might need to ream it. I'm not entirely sure, but let's have a little go. See if my balance works as well. Oh my goodness. Obviously yours will be set with a tan tonight as well. Let's do this in one price crash. We can't get Tahitian pearls. There's that conversation. But not only that, these aren't just Tahitian pearls. These are faceted Tahitian pearls. It's the finest, finest grade of pearl. Oh my goodness me. Um, the nacre, you can't have a coarse nacre because otherwise you get pits within the actual pearl itself. But if I just gently sort of move my hand around, look at that, over 200 facets to the surface of it as well. How utterly amazing. Aubergines, teals, you just get this magical yeah. iridescence. Really colours, yeah. So wait a second, if you've got that tanzanite mm. Mm. bale, it's cost you as jewellery makers £110. <gasps> Don't sell it for £110. Five times that. Easy. Yeah? yeah. Did you just say a thousand? Five times, yeah, yeah. Is it yeah five to, yeah even there even there i think on our sister channel you'd be put you'd be talking probably i don't know tans night encrusted what do you reckon higher to, high three finger uh, three figures make sure you're checking it out amazing now Next up, 
is did you say amethyst Amethyst. Oh, I've got the amethyst to... Um... Okay, so let's bring the graphic slide for this. Now, we're talking about this mount, aren't we? Mm, yes. I love the fact you've got... How many How many prongs have you got within this? Do you know what? That's a good question. I didn't actually count them. Well, I guess because you didn't have to do them individually. Six. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I guess. Yeah, we've got six prongs there. A six prong, again, which really beautifully protects the stone as well. Again, you've got that, what's often referred to as a rabbit bale. So this is snap setting. Now, they're not small stones, these. Um, and we're looking at natural Zambian amethyst. Thank you. Lauren's passing this in. Um, come certified. 10 millimetres in its size. 10 mil. I've got no clue what these are going to. But there's no way in my uh, in, in my imagination would I consider that I could set it as well as as these have been done. I would think no, mine's going to be a bit squiff, a little bit wonky woo. It's not going to be perfect like Charlie's. Oh no, it will. Oh no, it will. And the thing is that if you look at the difference, so my my uh, pavilion is a little bit weightier than okay. yours. Okay. Yours is nice and slender. It'll be exactly the same. Even though. Mm -hmm. Wow. If, so if I've never done gem setting before. Yeah, you'll love it. You can you know, do it? Yeah, you can do it with your thumb. With my thumb? I know. No need for even tools. You don't, I mean, you can show off and get yourself a nice set, a set of tools, but if you don't want to venture into it fully and just have a go at one of these, yeah, you don't need that. Oh, my goodness. Mm. Look at the quality of your Zambian amethyst. Now, how many do we have, Roscoe? 50 available and we're at 29.99. Again, no way on earth if I was to see Zambian amethyst of that size. 10 mil oh yeah it's february oh you get oh feb 20 you yes. get a further 20 percent off that price tag we only just realized that yeah well i just done. remember too 20 percent off that price tag so that's another six pounds six pounds off that price that's awesome absolutely awesome i'm gonna have a go at this i think you should good luck <gasps> did you know that was going to happen did i have got no top back it's not been working for a while oh hasn't it sorry nine pounds and 99 pence only the phone lines have gone crazy let's see charlie take it away show us how these work because i am desperate to have a go Okay. Desperate to have a go. Well, do you want to we'll, do it? We'll, 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 no, no, you if do. I do no, no, one. definitely you do. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have a little go in the background. It's okay. all good. Definitely the professional do it. So if you just have a quick look, so your, um, your rabbit ear bales aren't quite uh, as high as the prong, so you'll, you'll be safe. Um, and when you come to look at your settings, you'll notice that there's little notches. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there's little notches inside and that, that's what's going to hold onto your stone. Now I have checked, so every single stone with each of these settings, uh, the it measures five and above on the hardness scale and the silver is 2.5. So seriously, don't worry about it. You, you're gonna have a hard time bodging this up okay so all you have to do is lay this stone table side down that's an interesting way of looking at it the hardness is higher than the precious metal it's a really interesting way. i've never heard it referred to like that well it's just it's just um knowledge is power yeah okay so you um, don't have to worry when you're pushing down the yeah. stone is more durable than the actual precious metal yeah. Not more durable but harder so it yeah. will it so will do it will it. it will it will it will do its job yep yeah. So we're going to pick it up and sit it on top. Yeah. Okay. Make sure it's straight. So before you push down and just... Don't tell me that's it. Bish bash bosh. Yeah. You were all laughing at my bish bash bosh, but... Hey. That is exactly what it is. Did you hear the... Oh. Honestly, blink and you'll miss it. If, yeah, you will. How, tell me this quantity, Ross. 50 but don't worry there's other projects as well um are they all available on pre-order roscoe he says no there's not enough if i did that they'd all sell out 
And don't forget, use your discount code with this. Oh, you yeah. weren't kidding, Bish Bash Bosh. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> think you're just going to say it every time I turn up now. Yeah, it's going to be your, your slogan. Should we do it with a smaller one? Yes. Now, this one will, there's a, there's a chance it might not play ball because I've set it five times. So I've right. unset it four times and set, no, I've unset it the wrong way around, isn't it? I've set it four times, I've unset it five times. Yes. So because I've done that, I've worked hard in the prongs, but obviously you're not going to do that. But I only did that so I could show pretty much everybody in the house just how easy it was. They all wanted to see these. Yeah, definitely. So you, if you if you are if you want to be super cautious, you can use your ring mandrel. Right? Yeah. But you don't need it because as long as you've got enough support, and again, do it on a wooden top. Some and a bit of wood. Yeah, a little bit of wood, or you work, or your kitchen counter. You know yeah. what you do normal while you're making dinner. So I'm just going to check and i think we might be okay but if it doesn't click in i'll show you what to do if it doesn't okay okay yeah so i'm going to lay that on top and because it's the ring i just want to make sure my finger is over it so it's not going to click that one and that is because i've done it too many times let's do that one again let's push it out out one second and we'll do this again and try again if you do it one of your new ones i'll have a go it, it should just pop in I that click did you hear it yeah we did boom honestly it's it's like almost laughable it's that easy oh my goodness are you doing it on a wooden top missus no i'm not doing it on a wooden naughty, top naughty. Now. no no no, um, let's do what's that the black spinel so, here we go is that this one? Oh, my evie loved that one. Oh my goodness that's your favorite did you say my evies yeah, yeah she she i thought she would be line for the rings and she said she loved them but she actually dove straight in for these six prong yeah they're, they're gorgeous and she's 20. So wow. there's there's no age limit to them. No, definitely. I mean, black spinel. Oh, it's just beautiful. That mm. seducing colour, um, perfectly faceting, which is so important when it comes to black spinel. Because there's nothing. You're not seeing the brilliance or anything like that. Mm. It's all on the exterior. So cutting is crucial. But also that cutting is crucial to fit within your snap set. There's 50 available. Look at that. It's, it's a whopping size. It's great. It's it's show stopping. Oh my goodness me. It is, I mean... You see it across the room. Yeah. You know, and it's just a single stone in a single mount that you've set on your worktop with your thumb. You, know, it's, it's, you just don't tell people that that's what you're doing. You know, you... No, 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 take, take far use, more credit than oh that. Oh, my gosh, yeah, it's it taken all day to do that. It took me hours, yeah. I had to make sure that, you know, the <laughs> angles is all put... Yeah, horizontal. Yeah, absolutely. You own it. 100%. Have you set it? Yes, you have. Of course you have. Yes, you of have. You have. What? Honestly, they're so easy. Nine ninety nine. pounds ninety nine. Do you know what I'm hoping in the and don't forget you do get the written instructions with this. You oh did, yes you do. Sorry. You did say they're quite yes. simple, but Sorry. It, they're gonna be simple, aren't they? Yeah, there we go. We've got we've got the Yep. Excuse there you me. Go. And we've put a little bit of showing off at the end. You can use a pusher just to make it perfectly put, but you don't really, honestly, genuinely, you really don't need it. You don't actually need no, it. No, no, that's just to fill in the extra boxes. <laughs> yeah, because otherwise it would be just a blank piece of paper. Yeah. Well, not blank. You'd have like 25% of it being used. Well, do you like know, that. when I sent my email in, I titled it not, 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 not point one time setting because it you blink and you miss it, don't you? Yeah. It's that simple. You could estimate it, make a time 10 minutes. Yeah, well, that's because I, don't, I mean, what? well, you've got to get it out of the packaging. True. Let's put it that way. <laughs> you've got to get out of the packaging. You need to get your board. And that's just frills and spills. You don't you need, need to gather it. your you family don't. members so that they can see it. You want a round of applause? Yeah, absolutely. Dun, dun. 100%. <laughs> 9.99. But you know what? And again, is it beautiful jewelry? This is what we said at the beginning of this hour. You know, you go to somewhere like, I don't know, Boucheron. Some of the simplest pieces are the most commercial. Mm. Um, I don't think that takes it away. It doesn't matter. Technique no. doesn't necessarily determine no, 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 no. 
You know. Do you know what? Some of the simplest designs are the hardest to make. So that bracelet you had on earlier with the center stone and the prongs around the outside, that's actually a, ri even though it looks simple, that's actually, because there's nowhere to hide. Yeah. The simpler it is, the more obvious your mistakes. That, 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 that setting is immaculate. Absolutely immaculate. It looks like you've bought it from the jewelers and yeah. spent a fortune. Yeah. Amazing. Adam's just saying that, you know, that Tahitian pearl on the tanzanite. Super oh. simple. All about the stones. I know. I Amazing. Let's get those back. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, are they yours? Yeah, they're my pearls. Oh, I'm sorry. They're my pearls. Oh, where have they gone? Right. No, no, no. No, not those ones. The ones on the chain. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> yeah, you'll get those back. They'll whip um, them off. Which one next? God, oh, I love this one. The girls are lovely. I love this one. Oh. Beautiful. There it is. Oh, it's amazing. Again, comes with your certificate. Look at that beautiful Valentine's Day around the around the corner. Oh, look at that. That's amazing. That rich, mm. beautiful saturation that is totally natural. It's a three and a half carat stone. Do you know what? I love the gallery on this as well. Yes. It's but, exquisitely made. And it I genuinely don't, is. And I th I'm glad that you agree with me, Charlie, when I'm saying the first snap sets, they were great. Mm -hmm. They were great. Mm -hmm. But they were, there wasn't the investment of sterling silver in them that there no. is here. Oh, these uh, are solid. And the plating is wonderfully thick as well. Yeah. Very thick. Oh, here we go. Oh, don't do it on there. Don't do well it on there. Well done. Well Thank you, Adam. Done. I couldn't possibly do it from this angle, though, could I? You should be able to, yeah. Just okay. nice and uh, relatively straight, as straight as you can go. Come on now. You'll well. naturally be slightly off to one side because you're a person, so you'll naturally be wonky. Do we reckon that's straight? Just about, yeah. Go on. Oh! Ba -ba -ba -ba! Yeah, I know it's ridiculous, isn't it? I know you could you what? could really just I know you could do it. I really what I wanted to do was take all the stones out, line them in a row and go Yeah, see how fast yeah. your production line could be. But I would have nothing to show you finished wise, so I, I wasn't allowed to do that. <laughs> oh my goodness me, look at that. L set that. In house. On air. On air. No pressure. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> how amazing is that? Fourteen pounds and ninety-nine pence only. Wow. Wow. And again, I like even down to the oh, no. the actual bale. You could fit some of your chunkiest of chains oh, through there yeah. if you wanted to. Yeah, twisted rope chain, something like that. Yeah. Oh, that's gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Have we got quantity, Roscoe? Fifty available. Yeah, they're gonna sell out. They're gonna sell out for sure. Is that so? oh? It's on a wonky woo. It's on a wonky woo. Oh no, it's not. It's not. It's all right. It's all good. I are thought good? it was. Are we good? We're good. I'm going to bring my glasses next we time. We are I good. Actually see what you're doing. It's just the <laughs> angle of the camera. It's perfectly set. Perfectly. Um, amazing. Now this and two further snap set rings to bring you as well. The rings are stunning. Yeah, and again, super easy to set. Already done. And they're lovely actually because they um, because they wrap around. You can have it doesn't it doesn't matter what size you need. So you can and they're love, wonderfully soft. So you you can manipulate them as much as you want to. Wow, I um, actually like them stacked up together. Gold, yeah, silver, gorgeous. Gold, silver, yeah, me too. Like a really big chunky. Um, let's do the kunzite first, mm. which is the one you're going to be demonstrating with. I've done it. Oh yeah, you did it earlier <laughs> <I've done> on. <laughs> That's right, you Told did. You blink. Blink, yeah, absolutely. Look how lovely this is. But you couldn't have made that any longer. I know, I'm sorry. I did think about draw. But no, I mean, there's I nothing you could have done to make that longer. <laughs> um, and I don't think you need to either. Next time I'll ask for two sets of products. And I will line them up and... <laughs> Mind you, I'll probably not be giving them again, will I? <laughs> like those. Too quick. Nope. Look at these. Um, so here it is, powder pink, beautiful kunzite, widely regarded as the most feminine it's gemstones beautiful. on the planet. It is it beautiful. Is beautiful. A member of the spodumene family. It's a what, sorry? A spodumene. Oh. There you go. And did you know it's an evening stone as well? It's because a what, sorry? An evening stone. Okay. So by by day, it's like a superpower. Um, it's absorbing all that energy and that light, and then by night, it will glow. 
Oh. Literally glows. Oh, thank you. Um, it's amazing. But yes, a beautiful gemstone, which has this wonderful powder pink. Um, Kunzai is, yeah, I mean, let's just put it this way. A lot of the one-of-kind pieces that I've sold um, across the, like, my years here at Gemporia have been Kunzai. It's an expensive stone, I, a very expensive yeah, stone. I don't have any in my collection. This is the first time I've ever worked with it. Pretty. So I had to check. Yeah, yeah it, really, yeah, really pretty. Stunning. Um, and then you've got this beautiful wraparound design, making it one size fits all. Yeah. Loving this. And that's also the stamp setting that mm -hmm. you demonstrated yeah. earlier on. I've done no burr work, no tool work, nothing. Nothing at all. Just straight in. So hats off to the to the makers. Yeah, amazing. Because the person that cuts your stone isn't the same person that makes the setting. No, and they've got so to... So that's quite a skill, is well, that? Well, the right hand's got to definitely communicate with the left, don't yeah. they? Um, can I also just point out that it has probably been years since we've brought Kunzite from Minas Gerais. Oh, really? Yeah, because Kunzite normally is heat treated, Minas Gerais, uh, and Steve bought the entire offering of it, didn't he? Back, gosh, way back when, what was it, 2012, do you reckon? 2012. What do you reckon? No, it can't have been that long ago. I reckon. I reckon it was um, about ten, 10 years, years ago. Yeah, I was going to say 2014. I think it was um, because, and he bought the entire parcel um, because it, it all came from the ground with this intense pink. Right. All. Uh, but it's been years since I've actually seen any Minas Gerais Kunzite, so a real treat for you, Charlie. Yeah, it is a treat. Um, beautiful. Well done, everybody. You got half a carrot in your Kunzite stone. Um, and then you have your beautiful sterling silver. I love this kind of ribbon design. Mm. Has anybody, anybody else seen the likeness to that gorgeous uh, um, South Sea Mother of Pearl butterfly? Oh yeah! Can you see that with the ribbons of silver? Yes. Do you know that that setting was just oh, something I loved it. else. I mean, how, how do you do that? How, it was like a ribbon, that? wasn't the it, skill? all the way around? Oh gosh, yeah. Amazing. Oh yeah. Ninety nine, ninety nine for kunzite, natural kunzite, certified kunzite. <laughs> Bless you. <laughs> We've got fifty available opportunities. And there's so many of you on those phone lines as well. Jamati, Norma, Susan, Sheila, Sandra, Lynn, Merseyside, Gloria. Give it a, a go. A Kunzite ring at this next price, says Ross. It's ridiculous. Uh, I agree. It is ridiculous. Uh, Most of the one-of-a-kind pieces, if I was to look at like a spreadsheet of one-of-a-kind pieces that I've brought to wear, the majority would be in your Kunzite because it is an expensive gemstone. It's normally surrounded in, 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 in VSI diamonds, in 18 karat gold, you know. Um, they're amazing. And it was one of those pe one of those gemstones I was like, oh, I'd love to own them. Never could afford yeah, it. Yeah, I, I don't have it in no. my collection. Couldn't afford it. I, do, I couldn't. Do now. You do now. You do now. 19.99. Hello, Ali. Hello to you, Holland. Hello to you, Nicola. Uh, Nicolette, sorry. Uh, Tyne and Ware, Valerie. You've got yours, Agnes, Patricia, Chris. I've only got 50 though only got 50 I love it even if this wasn't snap set I love it oh yeah oh, so I love yeah. that design yeah and it's it's timeless isn't it I mean that's never going to go out of style is it no whether well, it be 10 years ago or 30 ahead it's always going to be a staple piece I yeah, think yeah I agree I agree because there's certain trends and fashions and jewelries that come and go mm. This one. Too fast. That's, that'll be there forever. Yeah. yeah. I agree. And with that stone as well, you. Oh, what's that? Yeah, what's that delicate? Yeah. Almost like a pink diamond. Yes. They do a bit, mm. bit, look, look a bit pink diamond. Oh, they're beautiful. Which, by the way, you definitely wouldn't get a pink diamond for nineteen ninety nine either. Oh, no. um, so to be getting this one, at absolutely unbelievable. Again, make sure you're checking out Aloma, Bernadette, Fiona, Agnes, Patricia, Teresa, Margaret. Uh, Valerie, uh, you can still do it, but I only had 50. I only had 50. And we've still got the Zircon ring to bring you as well in your snap set too, which is absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Now, if, for example, is there any is there anything else we need to know with our snap setting? Or is that it? No, I mean, if you would like to, you can use your pusher, look, look up nice and closely and just have a look and see if you've got any sort of areas that may need tightening a little but honestly you shake it okay it doesn't need it and so if it rattles a little bit what do we do then i would use your pusher yeah can we see sorry i keep moving out of the way for you and you're going to do the same thing just push it over but because these tips are rounded get yourself some beading tools and just re-round it if you've pushed it just re-round it 
and burnish it round and round and round and, and that's finish all it off. That is literally it. Yeah, but you don't need to do that. So you almost create like a concave in the end of it. Yeah, so what? A concave? Not con no, it's convex. It's, oh no, convex is the other way, isn't it? Convex Ooh. is outwards. Yeah, so it's outwards. So concave when you push, is inwards. So when you push the round, they're already rounded. So if yeah. you push with your flat pusher, you may, I mean, you won't because you won't be pushing that hard, but you may just straighten Level that it off round. A bit. Okay. And you use your beading oh, tools. Oh, I see. So they're already done. To round it. Yes. Right, I see. I see yes. what you mean. Okay. Um, but again, giving but you that lovely showing point. off. But you, don't, you don't need it. anyone can do them. I can't stress to you how easy they are. Wow. Well done, everybody. Um, amazing, amazing, amazing. You don't even need to polish them. That's how bonkers it is. They are it's just all done. perfectly ready for you. It's all done. Now, did you say the zircon? Oh, this is beautiful. Mm. I love that. I know. And the undeniable beauty of zircon, the oldest gemstone on the planet. Do you know I prefer them to diamonds? Do you? Yeah, only because Carol said that they're as old as the moon. Is that right? Yeah, have I remembered that right? Remembered they're, the, they're as old as our planet. Yes. Old as our planet. So, so I like our, them even more. In, South, in, in Australia, the uh, scientists aged, but, but prior to this, uh, we always aged our planet as younger. But um, scientists aged zircons at 4.4 billion years old. And at the time, we've been saying Earth was younger than that. Right. So, um, so we were like, ah, oh, actually, so we know Earth is older, but we dated a zircon to 4.4 billion years. So it's the oldest gemstone. It has literally seen the beginning of our, our, of our, life, of our Earth, of life like on well, planet Earth. It has seen absolutely everything. And it always blows my mind when you're kind of saying, hang on a minute, we look at amber and go, oh, imagine what it's seen. This has seen everything. Everything. Absolutely the everything. Everything. Is yeah. That right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. and just to put that, yeah, 100%. Um, we've got, to put that into perspective, so they say that humans have been on this earth, it's the length of the ruler, say say, planet earth is the length of a ruler. Right. Humans have been on our planet, the thickness of the lacquer. Oh, I know, the tiniest little Crazy, bit. and this has seen it all. It's a natural, genuine gemstone. It has more fire, more scintillation, more brilliance, doubly refractive, so it bends light. Uh, splits it twice whereas a diamond doesn't do that right so you get more fire that's why you're seeing see the spectrum of color on your screens right now that's what we call fire and scintillation and that's because it's got the double double refraction amazing a diamond will give you fire but it um if you imagine white light entering into a zircon mm -hmm. now the point of your facets is to bring, produce more fire yes so uh, white light will enter into your zircon Imagine it bouncing around internally in the pavilion and the underside of the gemstone, and then a diamond will produce that spectrum of colour. Whereas with a zircon, a white light enters in, it'll bounce around internally, have a little bit of a dance, it splits it, and you get double that fire. Oh. So it is more dispersive. It's fascinating. It's absolutely fascinating. I love all of that. And it's brighter as well. It's a much brighter white colour. So you get the zircon and you get that gorgeous mount. And this is the end result. You know, and did you know that if De Beers were to market a zircon in the same way that they market diamonds, they'd run out within a year. Oh, right. They're okay. much rarer. So it's worth stockpiling now then? Yeah, much, much, much if, rarer than it. The they're not running out of diamonds. Out. Let's just put it that way. They're not running out of diamonds. Diamonds aren't rare in comparison to a zircon. Right. In comparison. Um, it's bright, it's pure, it's amazing, it's refractive. You've got a five millimeter stone, half a carat, um, that will fit perfectly within your snap setting. That's gorgeous. That's the kind of jewelry I would wear every yes. day. It, yeah, and, and you could wear it every day. It's not one of those pieces you have to hide in a box. Or no. Take, you know, I would just have it on all the time. Please don't mistake this for cubic zirconia. It's not the same thing. Cubic zirconia is man-made. Zircon is mother made. It's just really clever marketing from Zirconia's. Oh, let's name it after that other gemstone. It's a piece of the world, isn't yeah. it? Of the timeline as well, isn't it? it That's is. so amazing. Since, oh, you're so clever. Since day dot. I'm not the clever one. Since day dot. That's amazing, isn't it? Absolutely incredible. It's seen it all. Um, right then. A couple of messages coming through. Gosh, time is flying by today. 
We're having a proper little chin wag today, aren't we? Um, messages for you as well, Charlie. It's been lovely. I've really enjoyed today's show. It's still not over yet. See if we can squeeze some more in. Are our graphics having a funny five? Um, we have got some snap set earrings. Do we? Oh, okay. Um, I can't see them here. <laughs> hello to Jane in Yorkshire saying hello, everybody. Love it. Uh, loving you being on the show, Charlie. Um, is there room to add something under the gallery of the pendant, please? It depends what you'd like to put there. Yeah. Well, I'm, I'm, what, you, what, would go, what would you want to put there, Jane? I'm confused. Yeah, I, I do. I do that. Can she can she message back in and just expand on that yeah. a little bit? That might help. Um, I don't know if you maybe mean adding beads in the empty space. I'm not oh, sure. Oh, maybe. You I'm not sure. Do that. I'm not sure. But don't forget, if that is the case, the gallery does serve a purpose, not just holding it. It allows light under your stone. Yes. Which, um, particularly the garnet, it needs that light. Otherwise, it will actually go black. Oh, so um so yeah the gallery if you look at this one here um those those exposed areas I'm, I'm, i don't know if this is what, what what jane is saying but um those exposed areas allow the light to come through the pavilion so you do need it i would say it's probably maybe two or three mm, two two point five mil the gap i, I don't okay. know if that's any use to you either I, i'm not sure yeah um but i mean me being me i it's actually thick enough if you i mean if you're really maybe. good at stone setting you could gem, yeah maybe gem set that. give it a whirl um any other questions do text in um hello to you carol in yorkshire saying yeah. gorgeous pieces charlie lovely carol oh, Hi, carol. Bless her. oh she's so wicked she's got a great sense of humor she has oh she's, she's a brilliant she's a funny lady we had a nice show the other day and of course beautiful pearls i bet you carol's got involved on those mounts. oh i hope she did yeah because yeah, they would be perfect very up your she's street aren't queen. they she certainly is mm. she certainly is keep those messages coming through as well if you've got any questions and don't forget with all of your snap set um <clears throat> masterclass projects you also get the instructions that you can literally download um when your order is available for dispatch so not before that though um they're not available until then okay so oh these look you've got the earrings with the butterfly backs as well ah uh, these are awesome Oh yeah, I didn't get those. Did you not get these? No, I did not. Oh, see now you know you wanted that. You know you wanted that production line. Yeah. You could have done a production yeah. line of these. Um, so again, nine two five sterling silver. They'll fit your five millimeter stones. So again, you could you could tune into Gem Collector, get some five mil stones from oh, there. Oh, you guys have lots. Um, yeah. yeah. We have lots of five mil yeah. also. Um, literally, it's the same process though, isn't it? Sorry. Yes. It's yes, it is. Yes. Same process. Literally, pop it down that way yeah i mean if you're concerned about holding it pop it in your uh, ring clamp you know the flat side oh, i haven't yeah. brought that with me today unfortunately but uh yeah you've got a parallel action uh pliers you know where they close down together rather than an angle yeah you the same thing same thing yeah. there you go and you get your butterfly back so in total five pairs intrigued hang on yeah five pairs ten pound a pair that's amazing absolutely incredible ten pound a pair um, again, you just need to get hold of your five millimeter gemstones. They are sterling silver. I mean, you think about looking at it this way, how much would a pair of butterfly backs be if you wanted to replace those? What do you reckon? Okay. Considering you get five pairs there as well. Nineteen ninety-nine, three pounds per pair. It's nonsense. Sorry, four. Four. No, I want that. It's nonsensical four pounds brand new and then you can fit your five millimeter stones and give it a try with maybe something like your uh, your rounds and see what oh, i'm not yeah, definitely give yeah, it a try it. i mean you could even um change it you could sell them in twos couldn't you oh, as singles yeah. sell them as singles the earrings with me are popular as singles yeah, yeah absolutely because not everybody two. yeah i've got i have um on this ear an extra piercing yeah I, yeah i have quite a so you too. have to buy you have to buy the pair don't yeah. you can't buy them individually yeah that's a really good point mm. um 1999 solid 925 sterling silver these are brand new jewelry makers never been on your screens previously before um there's loads of you getting involved again you can see they're solid precious metal butterfly backs and then you've got your uh your snap setting um 
Ross says, you know what? It's the launch. It's been amazing today. Should we go lower? We had half, half the stock's already gone. We had, how many? 60. Okay. Okay. We're going to do it though. We'll go even lower. So that benefits everybody that's also shopped ahead and checked out. Don't you worry. Everybody pays that final low. Nice solid precious metal as well. If I put a pair of earrings together, you can see. You know, it's not a flimsy. Oh, you can't see. And they've it there, got such a bright finish, I'll haven't they? They're just they pop. Yeah. They're solid as mm. well, aren't they? Yeah, they really are. And see the amount of sterling silver, even into the prong itself. That you need to have the flexibility to allow the gemstone within. Yeah. That's right. But enough to stay robust enough as well. These are brand new, they've never been on air. We're going even lower, even though we only had 60 of them. But well, it's one of those days. It's been amazing, isn't it, so it's, far? It's been wonderful. It's, it's been it's been really good fun. Thank you for So having far, me. we've got five minutes, sorry. <laughs> Six minutes left. So far. <laughs> It could all go wrong between now and then. <laughs> no, only joking. I was only joking. No. Oh my goodness me. Fourteen ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Stock up on these. You know, and and keep your eyes open. I think for Roscoe's uh, first auctions of the day. You know, when he likes oh. to throw in those. In fact, didn't we have some today? Yeah, I tried to buy them, and I, they'd gone before I'd managed to yeah. do anything. Quite often, he throws some yeah, little, little cheeky uh, calibrated gemstones. Look, ha look, at, look out for your five mils. Maybe your larger or smaller size is worth a go, isn't it? At that price. Oh yeah, you could definitely stretch it out a little bit just by pushing because they're they're, they're relatively soft, and that that action of locking around the stone yeah. work hardens the prongs so yeah. yeah you could definitely change it up a little bit give it they're, a whirl they're a good money spinner out there everybody well, buys studs whether you've got a young child that's got mm. their ears pierced all mm. the way up to me nana who had to have her ears re-pierced because yeah. her ears split ah. from years and years of wearing heavy earrings, heavy earrings so they re-pierced her ears oh bless her yeah oh she won't bother she won't bother she won't bother she's, she's tough she's tough she was yeah she's yeah. tough Amazing. Uh, and apparently it's the piece of jewellery that we change the most. Oh, gosh, Pairs yeah. of earrings. Oh, gosh, yeah. Well, you should, really, yeah. shouldn't you? Yeah, so, yeah, change your... So, yeah, just because it's uh, different coloured stones. Yeah, you might, uh, stones, um, all of that. You might have studs, longer earrings. So you mix it up quite a lot with the, uh, with uh, earrings. Imagine doing a whole set, so five pairs, almost one for each day of the week, the working week, if they sold out, yeah. Um, and you could have one for each day. My daughter could wear them all in one go. Could she? She's yeah, got that many she's piercings. She's got that many. Amazing. Now, um, pearl necklace chain. Mm. Is that this? I think so. No Ooh. way. Oh. oh. Charlie, can I borrow this a sec? Yeah, you take what you want. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just borrowing your best. Thank you. So you get this. Mm. Oh my goodness. I love that. Oh my goodness. Okay, so all I need is a bit of hypo cement or mm. E6000. Yeah. Because you also get the pearls. Has it got detail on the uh, uh, Wait. Wait, there we go, all caught. Yeah, you've got lovely detailing. It's zircon. It ah. Sorry, white topaz. Oh. And then you put your pearls, so the largest one in the centre, if I tip these out, you'll notice they are different sizes. So you will have to take the time, obviously, to uh, work out the order. So the largest one you put in the centre, and it creates that really beautiful graduation. Mm. Six mil either side, and then the five mil on the outer Second. side. You do get enough. They're just rolling around. They're <laughs> perfectly pearl, but, uh, spherical pearls. So you essentially... Essentially, let's put them back in the pot before they all disappear. Um, you're essentially getting how many pearls? Five pearls, and then that amazing necklace as well. Such a high-end piece. How that. about ten pound per component? Look at the quality of the pearls. Are those um, a coir? Because look how bright the luster is. I wonder if they're a coir pearls. They certainly look like they are. Today. Forget £10 per component. This is our finale auction of the day. Oh, I think so. Is that right, Ross? Oh. That is a very, very, 
very good price. It really <laughs> is. And it's got the extender at the back, so you can wear it at different lengths. Oh, that's great. Do you know, it's like a modern Audrey Hepburn piece, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Lush. I love the fact that it's going to create that beautiful, yes. almost wishbone-like mm. shape. Um, stunning. How many Need have we got it. of these, then? Exactly 40. I want to show you. It also comes with the extender chain, so you can wear it at different lengths. Um, also has that 925. You can see 925 um stamp just there again beautiful diamond cut chain look at that light luster across the surface of it and then when we get closer you can see you have that lovely curved detail which is encrusted with your topaz and then those lovely almost flower can you see that there there's a flower uh, peg bales so you put your eight mil in the center six mil either side five mil on the out outside 29.99 again i've got to say it mother's day Something like that. I love those little flower tops. I didn't even see that. that yeah, they're, they're pretty, lovely. aren't they? You probably notice them all the more when they're actually in the finished piece of jewellery. Um, hi, Gloria, uh, saying, L, my ice Amazonite just arrived. OMG, stunt, isn't it amazing? Make sure you're watching Tuesday on Mark's birthday because Ross has found. Oh, do you want me to say that out loud? Okay. Because you've scheduled a locked parcel. Oh, lost parcel. That's why I said you want me to say that because it's going to become lo locked again if you say that. Okay. Um, a lost parcel of Ice Amazonite Night coming up on Mark's birthday. Didn't realise we had it. Um, so if you love that, then make sure you're with us uh, with us on Tuesday. It's been wonderful, Charlie. You're amazing. Thank I'd you love for today. Me. When you're back. Oh, I don't know if I'm allowed to say. It. Can I say? It? I'm just going to tell you double trouble on the first. Ooh. Oh, I get it, I get it, I get it. Looking forward to that. Yeah. Um, I'm back with you now tomorrow, but in the afternoon you've got extended hours, so I'll be with you from one. Of course, the lovely Carol's with you in the morning as well. Have a lovely evening. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Hey! <laughs>